Well, she called the cops on me again and nothing happened because the cop was on my side. Hey, Jessica, I would never call the cops on you for anything unless you were trying to hurt yourself or somebody else. Cop calling is such pussy shits. And it didn't work. So I don't know what your little plan was, but it didn't work. So, uh, guess what? Don't fuck with King Cobra.
fucking <laughs> high for stupid <laughs> episode. <laughs> I forgot to make it like an, in, an ending there, but yeah, we're here. It's episode 77. Josh was shredding. Oh my God, was he shredding, bro. <laughs> this was amazing. This is my favorite part by far. I, I was sitting here dying, man. <laughs> He shreds, dude. That's what Josh does. I mean, look at him wail. Like, look at that. Look at that. He's so... He's the best. He's the yeah. best. He's a hidden guitar legend that nobody knows about. And it's it's mm-hmm. a shame that all people talk about is the chronicles of him and his wench. That, that wicked Jessica. And we'll get to all that tonight. Because we got a shit ton to talk about with all these guys. Him, Jupiter, Nova, Chris Chang. Chris wasn't in the intro. We got to talk about him, too. And shit. It's going to be a good night, bro. It is. It's going to be an amazing night. I don't think we've had this much news in a very long time. We call it news, but, you know, it's just shit that happened. Um, we got Jupiter on deck. We're probably going to do Jupiter first. Then we're going to move into Nova. He's been up to a lot. Um, yeah, we forgot about Josh. Yeah. We forgot about Josh Block. <laughs> yeah, then then we'll probably move into Josh Block or Chris and then finish with Smokey. They're saying turn up. I'll turn up Smokey. No, that's me. That's me. I turned it up. No worries. Okay, bad, bad. Yeah, it's going to be a packed one, but we'll probably finish off with Josh. Uh, we're not going to be covering the, you know, the old pew-pew in the mouth because, yeah, that's even just a little low for our tastes. Uh, but we will be covering everything else because it's crazy. Mythica is gone for good. And shit's just, like, really heating up. We said it was going to be the summer of lol cows, but it seems like it might be the fall of lol cows as well. So Something you just said year, there. Something you just said there, bro. Like, do we know she's gone for good? Like, you know, I think we- so. I, I'm, I, just as someone who's watched for so long, um, and I won't digress for too long. I think this is it. I really do. I, I would like to think so, but just like last time, I don't, I can't give Josh any credit to do so. You True. know. True. I completely agree. I used to expect a lot more out of this boy, but I've constantly been disappointed and uh, dis- disproven. I've always been like, oh, you know, the boy cut him some slack for this, that, and the other, but if what she's accusing him of uh, is true, then Josh is a piece of shit, and he has been what a lot of people have been claiming him to be. And I'm not saying already that I didn't think Josh wasn't a piece of shit. There's a lot of stories, but like, I don't know. Things, especially lately, have been rough. Like, between Puff and uh, oh, Jessica God, yeah. claiming that she choked him a whole bunch. Like, I look at my bearded dragon and I think of Puff and I'm like, what a horrible, horrible fucking existence. What a, what, not only like a horrible way to die, but a horrible existence as well. And just other shit too, dude. It's a shame. I really used to think that Josh was like one of the people I could be like, oh, you know. No, it is a shame. It absolutely is. The more and more time goes on, the more and more I'm seeing Josh. Yeah. Like he's exhibiting these these weirdo traits, and obviously mm-hmm. he's never been like the <laughs> like Josh was always kind of a strange guy, you know. But now more and more this Jessica shit, right? Like she's unbearable and all that. But some of the stuff she's claiming and some of the stuff we see in that video, it's just it's pretty fucking far out. It is. Uh, it yeah, is. and can can we and to get onto a lighter topic from this, I, I don't really know another like segue to get off of talking about this. Uh, Nova's in chat. Nova, Jupiter's back, and he wants to fucking kick your ass. So like, you need yeah. to figure that out. Just saying. He took it. I feel like this is the perfect segue. Aside from all, see, Jupiter is back. He's posted a whole bunch of videos, and he's been calling people out. One of the deleted ones was of Nova. And Jupiter is just calling him a bitch, a pussy, a chomo. Yeah. Um, an age regressing freak who wears a diaper and shits himself. Like all this, all this like stuff, all this horrible like, stuff. Yeah. Uh, and and he it's even the said, cigarettes. It's the cigarettes doing it. doing it to him. And he said something in there that I thought was really important to let the chat know because Jupiter did. How do I. <laughs> He deleted a lot of these videos, and let me tell you, I managed to catch one of them, and we are going to play it here. I just posted it on Twitter about, like, ten minutes ago. Uh, this is a real thing, too. He, I don't know why he deleted all these, um, but one of them he posted, um, he was singing. He was, like, uh, I, I made it in my video yesterday. He was singing along to some song he liked for, like, five minutes. Then it was a bunch of him, like, in his uh, his screenshot pictures of him as dragons and shit. And then it was mm-hmm. this video here where he just talks and talks and talks for ten minutes. Uh, yeah, so he's he's got a lot to say, and apparently, <laughs> apparently he doesn't want to be called Jupiter anymore. 
he wants to be known now as Dark Nova. And I was like, that's Whoa. crazy. Dark Nova. He wants to take Nova's name, but like, I think I think I might just start calling him Dark Nova because that's what Jupiter's yeah. saying. I think uh, I think that's a great point. Wow, it just seems like a lot of uh, a lot of shits being talked on. I almost dead named him on Nova. Light Nova. And it, yeah, on Light Nova, not Dark Nova, or is this a Liquid Nova? I don't know, or Venom Nova. I don't know. No, very th- many like. You see, I think this. Nova, yeah. I think this is more of a Jack and Daxter thing rather than a Metal mm-hmm. Gear Solid thing. No, so, no, I think yeah. you're right. I just feel like if we call him Dark Nova, because because Nova's like a reformed uh, neo-Nazi, from what I've seen uh, based off his Instagram and stuff, he's here. He can tell us all. Yeah, about and Jupiter's it. totally not racist. That's where it's yeah. like different between them. Well, it's just if you're gonna call him Dark Nova, I feel like it's gonna enrage him even more. So we're really not helping him when it comes to trying to uh, move past his neo-Nazi-ism. Well, that's Nova's problem, not Dark Nova's yeah, problem. Yeah, no, you're completely but Dark right. Dark Nova posted right. this video, and he's talking for 10 minutes where he calls out his little sister, he calls out new trolls he's dealing with, he calls out the entire internet again, and he tells them that he's a changed man, chat. Like, again, the same shit he said on the interview, the same interview where he admitted he was, like, having a 15-year-old girlfriend. <laughs> this guy... Yeah. Now he's changed yet again, he says, but, I mean, he's a fucking menace. This guy, he needs to be behind bars, and it's ridiculous that he keeps making TikTok accounts. When he when he says he's a changed man, it's one of the funniest things that he can say, because we were talking to him that one week, and uh, I think it was like a half hour after it had been exposed that he had a 15-year-old girlfriend, or it was during that stream that it was exposed, and he was like, yeah, but I've changed. <laughs> okay. I don't know. It's At some like, point, <laughs> you're, you're going to crack up. At some point in this video, he's like, I've changed a lot over the year, days. <laughs> he goes from years to days because he realizes, like, fuck. Like, all right, well, it wasn't even a year ago that I did that fucked up shit. So it's got to be a few days that I've changed. This video is so stupid, bro. But it's one of those ones that Jupiter was like, let me sit here and let me steam a couple cigs and let me just, just set the record straight for the internet. And yet he again, he just made. He makes an ass out of himself. He was blaming this all on cigarettes just a couple months ago, and now he's fucking smoking cigarettes and talking about how he's changed. Like, I don't think he gets what, that for the too. worse. He don't. Oh, he doesn't man. get the him saying that. Oh, I blamed on the nicotine. I was high on nicotine, and then constantly smoking cigs and like hitting his vape doesn't look good. Like Dude. if you're claiming that nicotine makes you do this, and then you're just just chiefing down on all the nicotine you can get your hands on. Sorry, but, like, <laughs> you're going against your own claims there. You look like you're more of a pedophile by doing that. Did you see him try to use that arc lighter, and he expects it to, like, shoot up like a regular lighter? And then he oh, I thought he was afraid of... Up. I thought he was afraid... Yeah, he was afraid of the little <laughs> laser in it. He was like, those yeah. coils are scary, bro. I can't do that. I yeah, think no, he thought that, was... that it was going to be demonic, and it'd shoot all the way up. And light his cigarette with lightning, like Darth Sidious... <laughs> I don't know what he thought, but those, <laughs> them things suck. I don't, yeah. I don't like them. Yeah, lighters, they do bro. suck. I used to try to light my joints with them, and it's just they, never the works. Worst. No, never works. No, you can, and it, it was probably stupider for doing it with a joint because you can't even get an even light on a cigarette with them motherfuckers sometimes. But, I but he thought he was gonna get one here, and the only mm-hmm. thing he got. The only thing, he, well, I don't know what Jupiter got, but I know what he's going to get. He's just going to get his ass run off the internet again when <laughs> enough people figure out what his TikTok is. And spoiler alert, ladies and gentlemen, it's Jupiter Pennell. That's yeah. the name of his TikTok account. Big shocker. Your heads. I'm different now. Oh, oh fuck, yeah. Today. <laughs> versus back then so real quick i just want to let people know there is music that he has to of course have playing in this but around the four minute mark it it stops so then you finally don't have to deal with it my voice just completely (laughs) fucked out there bro i'm (laughs) smoking way too much i'll get it i have changed over the years i've changed and i've learned my ways around the world so, stop trying to make me into a monster. And you all know you're the ones who are behind all this. Um, excuse me, sir, could I have a pack of Marlboro Reds? Uh, preferably a soft pack? Um, yeah. They, the, the hard packs hurt my werewolf hands. 
I'm just I'm trying to imagine what it's like being the guy that sells cigarettes to Jupiter the hybrid. <laughs> Some poor convenience worker. Jupiter just strikes me as the type of guy like, and you'll only get this sick. Like, I feel like if you're a smoker, maybe not if you know someone who is, but like you smoke your your pack. Like I smoke yeah. my Newports, right? Jupiter, he he strikes me as the type of guy that goes into a, st- a, sh- a store and he's like, yeah, like I'll just take whatever. Any pack. You can yeah, hand him a pack hand of Cheyennes. Just cigarettes. Yeah, you can hand him a pack of Cheyennes and charge the same price for a pack of Newports and he wouldn't bat an eye. He just wants to have something to look cool. He yeah. thinks he looks cool as shit. Absolutely. And I feel like I was about to say but he looks like a douchebag here. He does. You know, he <laughs> smoking his cigarette like this, he looks like a typical frat boy douchebag. You wouldn't think that he's like a regarded predator. My favorite thing is I kept putting it in the intro. He'll take these like huge hits. He'll be like, <sighs> and then he'll just have this little puff of smoke <sighs> come out. And it's just the fucking like, he, I don't know what he's doing with the rest of that smoke, but there's, there's nothing coming out. Like, <laughs> you want to see a monster? The monster needs take his, his cut of the cigarette. He's been ruining her, her older brother's life for the past, I don't know, year and a half. Kayla, I'm speaking directly to you if you see these. I fucking hate your guts. And I wish you would just disappear. But you're my family, so I can't say those things to you. You just yeah, did! I, you just did it publicly! <laughs> what do you mean? You just said, yeah, little sister, you know how you're, like, going out there and talking to people and knowing them that I'm a creep and I assaulted you when we were younger and that, like, all this other shit? Well, I hope you mm-hmm. straight up disappear. But, yeah. but, Kiwi, but, I can't say that. I can't say that, especially in a public setting. No, for real. It'd be like at you're at Thanksgiving dinner. You're like, hey, little sister, uh... I fucking hate your guts, but I can't say that here at the Thanksgiving dinner table. (laughs) I don't know. His logic has always been so flawed, but the reason why he hates his little sister is because him and Duke have gotten in trouble. Um, Rightly so, too. They're both sick fucking freaks, but he resents her for it. You see how he like props Duke up on a pedestal? (laughs) He he loves Duke. Detests her. Oh, my God. You would think fucking Duke invented penicillin or some shit like crazy with how highly that Jupiter speaks of him. And no, he's a convicted sex offender. <laughs> Meanwhile, his sister, who's just a victim in all of this, I fucking hate your guts. Like, I don't know. I, don't, I shouldn't have expected more from uh he should treat his guy. brother more like boss man jack does he should come on stream and be mm-hmm. like my brother i beat that pedophile's ass last night bro just, yeah, just for, for being a pedophile like he should he should come on here and just say that he knocked duke out cold and fucking duke's a rat and a son of a bitch and when duke's over to visit all i do is gamble i don't even go visit him <laughs> <laughs> But those are the things I think towards you sometimes. Is boss man the hybrid? What an did interesting you, combination that would be. Do you imagine him at like a Thanksgiving dinner, like giving the prayer and all, like, and gra- <laughs> thank you God, gr- thank you for keeping Grandma here no. another year. And, and Kayla, I hate, I hate your fucking guts. I hope you fucking <laughs> die. Like, <laughs> yeah, thank you, great old old Father Satan. Oh, oh Mephisto. this bountiful male, Mephisto, for blessing onto all of us magical dark powers. And may you smite down Kayla, my slut of a sister who has ruined our lives. And i sorry, I should not be saying that to you, Satan. Like, it'd be some shit like that, dude. This guy, he needs to give grace. And he it's just, it's, it's important to remember, again, he's saying all this about his sister who just came out and talked yes. about how, like, how weird this guy is. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> he just sees it as such a great offense because how dare you tell they're, people about like me they're all foster siblings they're not even all fucking related to each other right am i wrong here as far as I, they're all in a fucking foster home they're I not think blood so. related I don't, I don't know though i don't know that so, for a fact jupiter is just like out here just fucking Calling people his siblings who don't even know who the fuck he is anymore. They might as well have gone to school with him. Kiwi, Kiwi, yeah, they they may as well have. They studied fucking ninjutsu together. <laughs> and his sibs. It's like Lego ninjutsu all over again, <laughs> dude. 
He's a he's a freak. It's Jupiter. I don't know. Yeah, and we've only played one minute of this, and I, I'm, I promise you, chat. I promise you. Eventually, it does become listenable. But for right mm-hmm. now, you just got to deal with Jupiter's horrible music taste in the background. People are mad that he didn't play Skillet in the background, or like something you know, powerful. I mean, I don't, I don't expect it from him. Shame. <laughs> like, like I've never, like again, I don't, I don't consider. I don't know. I don't know. We're not going to get into this topic, but like none of these people we cover ever like have a good song in the background of their shit. Like no. Daniel Larson played his own song. Actually, Daniel Larson may have played the best song out of all these people. He did. Roaring, most, yeah, Roaring Thunder kicks, kicks all these songs' asses. I've been hearing some of, I'm doing a new King Cobra video, so I've been hearing some of his new music and it's, I saw a comment under, I think, a Boglum Chronicles video. They They described it perfectly. It's like some shit you'd hear in the middle of the night on Adult Swim. You know, it just a, a random thing. That's what his fucking music sounds like. It's so yeah, we strange. Talk, I think we talked about that last week. I said that's a perfect... Yeah. <laughs> it is really a perfect uh, description of Cobra's music. It's crazy. But back to this crew. You may be my little sister, but it's... It's hard when you treat me like I'm some sort of animal, you know? <laughs> Kayla, you're my little sister. I love you so much, but... I give very little in return because you and I have been mortal enemies since day one. You may be my baby sister, but God give me strength to say this. You are a pain in my ass. Give me the strength to say this, God. You're a pain in my ass, Kayla. Why do you keep reporting me and Duke for the horrible (laughs) things we've done to you? Why? You pain in the ass. He makes this video so seriously, and he's like, I can't believe you've done this to me. Like, just imagine the, like, how could you, imagine being the sister and seeing this? Like, you'd be like, what the fuck? Like, it's just like, he acts like he's done nothing wrong here. It's like, just how dare you hold me accountable for shit I did in the past? Like, you, this is, this is heinous of you. Oh, this guy would have fit right in on To Catch a Predator. I mean, like, oh, you know, I mean, can I eat some pizza? He's one of those types. Uh... He reminds me the most of what, what the fuck is that guy's name? The the one who came in naked. Uh, and then they caught him again at a McDonald's. I've talked about him before. We've He's like one of the most infamous. But that's who this reminds me of. Just the way he's like, yeah, wow, this is a real pain in the ass, Chris Hansen. You know, the fact that I'm getting thrown in jail for a couple of years. Real pain in my ass. You know, I, so I can tell you exactly exactly how he'd react. He'd be like, wow, you yeah. guys are catching pedophiles? That's really noble of you. That's a really good job of you guys to be out here <laughs> cleaning up the streets and oh. making sure that there's no pedophiles going after these kids. That's really good of you. You know, yeah. good job, everybody. I want to shake all your hands. And he'd be going around trying to shake hands <laughs> with the cameraman and shit. He'd be like, all right, so yeah, Corbin, can you sit over yeah. here again? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. So what's up, friend? We're all brothers here, right? Right, brothers? Yeah. Aren't we guys? Yeah, so I just came, you know... We're all brothers. I just came here to solicit a minor. <laughs> yeah, it's John Kennelly. One of my favorite quotes from To Catch a Brother To Catch a Predator is John, we've been over this. You can't be messaging young children. And he's like, <laughs> I was just trying to get something to eat. And they're like, No, we have the chat logs right here. They're out front of a fucking McDonald's. A McDonald's, so, yes, I've seen yeah, that video. The next day, this guy gets caught by Chris Hansen before That's they had so the cops. Wild. And he comes in f- buck fucking naked into the, the catch house. And they let him loose. And the next day they catch him out front of a fucking McDonald's the second time. We're going to have to watch it sometime. They're calling him Evil Ray Absolutely Romano. no excuse for that. Dude deserves to be lined up against a wall. Yeah. But there is another oh problem God. there in the fact that he was even allowed to go. He was allowed to be out in public the day after. Like, why True. after that, after showing up naked in the fucking house, was this dude ever allowed to be out on the fucking streets? And it's I shit think, like that. It's, it's crazy. I think it was like the first run of To Catch a Predator that they had done. And really, they were just trying to raise awareness for how many fucking sickos there were out there. Fair It wasn't enough. like we're trying to get them off the street, like what it became. Yeah, I don't know the but, full story of To Catch a Predator. I just know. I'm not talking about them. Wild. I'm talking about law enforcement-wise. Like, that's no. crazy. You're right. You're right. It's It's 
honestly, that that make a good video. To catch a predator's story is fucking like nuts and how it ended. Well, yeah, Chad's saying that too. It's before they worked with the police. Yeah, I, I'll admit it. Like I said, I I do not know the history of to catch a predator. Yeah. I just when you hear something like that, it's the first thing you think of oh. is why the fuck was he even allowed to be back out in public? Absolutely. That's what I wonder about Jupiter. Like, it seems like he's in a new location too. I'm kind of wondering if he was transferred because of the fire. You know, he's been gone a while and he just pops back up. Why now? Yeah. I think he's been moved. This this looks different. You know, let's think about where he was. That backyard didn't have any fu- didn't have a fucking tree line from what I saw. It was shared with other no, it, people. It definitely had a tree. Definitely had I see okay. this is the thing. I okay. think you could be right. Uh maybe that's why he hasn't like shown anything and like shown where he's at. However, yeah. we just it's tough to know with Jupiter because I don't know if he's been at that same place and if he has, and they put up with a lot of shit. Absolutely. I mean, he's been fucking trolled by several, like, shadowy organizations, it seems, and uh, burnt a bunch of shit in their yard. I don't know how he would get away with that and not be reprimanded. He had to have had some kind of consequences. Because we haven't seen him really since the pony burnings, have we? A little bit. I'm trying to think but back. like Not all much. Of, the only, like interaction i know jupiter's had online is with like more trolls but i didn't yeah i don't i don't know if anything ever came of that i just heard he was getting trolled again true you're the biggest pain i've Maybe ever we'll had find some clues with. but i was there to help you when no one else was it's because he's middle class it's so sad. He takes advantage of Josh. It's so sad. Anyway, to the people who are making fun of me, piss off. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not doing anything to hurt anybody. I'm just here posting videos, posting my daily life. You know, routine stuff. Excuse me. Anyway, I just want you all to know that I'm sick and tired of your shit. Yeah. I'm fucking dead. No, I want to send a message to chat, too, because I'm riled up. I'm fucking sick and tired of this shit, chat. You need to shape up. You need to shape the fuck up. This is enough of this. Because the fact that... Me, uh, what the fuck did I call myself again? Alphonse and Jupiter are going through this kind of shit? It's bullshit. I will stand for it. As a paranormal investigator, won't stand for it. I just love how he starts the video by being like, you guys need to understand that I've changed. I'm not the same person I was like years ago. Yeah. But listen, I'm not going to put up with your fucking shit no more, you yeah. know? Like, I'm a changed man. I'm a good guy now. I'm I'm good guy, Joop, you know? Mm-hmm. Definitely not a pedophile over here. But, mm-hmm. like, he's... And he, he wants people to believe it's so bad, but he's done nothing. He's proved nothing. He just... Like, it's, like... Oh, my... I just... I think it's so crazy. He just makes a video like this. He's like, listen, guys, in the background of my real life, like, I've been doing so much to fix that. When really, in his background, in his real life, I don't even want to imagine the amount of, like, creepy shit he's probably been doing. This is some doctor disrespect level shit. Where he's just like, guys, I didn't do it. Like, what are you even, champs? What are you even talking about? Like, I I didn't do nothing. That's like, crazy. Fuck. What are that doctor, shit? That is so crazy that he <laughs> didn't. I. And I'm sorry. I I don't like to, but like, I'm pretty sure either one of us said that a while back, and I think it was me that said yeah, that he's gonna you. come back. He's gonna come back, and people are gonna just welcome him with open arms. Mm-hmm. And I said I was afraid that was gonna happen, and it fucking happened really easily. Uh, All he had to say was, "Hey, yeah. you know how I came out with that statement and admitted I was talking to a minor? It's just, just, just no. that didn't happen. That didn't fucking happen." But he didn't say that. Do. He didn't say that. He said he did it, but he did it to trick journalists. Like, okay, okay. Okay, it was you, full of like deceptive wording where he's like, it's "Y'all the didn't classic. even think to ask if she was underage," and I'm like, "Did that? You're saying nothing about the situation with that kind of statement. You're not he saying oh, she the, wasn't. It, it, it's bullshit." It's no, important. he hit him with the pedophile fake out, bro. He got them journalists. Oh boy, did he? Yeah. What are you? What are you a fucking kid? I'm not gonna share <laughs> screenshots where I talk <laughs> about licking this kid's feet. What are you talking about, champs? 
No way. Get out of here, fucking children. I don't doctor know. disrespects it, the worst, bro. Yeah, doctor fucking diddler. I, I don't know, dude. I, I like doctor, allegedly Doctor Chris respect. That's it's, yeah. it's, it's keep it like that. Too. Don't yeah. forget it, Doctor Chris, Chris respect. respect. Working for Mister Mister Satan Incorporated. <laughs> we haven't talked like anything about Jupiter. <laughs> no, no, we haven't. We're two minutes in. Fight with someone else. Because I'm not listening to you. I'm not listening to your bullshit. Look, ready? Watch the little bit of smoke that comes out. Yeah, look. There's, what? There's barely any Dude, smoke. Motherfucker, <laughs> mouth hits cigarettes. I he, I don't even think he inhales. I don't think I don't think he ever has. Yeah, can we can we replay that? Let's see. Mouth. No, hit. no, no. That that sneaky little bastard. No, he didn't. Oh, that that riles me up, Kiwi. Yeah. Yeah, dude, he doesn't, he's just wasting it. You're, you know, I feel like Smokey's like a, a fucking parent at the dinner table when it comes to cigarettes. You're like, you cannot waste it, you know, you better fucking clean your plate. Like, this is the way I, I look at it. Rug. This is the way I look at it, right? <laughs> like, so say you have a pack of cigarettes and you have one of them just like Jupiter does here. And it's like, hey, that cigarette, like, I think that cigarette would be really sad if you smoked it and didn't inhale it. You know, like, yeah. so could you really do that to the cigarette? Like, cause like, I don't know. Like, I think that cigarette, like you would really hurt its feelings. If Those little not. slave children didn't pick that tobacco for nothing. You better smoke that or you're, yeah. you're a waster. Yeah. No, it, it kind of like hurts my feelings. I was like, yeah. it, it's, it's just sad. It's sad. I agree. I completely, it's like the, uh, I don't know. I don't know where I'm going with this. You see, I'm unlike other people. I don't give a shit what happens to you, to you who make fun of me. I don't give a shit. Yeah, if you Mama don't eat the filter, you're a waster. One day. It'll come back and bite you. Oh, Chunk Squad, by the way, smoking does, is allowed don't here. Don't come back to me. You fucking saying, legend. You were right, you were right, I'm sorry. Don't come back to me doing that. Because all I'll do is laugh in your face and slam the door. Is he still talking about his sister? Yeah. Yeah, no, talking about the trolls, how I'll just laugh your... You know what, I'll just show you some drunken onsatsuken and reveal all my plans for grooming. And then slam the door in your face. <laughs> well, do you hear what he says? He's like, yeah, well, don't come crawling back to me. Mm -hmm. It's like, like in what, the, in what possible circumstance or situation in this fucking universe would the trolls ever be like, Jupiter, we're sorry. We're so fucking sorry, <laughs> Jupiter. Like, we don't know why we did this. Like, like there's no reason. Like, it, like I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. But they all think for some reason they're like, yeah, you're going to regret this one day. Like, how? Are, I, are you fucking crazy? I'm terrified. Have you seen his TikToks of him morphing into a demon and a skeleton and shit? I'm I'm fucking scared for my okay. life here. If we put the big Hawaiian Tito and the 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 taped headed uh, Kiwi Tapes avatar into an AI filter, come up with some pretty fucking wicked satanic designs too. <laughs> Could you imagine Tito? <laughs> <laughs> So we could we could out we could we could Jupiter shit would let not look anything as cool compared yeah. to ours. No, you're right. Too high for stupid next week is the Satan edition. Facts, Yay, folks. Got to yeah, we got to like we're gonna play some Breaking Benjamin in the background and make yeah. AI things of like cool no. demons and venom. We're and shit. playing Ghost all the way, all day and night. Ghost and uh demons and werewolves i don't know i was serious about seeking out like some black magic practitioners but not for raising my views mainly for cursing low cows like i'm willing to auction off a little piece of my soul my soul you know quote unquote uh just like some uh voodoo practitioner let's go to something. new orleans yeah i really do want to go to new orleans i feel like my limit is like animal sacrifice but uh anything Shit. other than that i'm game for it Chad, is gambling legal in New Orleans? Whoever lives in Louisiana, let us know. Yeah, let us know. Should we fuck around with black magic in New Orleans to curse? Um, am I going to curse? <laughs> Maybe. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'd probably just, you know, Earl and shit. I think yeah, Earl. Earl. Just, just Earl. <laughs> we already got some of his hair the last time we were in town, so. 
Could you imagine yeah. he's listening to this right now? He's like, he has his little calendar, like, ah, 27 days without a mention on Too High for Stupid. Like, this is going great. <laughs> and then he hears that, and he's just like, he's literally, he's back in Henry Ford already. Like, he's already halfway there on the car ride. I want to film the whole thing. I want to film this whole, like, when we go in with, like, some, uh, voodoo person i don't really know what they're called i don't want to be offensive fuck yeah you know? they're saying gambling's so legal that there's slots oh in the fucking oh my god oh that is major that yeah, is major that is major that is major oh and linda if you're watching this and you see all these videos i want you to know something i'm taken <laughs> linda. i'm taken and you can deal with it I'm not gonna cheat on you warned me not to fuck I'm with sorry, voodoo. But... It'll That's fuck you back pass. ten times over. Because I love the girl I'm with. I love her to bits. What is going on with his mouth? It's not. It's not. Uh, if it's not synced up, that might be a problem with the video I took. Nonetheless, it's it's still the audio. Okay. And M, if you watch this, my dear girl. Soon to be wife. Oh Christ! I forgot about this part. Yeah. Will be happy being part of my family. I've changed, but I'm probably actively dating another kid, or at least what I believe to be a kid. Anytime he so, says he has a girlfriend now, yeah, you got to assume that. You got to assume back that off. he has. To, he finds the need to call out Linda Benda and be like, this "What is, did he say there? What did he say there about Linda Benda?" This is Loki like the crow. This is the crow all over. Oh, he again. is the, the fucking Bill crow. Star scarred. Yeah, not the not the Brendan Lee edition. But, no, uh, not even Bill Sting. No, no, <laughs> not, not even Sting st edition. <laughs> wow. No. Oh, Sting that's low. Sting isn't vengeful enough. You know, it's got to be the new crow who's all edgy, and uh, you know, like s sewer slidle and shit. <laughs> Like, why does the new crow just remind me of, like, Little Peep and Machine Gun Pe Kelly? I, I don't know. And I hope my family will love you in return. You have no family. Anyway, on to more pressing matters. I've been seeing a lot of people talking smack <laughs> about me. Saying they could take me down, they could hurt me. Oh, the you know music what? finally stopped. Your words don't hurt. Oh, no, it didn't! Fuck off! And, uh, your actions are only just making you look like an idiot. Who? Your actions, <laughs> your words towards me. Everything makes you look like an idiot. Anyway, your actions are speaking louder than words. Oh, he didn't like that song. You're making yourselves look like idiots. Yeah. Well, I'm doing my best not to, not to provoke anyone. Well, you better ash that cigarette. Boy. No, I think he's tossing it here. Chat, wait, hold up. Wait, wait. Chat, chat, what's, what do you think the answer is? <laughs> that cigarette is down to the last. It's down to the filter. Uh, Kiwi, what do you think? Do you think he's going to throw or do you think he's going to ash it? I'll, I'll bet you five bucks he gets one more drag out of it. How about that? I'll bet that he throws it right here. Chat, okay. what do you think? Oh, shit. Do you think, do you think he, you, <laughs> shit, do you think he tosses it or do you think he takes one more hit? Just one more drag. It. I'll spark mine up just as he does it. Let's see what happens here. They're saying that's a that's a finishing. One more. Eats it. Oh man! It's like we're playing baccarat, if, if and that's the tie. It, I'll, if he eats it, I'll give a fuck <laughs> what to memberships. Yeah, you are. Oh, you Come won! On. It's it's over. No, it's over. You won. You won. Yes! You won. He hasn't tossed it yet. He, he's not. Cause to hurt he's gonna take those one more. around me or those around. I've you. seen this video like three times too. That's crazy. That's I'm crazy. Not for it no more. <laughs> so, if you're gonna be like that, pick a new person to fight with because you're nothing to me, but insignificant little flies who get under my skin but can't annoy me enough to actually want to take action. Oh, the video <laughs> cut back in. That's awesome. Bam, another hit. Oh, he's throwing One it down. more. Oh, baby, I was so right. Yes. This is why I've stopped more. gambling, bro. 
No. <laughs> Dude, I'm telling you, every time I take advice from you, on I, I hit. So, I don't know what it is. I think you're giving out too much. And it's like as a fisherman, you know, if you're a fisherman, you don't give out your fishing spots. I feel like it's like that. You're, you're giving out your luck. You we gotta talk like, to... We gotta talk to boss man Jack. We, we really do. do. Yeah, we do. I think to get on that level, we'll need to like do some galaxy gas or something. Too high for stupid. The galaxy gas edition. But uh, yeah, oh, that's, that's we coming. we there there is like maybe episode one hundred like just something take massive rips of galaxy gas. We gotta really like lean into the high part of our name on episode one hundred, yeah. and I don't know how we do it. Pre- right, maybe not on, even on this fucking platform. Yeah, I think you're right. I think something crazy. He's saying, yeah, please, please. Yeah, guys, let's do it. I love that they're encouraging us. I can get real bad quick, but still. <laughs> they're like, oh, yes, please, yes. Dude, Galaxy Cats. No one is saying no. I've seen one person say no. <laughs> yeah, guys. Say everything you want about me. Say it. I should tell you, you no, that me. should tell you something about that, that literally people who smoke dabs all the time, like me and Smokey, are sitting here ripping on Galaxy Gas. That should tell you everything you need to fucking know about that shit, man. On the real, do not touch it. Like, Oh, no, the Galaxy Gas? No. What I was thinking was inviting White Bowser back and dropping down. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a fucking show. Oh, my God. I don't know if I could drop a tab and just be here on stream, man. Like, with I, White Bowser? With White it, oh Bowser. my god. Oh, that would be... that. Uh, no fucking <laughs> way, dude. No way. That would be he the act- weirdest trip ever. He'd In front of thousands of people with White Bowser, just this tripping dick. Oh my god. He would god. need to take one, too. He would need to take one, too, or I'm not doing it. Unless everybody's on the level. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, we're getting way off topic. We'll, sh- we'll ship some to Shelby. What you think of me. Yeah. Or what you perceive me as. I could give a shit less. Doing Just gel tabs with white mouse. <laughs> oh, no fuck off. Oh, you're not <laughs> fucking kidding. Dude, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Well, how much is it? Well, how much is it? The- Easy. This will get us a fucking bit, dude. I'm, but I'm not. All right. Is it whippets? Yes. Smoke. Okay. I guess we're going off on this tangent. Let me just pull it up here. Yeah, it's like, uh, you know, they can sell this gas, like this nitrous oxide, uh, for fluffy, like, can chargers. They're like fluffy cream can chargers. But they've what? got it figured out. So they're marketing it as like shit to you know for baking, but everybody's huffing it. Um, I don't know. I don't want to pull up the website. Where's like a good? Yeah, it's like whippets, but they flavor them. They it's like fucking cherry whippets. Flavored whippets. Fuck. Yeah, let me show you this. Have you not seen this? This is I a s- problem. I assumed it was just whippets. When everyone kept saying it, I thought, oh, it's just the new name for whippets. I'm fucking strawberry flavor. I feel like a fucking old man, dude. I, Jesus. Can you, can you, like, I can't, so what? I can't smoke a cigarette, but I can fucking do this shit? What is going on? I don't know. Uh, Shade, I, I love you, brother. Thank you so much. But on, on the real, I'll probably never touch this shit. Like, this is, uh, re- regard fuel. <laughs> to the moon just strap it to you and you become more regarded you know what i see when i see this right like i would say the same thing as kiwi personally flavored whippets not not that that's not up my alley however uh when i see this i see original four loco or salvia it's one of those things on the market that's not going to be here very long (laughs) uh yeah absolutely yeah absolutely so it's like kind of like a collector's item you know? you know, this is the big um, rap craze right now. All the young rappers oh, is it? are doing like it's the lean of of this era. It's the new lean. It just goes to show how down bad the economy is, where where rappers are re- are resorting to galaxy gas over over syrup. 
but I don't know. Fucking A. I, I didn't know nothing about this type of shit. Yeah. I mean, I knew about the Galaxy Gifts. I just didn't know it was a flavored Whippet. That's, oh, yeah. That's fucking ridiculous. Yeah, I mean, they, they aren't fucking shy about it. They know what they're doing, and they're making money hand over fist. But Shade Horror, <laughs> Shade Haxor, do not <laughs> hesitate to charge back. I will not, I will not be taking any Galaxy Gifts. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, we'll see. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Let's not let's not make any statements here, any positives or yeah. No, I, you're right. You're right. We might do it. And uh, yeah, I'm doing all I can. Maybe Nova will do it. Oh my! I was just gonna say the same shit. Yeah, I was gonna say. I was saying maybe the the great food connoisseur yeah. Nova Online would review it, and then I just have to try it. But until then. Nova, do you think you could do that for us? Do you think that you could review Galaxy Gas just to make sure it's good? Like, I feel like that'd be probably, with how trendy it is right now, your biggest TikTok ever. I'm not even fucking with you. I think that you should you should purchase. It's only a hundred bucks. You should go online and you should buy a big old tank of this and just do a bunch of rips in front of your TikTok and. That will be your biggest. You know how the Kaba no. videos do great. No, I, I like, already. I think you're right. I think you're. I'm yeah. sorry. Go on. Go on. I didn't want to cut no, you off. No, no. The Kaba videos do great. I think you should just uh, sample it. I think it it really would do some amazing numbers for you. I've thought about this before, and I really do. And Kiwi Chat, I really like. In all actuality, because like he's never gonna. As much as like it would be hilarious, I think the <laughs> the most likely outcome for Nova. And the best video he could possibly do is on your 21st birthday, you go to the bar, you have, you just, you start slamming shots. You just get fucked up and you have a world of t-shirts-esque like night on TikTok. Like you start recording yourself and you're like, yo, Josh Block, suck my dick, like all this shit. And you're going crazy. You're trashed. You're all fucked up. That would get everybody to be like, wow, that Nova yeah. is one crazy dude. Because you know what, Nova? Like... You see it here on the show, like... <laughs> like yeah, and like, if you, you know, can't you afford it either, you can always go down and get a payday loan, bro. Like, I'm telling you, if you ever need financial advice, or, you know, I'm not, like, a financial professional, but, like, you know, if you ever need something like that, just just let me know, because I feel like Gal both Galaxy Gas and payday loans would be pretty beneficial to someone in your, your situation. So, yeah. And then you gotta you gotta figure out the Jupiter situation because again, yes. uh, he's been calling himself Dark Nova, and he like I said, man, he's got a lot of words for you, Nova. You gotta figure this shit out. Yeah, for real. I think you should take a big old huff of Galaxy Gas and just lay into Jupiter. Show him you're not a pussy. Like you know, cigarettes are for pussies. Anyway, long story short. I'm fed up with you all. I'm fed up. I'm sick and tired of your shit. I'm fed up. <laughs> I've had enough. Find someone new. And move on. Because... I've changed a lot over the days and years, you know? I've changed a lot. It's just you are failing to see the changes. You've changed absolutely in no way. I just want to... <laughs> from the moment people have be have started covering him he has changed in no way shape or form he occasionally has a beard he occasionally doesn't that's the only fucking thing that changes it's... you all fail to see me as a true person we do you all fail to see me as a person you all he's, he's you got all that fail. right He's, He's the fucking Sloverine, bro. He, he looks like a... <laughs> he really looks like a slow Wolverine. Yeah, He's got to pull out the claws like Logan. All fucking depressing like. Definitely he... slow Wolverine. <laughs> your pyro is done with your shit. With his hair? Yeah. I'm done. Dealing with your bullshit. So... A Wolverine from the Ozempic dimension. Target. And move on with your lives. That's all I got to say to you. And Paladin, if you're watching this, I'm coming for you. I'm literally going to find you. Yeah. And I hope that the police catch up to you because you're the real pedophile. 
They've been grooming little kids. As for me, I've been living my own life. That's his Chris Chan moment right there. Life to live. You know, I live. You're the pedophiles. Yeah. You're the shitheads. You all are actually acting autistic like. <laughs> That's this paladin thing, guy's under his fucking skin, though. It is. He's got a lot of people that are under his skin. Fucking his well, old sister, paladin. Well, they're just all like the flies. They can get under his skin, yeah. but not enough to annoy him. And then he stops talking about that and just says, whatever the fuck. I'm living peacefully. I l I'm living my life in peace. You look like you're going through I hell. What you think of me, Paladin. Nobody does. So, if you're watching this, Paladin, just know that me and Aqua are taking you down. We don't care. Your accounts will get banned. He'll never learn. The police no. will find out what you're doing. And they will make sure that you wind up behind bars for the remainder of your lifetime. Because Chad's trying in your to state, cyberbullying is a crime. So. So. Wait, wait, what wait, the wait. Fuck? Play, 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 play. Do yourself a favor and get a fucking good lawyer. Because there ain't a snowball's chance in hell. That you're gonna get out of this. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> there ain't a snowball's chance in hell. Wait, it's it's post it's post sig smoke. Plus, it'll be a cold day in hell before you ever get the chance to hurt anyone, especially me. Okay, I don't know. My bad. If he it'll fucking at some hell. point, at some point he says, "Well, I'll see you in prison then." Implying that he will see this guy in prison with him. Like, like, he's he's such a fucking idiot. Oh my god. I can only imagine Jupiter in prison. It would be such an... I would love to be a fly on the wall in that prison when Jupiter's in there for the first week. Hey guys, do you think I can have a pack of ramen out of your cell? Or just like goes in there and takes a pack of ramen. Some shit like that. I could see it going bad for him real quick because he just has absolutely no social skills. So, well, I, him, would, I oh, would kill to oh see him there. Oh my god, no. Could you imagine Nova? <laughs> Fuck! Oh, like, we, we've we interviewed both of these people in Jupiter. I mean, despite... Like, he would get stabbed by, like, the first week. Nova, though? I don't know. I don't know about Nova. I mean, Nova uh, might have, like, pretty good survival instinct if he could just stay quiet and stay in the corner. Maybe. I think Nova would, uh, you know, he'd find himself... A significant other in there, someone he could spend some time with. And oh, he's a prison he's a bitch, great, absolutely. Yeah, great absolutely. old time. You know, I feel like he would. He'd figure so, figure some things out. Yeah. <laughs> Best start talking to lawyers, or at least looking for someone who's good enough to take on your fucking yeah. case. That's all I have to say to you, Paladin. See you in, see you in prison, douchebag. Peace out, bitch. That's all I wanted to say to you, Paladin. There was. See you in prison. <laughs> Why are you not in prison? I'm fucking mystified. It's... It is crazy that he's not in jail, and here we are, like, a year later. It's yeah. actually, like, what? It's 14 months now, 15 months since the cops confiscated his shit. I... Any day now. Any day now. Yeah, man. It's fucking depressing, but I don't know if Jupiter ever will face any consequences. Dealing with... You know, they, it doesn't seem like any of this has been taken seriously. His shit was confiscated. I would have thought they would have found something on there, but I don't even know if they looked, to be honest. He admitted to having it. shit on there, too, which yeah, is crazy. He did. It's I don't know, but Jupiter's back. So we all better look out because he's a fucking were-demon-vampire hybrid. He's out for blood. And from Dark Nova... To light Nova. Yes. Oh, God. Like, it's... The and I lightest. feel so bad. The, the live chat here at Too High is not very fond of Nova Online ever since uh, the episode Two Fateful Weeks oh. Ago. And, man. Oh, oh, shit. oh Christ, Nova. Oh, you Sorry. guys. Can, can Nova, I know you listen to the show. You need to do me a solid here. Stop. Stop with the loud fucking music. Just, just... Yeah. Just, just lay, we don't need lay off with the, the music. 
like like and and maybe like you you wrote fuck my life in that make a video of yourself doing that just like three seconds be like oh fuck my life and then just yeah. end it there just end it there that's your whole tiktok that's all you need don't post these black screen tiktoks they're costing you views when you're feeling something like that just make a quick quick like video be like yeah i lost my fucking job just, yeah like something about your uncle or just add something in there you know you want these good hooks but this is where we begin with Nova, you know, real positive stuff, dream come true, tickets to, uh, I, I don't know, some concert. So this is very exciting. Ladies and gentlemen, I am about to meet TX2. This is absolutely crazy. I've been a fan of him for over a year, and I'm going to see if he can tie my CD and shirt. There Nova, you got a clean shirt for this, right? Maybe. Like, you, I don't you need, doubt when it. You're, when you're trying to impress people, you need to wear a clean shirt. This is absolutely amazing. I'm at the front of the line, being this close to Evan and Cam is absolutely insane. I'm shaking with anticipation. Here, can you please sign my CD? No. And you got a Ghost of LA CD. Yeah, uh, fuck yes, I, I, also, I also pre-ordered it. Yeah, you know, I pre-ordered it. Will you guys fucking sign my tits? <laughs> that goes hard. I really appreciate it, thank you so much. What's up? And the, those guys, I bet. What's I bet up? They've These done are my, some shit. This man. is my favorite band. Can we get a fuck you to Walmart for giving my worker to immigrant workers? Thank you. Oh, give my job. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. Oh Christ, I fucked that one up. Yeah. Give my job to them. But yeah, for real. Like Nova, Nova. I'm surprised. Like you seem really happy here, and then like one TikTok later, you're like fuck my life. Like fuck, I'm so mm -hmm. depressed. Like I hate shit. And you never elaborate on it. It's just like the next thing right after that, you're back to being all all jolly and interviewing, you know, whatever mm -hmm. whatever fast food you happen to get that day. I, I'm never I can never take your like sad post seriously, especially when you're here rocking out with your favorite band. And I'm more concerned with like fashion. Um, you see how these guys are dressed? That's radical, dude. Like that shit around that one guy's lips and under his eyes, and especially that little netted like ripped up thing that guy has on his hands. That's fucking badass, dude. Like, I think you should get some shit like that of yourself, uh, and you should just, like, you know, but put it on for some videos and stuff. Show your true fan. Really looks like some cool stuff, and I think oh, yeah. you should, like, look around for maybe getting, you know, some stuff put on your lips and under your eyes, and particularly get you one of these fishnet things. Exactly, I agree. It's the future. And the other thing is, chat, for the people, a lot of y'all said you know this band, uh, Kiwi... You know, as soon as I'm done saying this, we can just keep watching the video. But from a scale of one to ten, how gay is this band? If you know who they are, because I don't. Yeah, are they, is this a gay band? Yeah. I mean, no offense. I'm not trying to be offensive. No, is it? Is this? Is this just a band? You'd be like, yeah, it's a pretty, mm -hmm. it's a pretty gay band. But yeah, we can keep watching this. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. Oh. Love your music. Oh no. Guys. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, I can't say that. <laughs> you too! Holy shit, that was amazing! I am never washing this hand. Oh wow. I got it signed. Evan, Cam, if you're watching this, it was an absolute honor to see you at your shows and to meet you in person. It, it, this is absolutely insane. I've been a fan of TX2 for a long time, man. Wow. TX2, let's see if they're a gay band. Oh, oh, it's a, a pretty prominent, it seems. Pretty prominent. Oh, man, he's got, like, a... Texas, too? Wow. Wow. They're country, right? Um... I'll look him up, too. I, I just... Uh, punk? Looks like punk. Whoa. Cool. Yeah. Looks T radical. TX2. Oh, it's some cool dude pointing finger guns to his head. Yeah, what a look at his tattoo. Oh, too. dude, he has a skeleton tatted on his hand. What a oh, cool dude. No, dude, it's like that that venom. Oh, it is a skeleton hand. That's badass. Nova, you should get some tattoos, too. I think you should just do what this guy's doing, because it's working. Chance I finally got Yo. to him is insane. So this is really pot. Like, Nova's really just going through, like, some some great times right now, like... Good for him. I cannot wait to see what is next in his life. Yo, yo. Yeah. Oh, man. So, oh, shit. I, Jesus Christ. Whoa. I need to, yeah, I need to brush. That. Yeah, I need to brush you and you in the chat up on what happened here. So he just got laid off. 
And, uh, and afterwards he was like, you know what? I'm also really mad about my, uh, about losing my job, but I'm also really mad about that concert last night just being dog shit. Like, Mm -hmm. that TX2 band, they were so fucking bad live that I just completely turned myself off from them. And then I was like, Nova, because I I commented this. I was like, Nova, you can't be saying that, dude. You can't can't be saying all this. And then, like, out of nowhere, all these people were like, yo, we're going to start commenting on TX2 shit, being like, yo, Nova's talking crazy shit. That Nova Mm -hmm. Online kid fucking hates you. And I was like, people really shouldn't do that, man. That's not cool. I saw that, too. I saw the uptick in people going over to TX2's accounts, you know, chat. Uh, and I might have to go over myself just, yeah, right now just, on Twitter yeah. and let them know. And yeah, let them in know my, what in, in Minecraft, saying. in Minecraft. And I just see all these people just being like, wow, you know, this guy who was over. I have more followers than him. Stuff. What? Yeah, I have more this followers TX2 than you. guy? Yeah. No way. Yeah, it's got to be yeah. a fan page. It's not. Huh. I, I can, I'll, I'll get in touch with him right now. Let's well, keep watching. Nova, this. why didn't you ask for our signatures? Yeah, that's true. I don't know. I'm kind of offended, but it's whatever. It's whatever. It's not nearly as reprehensible as what you did to Ted Nugent. So everything was going great for Nova. And then he gets laid off from his job at the Walmart. And Bad like times. Smokey said, I'm sure that he had some spicy comments um, about certain groups of people and their fault it being, but we'll never get to see them because the Instagram is gone. Also, he did. He did kind of do this. See, this is what we want in place of the black screens. What? What? <laughs> oh, yeah, look at him here. He's doing his great pose. He's like Jesus on the fucking cross, dude. <laughs> oh, my God, but he's, dude. But you get hired for the... Wait, let me read this. But you get hired for the second job you applied for because of your original cut hours. Oh, so he found a new job, so good wow. for him. Yeah, life, life turned awesome. around really quick. Maybe he's That's like awesome. a roadie for TX2. Yeah, I wonder if it's something like that. So things are looking up again. My entire signed CD collection. Let's get to it. We're gonna. Yes, let's not get to it. Or this. Actually, I want to see how he behaves in the mosh. Yeah, they know how to mosh. Look at him. If you don't have a fucking lead pipe, like if there aren't two sides, if if this mosh pit doesn't look like the beginning of Gangs of New York, then I don't fucking want any part of it. Let me tell you. This looks like some light shit. I've got to stop with the obscure references. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good Daniel Day Lewis movie, man. It is. It is. No, it's a good movie. At State Fair. So, a company called Straight Ahead was there selling their Pro Glider 1.0, which is a hair straightener that also quadruples as a curler, a scalp massager, and the detangler. And today, I. How no, but you be careful with that thing. It looks, you know. Wait now. Yo, we're being tricked. What's going on? This, oh, no. this isn't this isn't posted from around the time he said. Look at it. He's got the poop hand. Oh, that's true. Now, no, that's... you can't. I... <sighs> he did say he has tons of drafts. Um... Yeah, but what he what you need to do, uh, for lack of a better word, idiot, is yeah, that's mean. <laughs> I'm sorry, idiot. Um, you should just post all of it to one channel at once. Just get it all out there at once. I think that's, that's the way to do it. Because if all you're leading. Day. Yeah, if you're leading people along like this and not making, like, fresh, hip content that's in the now, it's useless. Uh, As you can see by the the ratios on this video, just uh, did shit. Well, can I say something? We were just talking about Nova's drafts. Uh, Speaking of my drafts, I have a tweet in my drafts right now saying, at (laughs) TX2official. Well, maybe we just hold on to that. Well, yeah, no, it's just, I just heard this through the grapevine, so I had to let him know. I was like, yeah, yeah. Uh, at the Novine Universe, let me know that you are his favorite music artist. You're right up there neck and neck with Davi Vanity, and he mm. thinks you guys are just the shit. So, yeah. It's... Nova, what is he? He's probably working right now. From He's probably busy. Um, 
Because we, we, he would definitely be contested. He said <laughs> you're the next Davi <laughs> Yeah, that's what he's been saying about this TX2 guy, is that he's going to be the next Davi Vanity, and blood on the dance floor was so hype, and we're just all a bunch of scene bros. Yeah, good times. Um, I think you should tell him that. Because <laughs> Nova's not in here to tell us otherwise. Nova is... The, all right, you're a big Davi Vanity fan, right? Like, that's what chat's telling us. <laughs> that's what chat's These saying. Are this, yeah, this is what your fans, not the trolls, but the people who support you are saying you're a big Davi Vanity guy. So we're going to at TX2 on Twitter and, and just tell them how much you love them. Yeah, yeah, gotta let yeah. them know. Gotta I let them know. For sure. Demonstrating it for you. Note that this is not a sponsored video. I was just told by the lady to... Um, to promote this product, and I think it's amazing. They're so they didn't pay me. They actually just sent it um over and told me, "Hey, just make a video on this," and I did it. Four different temperature modes on this thing, and I wonder, like, if anybody sent him anything else. If he, they were just like, "Hey, I'm a sponsor. Just make a video over it." I wonder if he'd do it. Like something wild. You know, yeah, like I walked a, it back a few steps. Uh, I thought maybe that was a bad first impression to leave on our new best friend TX2. So I wrote, yeah. uh, I wrote instead. Um, I tweeted at him and said, "Yo, we love the goat TX2." So maybe we can have him on as a guest next week. That would be awesome. I would love to get TX2 on here and see what he thought. <laughs> yeah, I always have a good idea. Like just ten minutes after blowing <laughs> any chance. Of... Oh no, we got it. We got it. Th- yeah. We've got to think about shit like that because we didn't think we'd get Uve and, and look what happened there. Yeah, right? So, the world's a weird place. Yeah, but this is just a hair scream. Um, more concert bullshit. Fuck. See, you've got to tell us what this is all about. See, it doesn't do nothing. Make a video being like, fuck my fucking life. My stupid piece of shit uncle profiled me for my sexuality again. Some shit like that would really pop off. This isn't. What do you think is now? We can't say here on the channel, but like, so what do you think his uncle like, calls him? <laughs> like, what do you, like, Bo, there's... Bo, I don't. <laughs> Something like that. Like... <laughs> this right here is actually uh, pretty fucking funny. So a couple days ago, over on Nova's YouTube, he made a community post where he added me. And he's like, hey, uh, we're not going to be we're not going to be talking about the hour of joy this week. I'm just too fucked up in the head. People are saying that I'm a crinkle addict. And (laughs) so that happens. So he makes a post and he's like, the hour of joy is soon to be renamed. What would you like it renamed at Kiwi Tapes? And I tried to respond uh, very warm and lovingly with, I think that you should embrace the meme and name it one predator, one hour. And of course that that message got deleted. I don't know why. Um, and he's decided to name it Kiwi Core instead. I'm pissed now, the fuck off that he 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 loves you. He does not seem to care give a shit about me because I would have told him to call it the French Onion Super Show, and like that would have been the name for it. First off, but yeah, and, like he fucking loves you. He loves you so much. <laughs> I, uh, you know, and I'm not going to lie, Nova, if you're watching, I think um, the only way <laughs> I got to reel it back. Um, <laughs> I yeah, don't know what you're going for. Nova, there, yeah, yeah, I just I probably. Yeah, Nova, I think that you should just, you know, listen to all the advice that I've given you. You should really take it to heart. And I'm going to warn you that, you know, I'll take you to court over this. Um my name is extremely original. It wasn't lifted from anywhere, not a website at all. So, yeah, you naming your show Kiwi Core after this is kind of fucked up, and I demand that you name it something else. I'm just going to say, you're stealing my intellectual property. So, not allowed. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, see, here's the problem with that, too. Like, we're known to have, like, some of the best lawyers in the fucking world. You know, yes, Liquid exactly. Chris. Liquid Chris exactly. is, like, I mean, and, uh... And yet, like, Jupiter here, 
Jupiter was telling people to get like that paladin guy to find a good lawyer. Like, so a lot of people are out here looking for lawyers right now, Nova, and we really don't want to do this. So, you know, if we can avoid this lawsuit, we will. And I think the way we do it is again, having us on the first episode of this show. And the reason I say this show is because we're not going to call it Kiwi Court. You need to let me and Kiwi decide the name of this yeah. show. Yeah. Low key, I feel like that would be the perfect show of faith um, to, to like the wider community. Is if you let not only us but the chat here pick what the name of your new show is, and I think uh, that that'd be a very, very kind chat, gesture. Chat, I need an opinion from every single one of y'all right now. What do you think the new name of the of the two high? No, not not too high for stupid. The new name <laughs> of the hour of joy or Kiwi yes. core should be because these names just aren't sticking. And I know you no. guys would have a way better name than possibly we could think of or Nova could think of. So what do you guys think? Yeah, let's see it. What do you guys think? The Novine Experience. The Novine, the hour of food. The big. <laughs> I can't do this. I can't do this. <laughs> Two soup for suplex. <laughs> I want to say like a few of these I'm saying, but I can't. Like. <laughs> The prowler hour. <laughs> That's oh good. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> Scoop with French onion. <laughs> <laughs> too too hot for soup. Right, <laughs> Crinkle no, core. No, hour of J O I. There's My so many great names. Uncle. <laughs> Fifteen and under. Fifteen and under club. <laughs> The Redacted Show, Scoop of Predator, <laughs> Crinkle, Crinkle, Crinkle Core, <laughs> Dude from Spokane, yeah, these are Novine, fun. Not Neptunic, Not Never. <laughs> I hate subtitles. <laughs> I've still been trying to calm down from the dude in the beginning. I can't even, I can't say it. I can't say it. No, I know, I know, dude. Some of the, some of the ones that came out of the gate were fucking. (laughs) The uncle hour. Gas station shower hour. (laughs) Yeah, I think you should do it like from the shower, like Tony Chase style. Yeah. Yeah, no, there's oh, tons. Man. There's tons of great options there. Yeah, tons. that was good shit right there. I I like that. Uh, that's like the, reminds me of the time we had chat give us uh, racks Viking names. It was beautiful. Oh, tons of great ones. Yeah. What's best, this here? Oh, he's gonna be shaving. Time. This isn't. This is. Oh, this video is fucking boring. It's long too. Oh damn. I mean, we so can yeah, watch it though. Yeah, it's Nova shaving his non-existent beard. Bo just shaves. Um. You know, for the longest time, I, I don't know. I think it's the beard. It's not the- oh, shit. You gotta stop that shit. That's what I'm saying, oh. right? Like, this is this is a problem. This is a problem that must be sorted out. And what is... I love the hour of joy. It makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside. <laughs> See, none of these are doing good, these black screens. You need to make an update. You need to be like, hey, y'all, it's, it's, it's Hayden Novacadre or whatever the fuck you call yourself. Say goodbye to the. Oh, this is here where, he goes. Yeah, here's where he is, goes and does it. I mean, and the the chat says oh, it all. Like, I think time? he's in love yeah. with Kiwi tapes. The call is coming from inside the house. <laughs> I don't know if any of y'all have ever seen Black Christmas. Hey, y'all! It's Hey Nova Kadri, and Hour of Joy is no more. Hour of Joy is now officially Kiwi Core. Yeah, uh, I'm not really cool with that. If I'm being he wants to be honest, oh, he wants to fuck you, dude. He's he's in love I, with you, bro. I, <coughs> it's like one of those like uh, you ever see the YouTube shorts where the people will be like handling ostriches and the ostriches just like proposition them to like fuck, you know, and they're just like no, you know, like. Lay off. It's like some shit like that. I feel like I'm just walking about my farm and some animals just like flagging me down for sex. It's very strange. 
where we uh, that's literally I, I, you, you say it's strange core. that's literally exactly what's happening right here i think so i i know it's very strange i don't yeah, know da- I just, I'm... david attenborough is like documenting this as it's happening right now <laughs> like you understand how like grave this is like now nova is going to no but, but for real no, this is more like uh bear man where the fucking the ending audio is so horrific the director is like never show this to anybody like you keep this locked up this is horrific look um, and all jokes aside because what the fuck like is, he really does I, he seems to have like a, a great respect for you I'm i don't a little know afraid i don't know yeah. why yeah i don't know where this came from Nova, if you have any level of respect for me, you'll rename your podcast. I'm not cool with this. I can think of a website that's not cool with this either. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> exactly. I'm getting these vibes. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, Nova, respectfully, no thank you. Of Lol Cowus. And see how they originally became little cows in the first place. Listen, you can't, like, well, what is this? You can't just, like, be like, yeah, I'm going to do a podcast called Kiwi Cord. I'm going to talk about little cows. What is this? The, the fuck he is. He thinks he is. And Damn. you know what the crazy thing about it is? I, I brought it up in my video yesterday that he is a little cow. But he doesn't want to be looked at as such. He wants to, like, you know, talk about it and all that. Why don't you give your story? Sit there and do like a, yeah. like give us your history, Nova. Like, how did the, you get in this position? Because like giving your analysis on Daniel Larson, where most of it is just you going like, oh my fucking God, I cannot believe Daniel Larson just did that. Like, no, no. What people want to know is like, how did you get in this position? Like, why are people calling you a low cow? But I, I think mm-hmm. Nova has too much pride to do that. Because in his mind, like, it's too, he's too far gone. He thinks he's the good guy. There's no problems with him. And that's, that's that. You know, I'm always happy when a new low cow content creator joins the fold. Uh, it makes me very, because, like, this is still, I feel like, a very new medium to YouTube and shit. Uh, at least in, in my opinion. You know, until they like, kick us off, this bitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, until they vanish us to kick. But, um, I don't know where I was going with this. Lost my you said there's a brand new wave of low-cal content creators and he could be the next yeah, one. Uh, yeah, but I'm always happy when a new, uh, like, low-cal content creator pops up. It gives me hope for the future of this. But this is not, like, no, Nova, this is not the way. You need to review semi-legal drugs and change the name of your fucking show. Like, <laughs> name it to the hour of Galaxy Gas. <laughs> Name it to the hour of galaxy gas, bro. I just had the perfect idea because someone wrote it in chat. Nova, I have the perfect uh, chat. You ready for this? Kiwi, do you have, can you can you give a drum roll? The a yes. perfect name. The perfect name. All right, ready? Underflow. <laughs> Nova, this is your one opportunity to do the funniest thing ever. Just, just, just no you're so right nova if you're trying to buy back good faith in the community name your show the hour of of underflow or the hour of ccdn one of the two please <laughs> no please just just underflow change no. your name to underflow yes. i think so too underflow. dude this is the answer there this is the answer you see there used to be a youtuber called underflow but he's gone now so you can straight up come in there and steal everything you steal all the hype up bro it's it's an amazing idea and you're not gonna get sued like you will with this podcast so it's it's a win-win <laughs> anyways look out for the first episode of kiwi core coming out the 14th nova universe signing off i just want to read some of the comments because i think he's in love with kiwi tapes i'm looking forward to the autobiography the call is coming from inside the house. <laughs> Nova, try Galaxy Gas two days ahead of us. We're fucking slacking. First episode gonna be about like he, yeah, dude. It's all just fucking Kiwi tapes. Hour of joy. Kiwi tapes. Is Kiwi gonna collab with you? You need to let me on Kiwi Core if it's gonna happen. I'm telling you though. Uh, no, you need to let both of us on underflow Dude. so that we. Can yeah. talk, so that we if can I talk. get on, if I get on his new, uh, his new podcast. Oh, underflow, you will. You will. I'm not. Uh, I'm not. He don't got time for me. You'll no, be on no. there. No, I, you're. I need you for fucking protection. You know, I. I I'm not going to be seduced. 
Um, I plan on eating an apple. No, bro, this is the, the mic. This is the weirdest Tinder date you've ever been on, and it's it's you and Nova have fun on Kiwi. Co- or no, I'm sorry, Underflow, the Underflow, <laughs> and uh, yeah, fuck. That is great. Oh, there we go. No, there oh, he is. Oh, off he work. Hates and, Kiwi. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Why do you pause. what? Oh, it isn't. Hey, Kiwi and Nova. Listen, have you have you heard Why? anything we were saying? Like, for one. We we really feel like the way you can like figure this out is let's let's take the name Kiwi Core let's throw that out the window, Underflow. Yeah. Just change the name of all of it to Underflow. That's what we've been joking around here with the whole time is we're like, low key. I don't think you should name it this. You yeah. need to name it Underflow. You need to shut like, that's the way back in. That's yeah. the way back. In. And see, no, but like, I don't think you should go rewind or nothing because you're just be wasting your time. All it is is an hour of us talking about how cool and awesome you are. And mm-hmm. honestly, like right now, we're in the here and now, and like that's what we were saying. Like, uh, yeah, change the name maybe to like to the Underflow Podcast, and then really start again giving it to Jupiter. Like, I, you need to start making like videos, being like, "Hey, Corbin Pinnell." Like, like it's game fucking on, dude. Like, here we go. His name is at Jupiter Pinnell on there, and you should also, uh, should also go on Twitter and talk to TX2 or whatever his name was, because we're telling him how much, like, we think he's awesome and whatever. I want to have a cigarette. I lost work. Guilt lover. <laughs> Personally, I can't wrap my head around Kiwi worship, because every self-respecting Too High fan knows that Smokey is the better host. Honestly, it's <laughs> not even really that code. I suck at this. Are you kidding me? <laughs> No, dude. He's right. Gilf Lover is right. I just wanted to add that. I thought he'd be appropriate in the moment. No, I think Smokey is is very good at live streaming. I won't fucking deny that. But I, what I will say is that if you want to be as good a live streamer as Smokey Nova, then you you need to rename your your channel Underflow. Not only yeah, your big. channel, but all your all your projects, all that shit. It needs to be included. That's what it is. Yeah, yeah, and the, and the other thing is Nova. Like, if you really are gonna go through with the Kiwi Core name, like you gotta, <laughs> you gotta have, you gotta have a song. You gotta have a song because, like, again, you will get sued if you don't. And you saw what happened to White Bowser. Like, do you want to like like look at the the shoes White Bowser's in right now? And it all stemmed from that original lull suit. And like that could be you, and you don't want to be in those White Bowser shoes, Nova. You don't. No, no, things could be a lot worse. It seems like he ran off. I don't know where he is. Oh, well. Let's keep going through Bo's shit here. I was sent this 4-in-1 charging cable. Yeah, that's 4-in-1 charging cable. We get it. Hey, all. It's a Nova. Man, is there anything interesting here, Gabe? I mean, come on, bro. Like, sorry. His more, I think it's his most recent video that we need to watch. We can skip a little ahead here with Gabe. He's, uh... Unless he's in chat, you're not, you're not doing nothing here for us. No, I mean this is. I'm always hyped for some more Nova boxing. I mean, rare form. It reminds me of a of of a on like before drugs Ryan Garcia. Allegedly. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> he's like a little uh. What's the word um. I don't know. It's probably going to be offensive, but something uh, Tyson Fury. He's training to smack down Kiwi. I can see Nova, that. is that true? I hope that's not true, Nova, because like, people in chat are telling us that you're like... Look like you're trying, you're trying to assault Kiwi. Those guns. He's not only trying to assault me, he's trying to steal all my YouTube shit and destroy this podcast. It's uh, uncalled for, if you ask me. This is this is the good one right here. This is the one you're talking about, right, Smokey? Yeah, this one kind of yeah. went viral for him, and this is yeah. so I've just been like the Jupiter stuff, Nova. Like you really need to tackle that, but we can put that on the back burner for right now because now that you're here in chat, and I know you're still here in chat because I just know know you, Nova. Um, we need to figure out this Tofia problem. You two need a battlefield to hash this out on, and what better battlefield than here on the show? And I think we need to find a way to get Tofia chat. Like Nova and Tofia, they need to come to blows. 
And I feel like we could give them the questions and like just kind of kind of lead them in that direction to come to an outcome, either a peaceful outcome or one where meant much much blood is shed, Kiwi. You know, it's this it's, is where this is why he needs to be here because he's trying to assault and seduce me. We don't know what's going on. He hasn't explained himself, and I'm a little scared. What does what does Tony Chase say? You're in, no, but like that's what people are worried about. That you're in league with this this gang of of sexual rapists like it's and that's we're worried we, we don't want to be nowhere around you unless you're yelling at Tofia. absolutely but this is uh this is peak this is what you need to keep doing so it's just you know some some fucking music and then he starts beating on Tofia, showing her what's up but yeah this is one of his most popular videos to date it seems 30 like eight thousand likes no 31.3 that's fucking crazy for him Usually it's like, I don't know, maybe one or two K tops, but this one, you're right. It fucking blew up. I don't know what the hell's going on. Here. Well, because people want to see him and Tofia go at it. And the problem is they don't have an even playing field. You know, there's no middle ground and we are the middle ground. Absolutely. They're saying I'm too old for him. I don't have to worry. That's a fair point. Very fair point. Little does yeah, the chat know that, like, like <laughs> yeah, yeah we're, we're this could be a bad time. We're both fifteen. <laughs> yeah, you fucking sick freaks. Me and Smokey have been fifteen this whole time. How you all live with yourselves? Yeah, I started talking about watching... Chris. I started talking about Chris Chat when I was twelve. Yeah. <laughs> God, what a bunch of sickos, right? Jeez, crazy. Speaking of sickos. <laughs> oh yeah, Nova. Nova, what's up, bro? Yeah. But I feel like that's it from old Bo for this week. He he wasn't able to make this segment, sadly. God it damn, is what Nova. it is. Nova, Nova, Nova. Let's see here. So, yeah, I mean, you guys heard it here first. Chris Hansen will be breaking down all your doors right now. New especially yours, TV lore. Especially yours, though, Nova. <laughs> like, you need to figure out all this beef you got with little cows, and then we can we can go from there. Yeah. Who but like we got said, next? Speaking of sickos, that's where I was like, you know, King Cobra. Oh, dude. Oh, God. Sickos. Yeah. Yeah. So. How can we forget about Josh Saunders? What a fucking. I think we start it with the Bog Cron video because it doesn't have uh, the rough moment in it. Okay. The, the week from hell is the one I'm thinking of. You know, this was some shit. Mm hmm. Big ups, Bog Cron. Uh, love the dude, as always. We'll probably skip through this bit a little bit, because that's just them arguing, and we'll get to the point where Josh is talking about it. Like, right here. So, for those who don't know, King Cobra JFS and Jessica Boyle got into a massive fight. Uh, most people are like, aren't they broken up? But no, they're fucking back together. She arrived in Casper with her plan to show up to his house and seduce him, and that worked. So, I think we covered it last week, but she's been streaming from there. Well, a couple of, like, new and very concerning pieces of information came out, and some videos came out about this shit, and their fights are, like, way worse than we ever assumed. They're, they're just, it's a totally toxic relationship, and we knew that if she came back that this shit was gonna go poorly, but it went, like, especially poorly this time. Yeah, it went way worse um, than people thought. Yeah. Yeah, and Josh, you know, he, he always tries to play it off like it was no big deal, but Jessica was secretly recording during the fights, and after we get into his explanation of everything, we'll probably watch the main secret recording she took. Back yeah, it it's... Video. It's not, nah, I just wanted to say, um, he, he doesn't... He gets on stream, and he makes these videos, right? And he talks about it like people didn't just see what happens. Like, uh... I know we said we weren't going to get into it, and this is the most we will, because it's just, it's, you kind of have to for this, because we might watch the video where he says it. He brings up, he's like, Jessica's lying about me, she's telling people that I threatened to, like, you know, off myself, I never fucking did that, and it's like, Josh, you, you can't say that when it's on video of you trying that, like, so he, mm -hmm. he, it's like, it's like he's trying to act like these videos don't exist, maybe he's just tuned it out and hasn't watched them, but I feel like he has to know they're out there. 
he deserves this, man. I'm just going to say it like what what he got here was exactly what he deserved. He let that fucking succubus back into his home. He did. He and did. it ended up exactly like we thought it would with fucking Andy. Way he, crazier, man. Way crazier yes. than we thought. It's, it's And like you said, though, you can't. He he wanted this shit. Like he wanted her back. He clearly mm-hmm. if I don't know. I don't know. Like He had to know it's she tough. was flying to Casper. He could have, I, I don't know. I just don't know. Yeah, he did know that she was flying to Casper, and there for a while he's like, I'm going to hold firm. I'm not going to let her in my house. Don't fucking worry. But he catches one little whiff of Wendy's, and motherfucker totally flips table. Um, it, it, I, I got to say, like, I want to say I can't believe this, but I can. Everybody else saw this coming. I expected more of the boy. So as soon as I knew that she was back in his house, I'm like, he deserves whatever's coming to me. Well, not me, him. He deserves whatever's coming to him. Uh, yeah. Uh, times, I mean, times honestly, two. it could have ended a lot worse, though. With one yeah. of them in jail, one of them oh. fucking, like, dead. Like It could have ended so. up horribly. It's like, it's like I said, there was a horrible moment of this shit that we're not even going to discuss. Um, you can go look elsewhere, but this shit is just really dark. Shit is just really dark. And this, watch how Josh plays it all off. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> like nothing happened. And I yeah. broke my goddamn phone. I didn't want to break it. I did not want to break my phone. I hate breaking my phone. I want to need at least 200 some odd dollars to replace it. I hate this. Oh, is he back in I debt? I fucking hate this. Who knows? It happened last night, which... I was having a great night last night, you know, hanging out at the bar, doing my thing, telling, telling jokes. I was at the bar and I'm like, so if you ever pull out your dick and it smells worse than a bag of three week old cheese, you might be from Wyoming. And everybody laughed. It was crazy, man. As I was walking out, even some goth chick said I smelled great. This is like the, that's that's the kind of like shit he thinks happens when he goes out to the bar and has a. Great oh yeah, we've time talked about smoky. it before. We've talked it's about it. And in, in his head, he's one of those guys who's <laughs> like he goes home and he tweets out, "Yo, tonight was like a mm-hmm. movie, bro. That shit wow. was crazy." And really, it was just him in the corner of the bar having a few beers and then just shuffling out of there without being seen by anybody. Just auditory hallucination after auditory hallucination. <laughs> you can't fucking make this shit up. And then when I got a ride back to my place, I couldn't find my card. And I wasn't trying to freak out the cab driver. I really wasn't. So if anyone or anything happened, I apologize. First hand. Oh, shit. Uh, so he broke his phone at the bar. I don't know what night. to do. I I'm so disappointed in myself. You know, like I wasn't trying to freak anyone out. No, the, you, the Gilf, driver I had Gilf lover, you can't buy your way awesome. back into my it good graces. What, what company you scumbag. To get a ride back from the bar, it doesn't matter. We love you, Gilf Lover. I'm not going to be able to do cooking videos <laughs> or talk to anyone or anything until I get my phone back. I mean, okay, I, can we now, just talk? I can't even do Let's, cameo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you want to talk about, man? This video is literally should just be named "I Need a New Phone." Can someone give me two hundred dollars? Because that's all this is, is, guys, I broke my phone, and then looping back around to, yeah, well, I can't do anything until I have my new phone, so it's going to be about $200, and I can't even do my cameos without my new phone and all this shit. <laughs> that's that's all he's doing. And that's, like, instead of going live, actually, he's he's too lazy to even do that, so he sits here, makes his video, uploads it, and someone will give him the money, and he'll have a new phone within mm-hmm. the next few days. I talk about this in my new video, bro. Like, all he has to do anymore to dig himself out of a financial hole is make one Juan, which he'll sell for close to 500 fucking dollars, and then go live once. And he's got close to a G. Like, make no mistake, this motherfucker is raking it in on his lives, too, because people are just itching at the bit for him to read uh, some trollish shit, especially since 
live streams are so limited these days. He goes live so rarely. Um, that's like they all don't he has realize to do. it. They don't yeah. realize it. People like him, people like Chris Chan, go live. Go live. And it's, I don't know. I don't know. Like, I'm never saying people give these guys money. I'm never saying that. But people will. Like, mm -hmm. no matter, like, like me and Kiwi are just two fucking random guys on the internet. But we say, we even say, like, you know, we've always said it. Don't give people, like, Chris Chan, like, Cobra, like, Cyrax, like, Daniel Larson money. And That's like, always been the line for us. We've crossed yeah. a couple lines, but I, that's one line that we'll never no. work with. Yeah, no, and, and that's... And the thing is, it's just no matter what anybody says, you go to those streams and there's going to be a million people send in five dollars to say Julie, because to them it's fucking hilarious. Mm -hmm. Like that's just that's the funniest thing in the world. And uh, and yeah, there'll always be people like that to make sure the Cobra stays afloat, Chris Dan Chris Chan stays afloat, and it'll be like that to the end of time. It will. Uh, that's why they'll constantly go live. You know, man, we got to get into Chris here sometime. Oh, that's one thing we didn't fucking... We'll have to do that after this, Chris yeah. and, uh, Josh. and Josh. Yeah, because and Josh. my phone's yeah. broke. It's so Man, frustrating, that timing dude. up. I hate when I break my phone. I fucking absolutely hate it. Listen to him. No, I'm not oh, I like hate it so it. much. I hate breaking my phone. Dude, I think I have. Uh, I have to... <laughs> he's, he's just bitching. Like, it's literally... Uh, this video... This, this is his first Look video back after all the shit. Nah, nah, Smokey, look at you sitting in your ivory tower with your fucking working phone, judging this man. All right, you. all right, all right, so my dab pen the other day, my dab pen, I tried to hit it, and it wasn't working, and I was pissed, because I was like, no, no, like, I may have one other dab pen left, but this dab pen, I wanted to smoke this one first. Oh, I'm so annoyed about this. Like, God damn it, chat. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do. Like, if I can't get high, I'm not going to be able to make videos and stuff. So, like, I don't know what I'm going to do until I get the 50-something dollars to buy a new dab pen, honestly, chat. Like, guys, what are we going to do? Like, I can't make... That's what he's doing right now. That's all he's fucking doing. Yeah, so support has been really low today, guys. And uh, here, on the, here on the show, we like to have fun, positive content. So... Yeah, if we could just get increased support, uh, it'd be greatly appreciated. And uh, maybe Cat could eat for another microsecond. And don't get it twisted. Um, we're not. I'm not oblivious to the fact that we do a show here. We get a fair bit of super chats, and I fucking love you guys for that. But again, we're not. And any other show you listen to is not sitting here. Just get, any other YouTuber you listen to yeah. is not just sitting here. Just. Uh, god damn it, guys. My car broke down, and I don't know how I'm gonna get through the week. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Unless it's, like, Wings or DSP or something. But then again, then it loops back to why they're fucking low cows. Guys, we broke our damn pen. Donations are not needed, but greatly appreciated. Fucking customized girl got a new t-shirt out. It's so... And you know how you can tell when Josh is broke? When he goes live. Because he'll make content like this. And fucking, he'll he'll make content stop, like stop, see, stop, <laughs> stop, stop. Shirk, you are you have Shirk. supported this show way too. Much, Shirk, dude. yeah, you're God damn it, thank you, brother. God damn it, Jesus Christ, where's the vests? I had mine stolen by some lizard. What are you laughing at? What's so fucking Me? funny? No, I'm just thinking like that might be the new way to do it. Like, like, I'm just going to go live every time I need weed and be like, guys, yeah. uh, I'm going to off myself unless I get weed. <laughs> like, oh my God, I'm not going to be yeah. here anymore, guys. Like, I just need some weed. Like, no, next, next to I for stupid is going to be the pay us or we're ending it stream. <laughs> yes. I mean, we got to make things clear. Like, it's either, it's either this or Too high for stupid grave. episode 78, Jonestown. Yeah. <laughs> 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 we came up and we just got our Kool Aid set right in front of and us. And that's all. No, yeah, that's all. It's just a, it. it's the camera just pointed down yeah. at the Kool Aid bowl. It's us with our hands. Like all you see is our hands at a cup being like, uh, 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 oh, oh, we're getting closer to the bowl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, stop, gonna, stop, stop, stop. We're gonna stop. look like a couple of sad puppy dogs looking at the camera, being like, "Look at what you're making us do, <laughs> you sick fucks! You, you're killing us." <laughs> And that's what Cobra, and I know, I know we're talking extremes here, but that's what Cobra's doing here. That's no, you're right. This is, uh, 
This is a n- next next week is the Jonestown edition. We're whipping up some special Kool Aid, and if we don't fucking meet the goals, we're gonna drink it down. And that's right. That's just gonna be how it is, and it's gonna be your fucking fault, people. Yeah, Rusty Cage style. <laughs> The guillotine will drop if you, we do not hit the dono goals tonight, bro. And not Come only on. that, not only that, to make it ten times worse, we're gonna have like a it's gonna be like a saw trap, you know, where it's like yeah. the second our heartbeat stop, <laughs> like once mine stops, my channel info goes to White Bowser. Once Kiwi stops, it goes to Nova, and then you guys are really fucked. <laughs> Did you ever see a show called Nathan for You? He was like, uh, I have, to, yeah, yeah. He he did a uh, stunt where um, it was kind, of, it was very fucked up. He had to like retrieve a key or something. He had to uncuff himself, or a robot would like expose him in front of a crowd and <laughs> oh, yeah, he'd be a yes, registered yes. sex offender. <laughs> yes. We'll do some shit like that, guys. That's that's terrible. I've seen that yeah. joke before. How is that? That's wild. <laughs> he he came close too, bro. <laughs> he came so close. <laughs> Oh, wait, that oh Josh, super hard. Josh. But that's really... Is there is there another yeah, Josh I mean, video? Can we watch the Jessica stuff? Yeah, that's really we'll go what over I think to the Rumble to. here. That oh, video it, is wild. It is. It is very fucking crazy. Yeah. Yeah, so a little bit of pretext. The Queen is on call with a pay pig. And Same guy who bought her a flight, right? Yes, the same guy who bought her flight and this wild. pay pig. Wild. Sneako shit. She she's telling him about like Josh, this big fight they got into. And it's continuing during the phone call. You'll hear it. But it starts out with her talking to this pay pig, Chris. Um pretty interesting stuff on its own. She accuses him of domestic abuse and it, it devolves. It really devolves, this whole thing. And the the infamous video that you all are thinking about, the one that we can't show here, was taken, I believe, before or after this video, but it was from this night. And this was... I, this is going to shock some people, but this recording is from before the red recordings, the red filter recordings that we covered last week, Smokey. Do you remember those, where she just looked terrifying? It's a creepy video. Scooby Video Those. Gilf Lover, you too, man. Thank Jeez, thank you. Hillbilly Gilf. I just feel like I gotta say this. Uh, Hillbilly Gilf and shirt. Sure, Jesus, thank you guys. Jesus Christ, Gilf. What did I ever fucking do to you, dude? <laughs> All I've ever showed you was love, and you stabbed me in my heart like this. All I know is that's two dab pens right there that, that, yeah. that Gilf made sure I just got. Thank you, Gilf. Damn. That's only one fifth of a dab pen for you. That's crazy. Yeah, That's I fucking. Fuck. <laughs> oh man, he loves you. Don't run away from your feelings. What's up? He choked me for the third time. And what is this over? I'm moving. Yeah, I feel over what? Because I had questions, and Nothing he threw his drink on me. Nothing personal, my fucking ass. Oh boy! Yeah, he he's choked me for the third time, and it's all about I'm a narc. I'm not a narcissist. Narcissists don't fly all over the fucking world to. You know, I'm gonna. I just want to say it. Like some people will be like, "Oh, you never lay your hands on a lady." I'll cut him some slack for this because this ain't no lady. This is a fucking demon from the pits of hell. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. That's just how I feel on the situation. Is it right that he choked her? No, I don't think so. I don't think it's, oh, you can't lay your hands. This isn't a lady. This is not a lady. The video is at least five minutes long. What video? That I just fucking recorded of him screaming at me. Oh, it's the video, yeah. The one we're not showing. He he has put his hands on me at least, (laughs) at least, Four times now. Twice tonight. Saying if he wanted to kill me, he would. Literally because we're trying to watch Tombstone and I have questions. I've told him, I'm not a... So who is that guy with the tuberculosis, Josh? Well, this is- why, why is he spinning that cup around? This is where it all gets confusing because for this entire call... She keeps repeating that. It's, all it is is because I had questions. It's only because I had questions. So like... 
I, I don't know. Like it's. Well, I, I think just feel what like happened that's not was exactly what went down, but who knows? He's been talking about this tombstone date for a long time. Uh, I but when I was researching the newest video, I realized he mentioned this during the breakup. All I wanted to do with Jason Kong was sit down on the couch and watch a little tombstone. Is that so fucking wrong with just a little bit of alcohol? I I mean, I thought that would just be so romantic. And it, it, that's what happened. And he, he thinks this is like the sexiest thing ever, bro. He really does. He thinks watching uh, Val Kilmer slowly die of tuberculosis for a fucking hour is just the ultimate date in his mind. So he goes to pour a little bit of liquor on Jessica. And he's really drunk, so he pours like half his drink on her. Which is amazing. And uh, she gets pissed because she's wearing her brand new Jeffree Star t-shirt, for fuck's sakes. You you sick monster. I mean, How yeah. How dare you soil such a holy relic. And... He does something yeah. else, though. Yeah. Like, there's something else yeah. she brings up in this call that he does. No, I mean, yeah, don't come on her either. I mean, just don't come on my Jeffree Star t-shirt. It's... I mean, Plain no, if she's saying, but if she's, the way she's describing it is true, then yeah, that's fucked. Is that like, yeah, she's, that barely, just... <laughs> she's sitting there doing a puzzle and he just walks up to her and comes on her? Like, that's fucked. That's well, we fucked. Are, I mean, we haven't gotten to that point yet, but yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's like some New York fucking bus shit, dude. <laughs> yeah, and by the way, I highly regret tweeting out, uh, we is love it? the goat TX2 because yeah. already we are getting... Not men, not much love for the goat TX2 for being honest right now. <laughs> That's what we call a sneaky snake right there, guys. Just wanted to... Movie watcher. I don't care if it's a Western or whatever. I'm going to ask questions. I asked a question. He threw half his drink on me. I, I put my Jeffy shirt on. I told him, do not get my stuff dirty. I'm going to wear this tomorrow. Threw half of his drink on me. I'm supposed to know that's flirting. Because <laughs> I told him I don't understand Westerns. And <laughs> that's the funniest shit ever, dude. You tried to be romantic and you just... <laughs> you, like, throw half your drink on her. <laughs> that is something you just imagine Josh would think is, like, a good move, though, you know? <laughs> yeah, it would be something only him would think would, uh... You know, be, like, a romantic thing. Nobody else is gonna like having beer and soda splashed all over them you know like you bump into somebody at the bar and uh you spill a drink on them they're like hey motherfucker it's not like oh my god take me home you know like, <laughs> there was a kid there was there was a kid in my high school who was trying to I, I i guess he was trying to like talk to this girl and he sat behind her in class and just had matches and he would light them and just throw them at her oh that's actually that's romantic as fuck that's exactly what josh was doing yeah. here basically just, would he, like, throw the lit matches at her? Like, light the match, yeah, and throw it. <laughs> yeah, I'm not fucking with you. No, that's like, hype. He, that's based. Everyone around would always be like, yeah. stop. And not only... It wasn't necessarily that people cared. It just smelt like shit. Like, at matches. Why, I, I've been asking you for another good story along the line of spa for a long time. Why has this been setting on the back burner? I've been thinking of, I'm thinking of a, <laughs> a fair few of them, but that was, that was one just came to mind here. Cause it really reminded me. I'm like, damn, that's, so that's exactly what Josh was doing. He liked this chick and oh, I just assumed so. I don't mean, I barely knew either of the people, <laughs> but like, why was he doing this? I don't know. He was either bullying her or he liked her <laughs> and the guy was a weirdo. And so I assumed it was, you know, the well, hey, now that's kind of a fact. Why would you call him a weirdo? Because he was just, a weirdo. Because he was nice. fucking weirdo. What, so <laughs> a man can't throw lit matches at someone he's into anymore? What the fuck is this nation coming No, but for? remember a few weeks ago when I brought up on the show how there's these guys who are so obsessed with, like, guns and war and, and oh, my mm -hmm. God. Like, they, he was one of those guys. Like, oh. like yeah. I'm pretty what, sure so his, does... like, his background on his phone was a tank. I remember that. It was a fucking tank. It's better than, like, a photorealistic wolf, but not much. And I'm trying to ask questions. I was asking so, questions. What, what do you think's going on here? He did wear cardboard pants. Know, he told me he hates me. 
he he tried to fucking blow his brains out a few minutes ago. I mean, he fucking had some rifle sticking in his fucking mouth. All because I'm trying to understand a movie that he likes, and I don't really watch movies, so I told him this on my second visit. I don't understand movies like normal people. I don't watch movies like that. So if I have questions, I'm going to have questions. We're sitting on the fucking thing. I asked him a question. He threw half his drink on me, and I got mad because all of my clothes were clean. I just took a shower. All of my clothes were fucking clean. Telling me he didn't splash it all over my arms, my tits, my fucking pussy, my fucking clothes. <laughs> what a vile woman. She never misses an opportunity to talk about fucking genitals. Never. <laughs> she is her. She, she's the worst with yeah, that. It's either your mom jokes gross, or dick and pussy gross. jokes. And then calls me a narcissist. I don't think you know she's what a narcissist gross. is. Narcissists only care about themselves. Well, that is exactly you, Jessica. Now Josh chimes in. He's like, hey, you're fucking narcissist, Jessica. You know what's so fun? She says, oh, p narcissists don't fly across the country for someone. Did you pay for that flight? So all you had to yeah. do was, was sit sit on a flight for like four to five hours like wow the sacrifices you make for love you fucking like what is she tries to act like some noble thing like people fly no. what like what it's a uh, she um uh, <sighs> she didn't even pay for it there's that and she went there for the sole purpose of restarting her live streaming career. This whole thing, this whole relationship with Cobra has been to make a name for herself uh, as a YouTube celebrity. So it, it's not surprising that as soon as she gets Cobra in a compromised position, um, like yelling that she's going to fucking freak out on him and record it and all this other shit. Because I feel like one of the intentions of going there was to ruin Cobra. Or at least she knew that she could do... I, I don't know how I'm trying to word this. It almost feels like she went there with the sole purpose of fucking up Cobra's life. But I know that that's not what happened. She wanted to go back there to win him over. So I think that the, the contingency plan was, if this doesn't work, if this doesn't restart our relationship, I'm going to go scorched earth and release all this hidden footage I've taken. So I, yeah, she went for the content. Exactly. She absolutely so did. She absolutely she had mission. It was never about like getting back together with Josh. It was to have more dirt on him. It was to like and actually, you know what? Maybe it was. Maybe she went there with the idea of, like maybe one last ditch attempt to try to get pregnant or to have a relationship when she didn't see it working out. It was like, all right, now we get to the point where we're just here to try to fuck him over and fuck him over mm -hmm. in any way we can. Yeah, she tried to get pregnant. She tried to fucking be his girlfriend, wanted to move in there, and when th that wasn't going to happen, she'd settle for clout, which would lead to money. And she's going to fucking drag his name through the mud. I wouldn't be surprised if a number of hidden recordings start popping up. I really wouldn't, that she's had on the back burner like this. I I, I wouldn't be shocked. Yeah, no. Those oh, because start you popping threw up alcohol on, her Instagram on me and, and I... Absolutely. Absolutely. Yep. She just... She's the type to even post, like, a Combra sex tape, man. Fucking oh, get him back God. there. Yeah. If she will. She really we'll, will. We'll have to do that rumble stream. There's no yeah. alcohol on you. I smoked a little bit to be cute. I flirt with you. It wasn't. You're fucking mine! You never want to smoke that fucking read your mind! I'm going to finish that! Yes, I got I'm pretty sure you just screamed, I'm autistic. I can't read your fucking mind, I'm autistic. Start slamming on shit. All time quote. I'm supposed to read your mind that you were flirting with me? So I'm all wrong. You were to a fucking time. Fuck this shit. But I had literally just taken a shower and I had. <laughs> I don't have a Discord. I tried telling you. I told you I don't.
I don't have a Discord. How many times do I have to tell you? Then she's about to be like, but I do have a Discord. Yeah. I'm not yeah, in no. any Discord servers. No, this is the moment. I feel and this is this is the God's honest truth, and I'm not trying to sound like a dick, but really, like just to me, like I if you're having a screaming match like this with somebody, anybody, significant other or not, and the words Discord are are brought up in there, <laughs> you're there's something wrong with your like you're doing you're doing something wrong, both of you. If both of you are just just no, 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 no. All the people with Discord kittens are going to weep. Like, no, Smokey, she's goth. Like, no, no, no. I don't have a Discord. I have a Discord for me and me only. Can you See, I have a Discord for me and me only. <laughs> no, for me. I don't have a Discord. You're literally telling me I didn't tell you not to spill stuff on me earlier before the movie. And then, yes, I did. I was sitting at your kitchen table. I said, yes, I did. See, this is where the problem lies. I told you. I told you. I did. Yes, I said that, but I did. You you didn't say shit. I did. Fuck you, you didn't say shit. Yes, I did. And I fuck you, did I? Yes, I did. I fuck you, did I? Yes, I did. And I you fucking did I? He's fighting her gaslighting so hard, bro. <laughs> With every fiber of his being, he's like, no. You're not going to fucking fool me into this bitch. Yes, I did. Yes, I did, Josh. <laughs> and she thinks if she says that enough that eventually it's like, and this is what's happened, though. She's, it's, look how worked up this motherfucker is. And how many videos have we seen of her doing this? It's always, I did, Josh. I did do. I told you I was live when she didn't. It's always some shit like that. She's trying to get him to believe some shit that didn't happen. It's, uh, it, it's the Gaslighting 101. Chat's killing me right now. Don't come on me. <laughs> I did. I did. And I did. No, no, no. I did, and I was completely sober. I do want to hit. No, like you did that. Yes, I did. Why do you get to tell me what I did and did? Fuck you! Fuck you! I'm not shouting. I'm not shouting at you. See, it's it's crazy. She'll always like. She'll claim that he's switching up when he's being filmed, but it's her. She'll turn on the camera and be like, "This fucking." almost sounds like a politician like why what is going on oh my goodness what is going on here why are you behaving like this after she's just wound him up it's fucking it's disgusting to see but also his behavior is fucking disgusting too if he's just pulling what the chat dubbed drive by yeah yeah like i said this is this goes completely both ways yes for him to be like like i don't know like it's like there's so much there's so many like weird angles to this like jessica is jessica autistic i think we asked this before like it's not like uh, not like a, it, like a, does she know like this like josh is clearly she's got something I yeah think but, she's more like bipolar is what i see i don't know i just feel like she's she knows she she, she tries at least to like outsmart him to try to get him to think mm -hmm. whatever she wants him to think and i i don't know I don't know. I just think this whole situation is a fucking mess. It is. And it's like you said earlier, it's on both sides. Uh, this makes Josh look terrible. People would have been so in Josh's camp if he just would have cut this shit off. But now he's got to bring her back and she's got to accuse him of domestic violence once again. So. And the way he's acting isn't helping his case. It's really fucking not. Like, this. No. I, I, yeah, I don't. I don't know. 
again, no, I guess it's, it's I really don't have a a set. But when he's wound up like this, there's no turning it off. It's it's like the intro, you know. He's smashing that fucking hat. He's got to get it out, or it's just. There, it's not possible for him to leave this amount of rage within himself. He's either going to take it out on inanimate objects or people. So, yeah. And another thing I've heard also is they're taking like pills and shit. A lot of people on Twitter were like, "Oh, Kiwi, taking Zans and drinking doesn't make you violent." Yeah, it doesn't like I, I guess I worded it wrong. It just removes like a lot of your, I don't know, personality borders, like shit that you'd think about, you'd you'd actually do. His mind is like unleashed. I don't know because I, you know, I don't know. I'm in the camp where I think that they've been mixing shit because every time she comes around, it's always just a little different. I, I don't know. Maybe it's just her, but I've I've always been in the camp that I, that they're doing. I personally the think it's too. Both of them are too. Uh, they're too stupid to not bring it up in the heat of an argument. Like Josh, yeah. I feel like would be like, "Well, you brought drugs to my fucking house." That's that a fair point. Um, That's a fair point. Yeah, I don't know, and I feel like if, they're just doing, doesn't if they were doing the, Zans, they'd be a lot more mellowed out too. Like no he matter just what, doesn't, I don't know. He just doesn't um, talk about like the dusting. He won't talk about the dusting. So that's true. I, right, could, fa- I could see fair enough. No, you yeah. got me there. You got me there. You got and, me there. and that's that's still going on. That's still going on. Blacked out. Yeah, dude. People do some fuck shit when they're mixing pills and alcohol, and it's just no good. It could just be Josh, too, but I've always thought there's a little chemical in it. Earlier was no problem, right? Fuck you! But it was no problem for Fuck you! you. That's just it was no theory. problem for you earlier. It was no problem for you earlier when I was trying to talk to you in a normal voice and you were screaming over me. You don't want to talk to me. I want to lose my shit. Then you want to think you're a great. I'm all called the collective, and you're the one that's crazy. But you're the one who's doing it. Fuck you. What? What did I do? Did you hear that right there? It's like you're you're gonna act like you're the one who's calm and collected. And you're recording <laughs> right now. You fucking you minge. Yeah. No. He 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 does not mince words with her at all. Uh, he's and you can tell he's fucking pissed. Like he's got. He'll call her every name in the book because in his mind this shit is long over. I really feel like that. Like in this moment, he's like, "It's done." But I always feel like a, a month or two could go by, and he'll just be like, "Ah, Jessica's not that bad. She can come back." <laughs> For real, he just gets tired of chatterbait. <laughs> yeah, did exactly. I, did I? <laughs> oh God! Did I threaten you? Did I throw alcohol on you? I did not throw alcohol on you. I just throw alcohol on you. It wasn't a shot. It wasn't a shot, though. It wasn't a shot. Yeah. It wasn't a shot. Yeah. It wasn't a shot, though. It wasn't. He's fighting so hard, dude. He's just trying. A shot. It wasn't a shot. It wasn't a shot, though, because it wouldn't have gotten all over me. It wouldn't have got. It wouldn't have gone all over me. Fuck you. It wouldn't have gotten all over you. How am I supposed to know that throwing alcohol on me is Fuck a flirt? You. Fuck you, you lying, manipulative fucking cunt. What am I yeah, see, like, whoa. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, He's fucking, he is not, he don't give a fuck. He just, he's pissed in this moment, and Jessica's trying to, to calm him down to make everything cool, it seems, but in the same breath, she's like, She's just making everything worse. Like, everything. Yeah, when when we... Uh, I don't know, I did that spot. What? Yeah. What am I lying about? You won't take responsibility for it, so much right. What, because I was, I, I was at... I'm stupid! I can't do anything like Because I was asking... Oh, a... like, why is it that when we tell you, Cobra... We tell you that she's a stupid, manipulative piece of shit. We're trolls. We're awful fucking trolls who are just out that got you evicted from your apartment. That's another thing. It's like you have legitimate fans of yours who are turning on you because anybody who criticizes your relationship with Jessica is a fucking troll in your eyes. And all you're doing is creating more trolls. It's it's counterintuitive. 
or well, whatever the fucking word is. Well, I don't you, know. No, you said it the best to start because he views everybody like that as trolls. Counterproductive. If you're not, if you're not looking in his best interest, and in his mind, his best interest is simply just getting pussy. Uh, then you're not on his team and you're a dirty troll. So you, by you telling him Jessica's bad for him and she shouldn't yeah. be there, you're just trying to you're just trying to cock block, really. Yeah. She smelt so bad he poured liquor on her. <laughs> <laughs> He's, I was just trying to clean you, Jessica. <laughs> you, fu- you smell like fucking roast beef and cheese, man. I couldn't stand it. <laughs> you know, because I was asking you. Because I was asking, because I was asking, because I was asking, I was asking a question about the movie. God, she's like a fucking unstoppable tide. It's, she just won't stop. He's just like, fuck you, fuck you, conversation over. And she just keeps picking up on the point that she was about to make. She gives, she like could not give a shit about what he's saying at all. Could not. She's got a script to deliver. Yeah. <laughs> I, it's one of those things where she's not listening to what he has to say. She's just waiting till he gets done talking so she can say what she's been thinking the entire time. Yeah. It's it's gaslighting. It's gaslighting at its finest. I feel like that's part of the reason why Jessica has like sought out Josh is because she saw him as a person who she could easily manipulate through, um, you know... The end, the end of the dry spell. And it's worked. It's worked flawlessly. She's been able to build herself a healthy little live streaming audience. And now she can fuck off into the sunset making him look like a piece of shit. And make a whole bunch of money off of it. You're, you're completely right, Chad. Completely right. And you couldn't handle it? Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. So explain to me. you. If you think I'm not going to explain the truth, tell me what I did. I literally. You don't want to explain the truth. You want to explain whatever makes you look the best. That makes everyone else look like pieces of shit. Because all of our feel covered is that because I'm a piece of shit. How does this feel sorry for me when I was literally. Exactly what you're doing right now. You're so narcissistic. What are you talking about, C Pat? We were literally sitting. We were sitting here watching. We were sitting here watching a movie, and I asked you a question, and you threw your drink on me. How am I a narcissist? <laughs> it wasn't spilling it. You threw. You threw. You threw it on me. It was. But you did. But you did. Like, what a... But he did, though. It's, the, no, it's yeah. true, though. He did. He did. And that is, he is... In his mind, it's like, look, I was just trying to be flirty. And she's like, yo, you did do this. Like, it's, I don't even know. They, they're You're arguing about something it's, pointless. It's not about the drink anymore. It's about her as a person. And she can't fucking get that through her head. He's like, You're a manipulative, narcissistic piece of shit. And she's like... How, when you spilt your drink on me? It's like, just because he spilt his drink on you doesn't make you a non-manipulative narcissist piece of shit. That's her only defense. you're You're at his house. He's screaming like this. He's a highly autistic guy. Just get the fuck out of there at that point. Just pack your shit and go. Get the fuck out. What do you, the fact that you keep sitting here, you're, you're, you're recording all this. Like, instead of just fucking leaving... Like, uh, again, it's just, it just seems so, like you said, counterproductive, really. This yeah, is, it is. It's all for attention, like you said. Like, there's a reason she's staying there and recording this rather than just getting up and fucking leaving. Yeah, she could leave. She could very well leave, but you're, you're right. It's all for the purpose of getting dirt on him. And this is low-key what I've been waiting for because I knew their relationship would end and she would just start going crazy with it like, and i think what, this is the real end of things can we can we talk about that video like again the one with um the the five minute video she took the one that yeah Josh yeah we can talk she, about it she fucking ends that video and she shows her tits like what? and you didn't know like in that video 
I the original screen recording I saw that that bitch fucking ends the video, puts the phone down, and right oh. before she ends it, she shows her fucking tits and shit. It's like, well, now why would you post that? Why would what you, like... It? Like, and I, it's not like she's like, oh, look at my tits. It's just she shows them. It's like, you could have edited that out, but she didn't. She's just vile. She's just so fucking disgusting. I really, I can't get past that fact that this is, like almost the epitome of how gross a person could be is that does that like i i don't know at least the way she treats other people yeah i mean i mean we we're seeing it right here she's just so trashy man that kind of shit look, just... and the thing is we're we're talking and it's just like my cobra video i did the other day like i was sat here and i was talking about how like annoying jessica is and how much of a piece of shit she is but it can't be discounted that Josh is just a fucking psychopath in this. Like, it's her, like I feel like a lot. I feel like everyone's kind of discrediting that a little bit. Like, I keep saying it too. Like, I know he's like a he's a heavily autistic guy, but like he's he's losing his fucking mind here. Yes. Over, and this isn't like I don't know. I don't. know. She's been back for what, like two to three days. If it's that bad, like you said again, he shouldn't have invited her back. But I mean, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. He is out of his mind here. And there's been a fair amount of alcohol involved. And what's shocking is, like, this is really early into her visiting. She's going to go live. Like, like I said, this is before the, uh, who are you talking to? You know, when she was fucking secretly streaming from his place. No, this, so, yeah, I, no, trust me, I agree. That would, that would get me to snap too. But it's again, after the first time. Tell her to get the fuck out. She's already like, it's, she's already proven that she's not there for you. Yes. She's there for the attention, and it's gotten to this point, and you still just aren't telling her to get the fuck out. I'm I'm questioning how long she's been there. All of this makes me question how long she's been there because if this was like the fight they had, then I'd assume she was at least there a day or two beforehand. I don't think it'd be the first day that they'd fight. I'd think that they'd work things out and be all in that honeymoon period. But this shit is like she's been there a couple days already, so at least a week. Yeah, it's strange. It's hard to make up the timeline because you almost want to think that in some of Cobra's videos that she's in the background silent, but you know she she couldn't do anything like that. So I think she it was only a couple herself, of days. Yeah. And couldn't then they snapped and, and made up and then had yet another fight off camera that ended their relationship. We never got to see that fight, which is crazy. I yeah, wonder I wonder what, what stopped happened. him from recording that one. Yeah, I wonder what happened there for sure. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. Oh no, no, I was gonna say yeah, no. This is this whole situation for real. It just shows that I see a lot of people in chat saying it that if you're in a relationship like this, just get the fuck out of it. Yeah. And that's the biggest thing about it is too. It's like Josh, even it's never worth it. It's never worth it. It's, it was never worth inviting her back, and he did. And I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Like, maybe maybe he does. They do have, like, stronger feelings for each other than, like, you know, these fights let on. But it really doesn't seem like it, especially from Jessica's end. No. Not at all. It's She's only going to record him at his worst. Okay, you know what? Maybe Jessica doesn't have a mental problem. I'll get her up. Thank you. That is the one I get. It's my fucking What do you mean? I have never showed you. I didn't fucking say that. You put me in a boy to watch the fucking show your ass, and then play fucking system. So that's like, yeah, the it's basically confirmed. It's like, yeah, you know what, you fucking slag, goblin faced, flint tinted whore, fucking choke ya. <laughs> I just don't like Jessica. I don't know if y'all can tell. It's bullshit. <laughs> What do you mean, Freddy Baker? We were watching a movie and I asked you a question. And I was like, John, what was your answer to your question? And you fucking turned into a two hour long fight. I'm tired of it. It's not a two hour long fight. I'm tired of it. John, I really told you before we watched the movie. I'm fucking tired of it. I told you before we watched the movie on Wedding Friends. It's not about the movie, you stupid bitch. It's about the fucking... <laughs> it's about you as a whole, man. It's about you, Jessica, and how you carry yourself. 
he's been put back under your little spell and he's waking back up from it. We're, we're hearing it in real time where he's like, it's the fucking thanks I get. You know, <laughs> it's uh you're watching the magic work off the gaslighting actively work off and she don't like it. She's trying to reapply it. Well, we oh, you did not. Yes, I did. Oh, fuck. Here we go back to this again. Yes, I did. Shit. No, yes, I did. But I did. No, she, she, yeah, she just won't did. stop. No, oh, she's, my God. she's insistent on it. Like each time, and I can't. And it does get annoying because both times I've heard her do this. Now they are lies. Like she's Josh. I did. I told you I was live. It's like throughout this entire live stream, you can go back the entire 20 minutes. You never once make any indication that you are live. Like not once at any point. It's like, see, so you can't sit here and it's, it's so obvious that she's lying to the guy. And, uh, mm-hmm. yeah, to do it on camera like this, just so, just so like without a care, just being like, I'll say whatever, I'll lie, I'll do whatever. Even if there's proof of me doing it, uh, just so I can prove Josh is the piece of shit. Again, just shows she showed up there with malicious intent to just try to be like, look how bad of a guy Josh is. Exactly. And uh, I think she did a pretty good job. I'm not going to lie. I think she did a pretty good fucking job, dude. Yeah, no, she took the W and... over Josh on this on this occasion. Yeah, absolutely. Well, they both took L's. Oh, <laughs> Why is it you can say everything that I'm talking about? Why? Why? I was trying to wash out the calm stains, Jessica. Jesus Christ. I'm just trying to do you a solid <laughs> apologize for earlier. <laughs> Jesus Christ. When I was literally talking to you about the movie, I told you before we watched the movie that you do not dirty Kiwi, my clothes. You want to <laughs> no, do you, not you, dirty you, my clothes? <laughs> You, oh God! Yeah, here we get to this. I just, I'm sorry, I can't hold it off. You want to crack the fuck up? Well, yeah, I, I, I need to tell you a few, uh, few responses here to my "We Love the Goat" TX2 official tweet. Oh, because oh God. you're gonna like some here that say at TX2 helped me through my depression after Nova tried to suck me off. Shirk David Wizard <laughs> writes, "Paddle up, bruh." <laughs> <laughs> Alicon writes, all the pedophiles like Nova love the poser emo TX2. <laughs> Reeves writes, I worked security at one of his shows and it was all minors, though I'm sure TX2 <laughs> liked it because he sure likes them. Uh, and then TX2 tweeted two hours ago and said, I am the punkest artist of all time. And someone replied and said, Nova said you're gay. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, it's TX2. Yeah, we have Ozzy Watch. We now need TX2. Watch. Yeah, guys, I feel like TX2 is going before Ozzy <laughs> just based off looks. <laughs> oh, that's genius bit. That's genius bit right there. I'm yeah. spending spend the rest of my week talking to TX2 oh. on Twitter until he yeah, blocks guys. me, of course, before the end of the night. Oh, we love TX2. We do love our chat. Our, our community seemingly doesn't though. But come on, guys, come on, guys. Our community doesn't nice. love a lot of things, apparently. <laughs> fucking motherfuckers. You're not. Yes, I don't know what you did. You lying fucking cunt. I just put on my the fuck you did not. I just put on the fuck you did not. You're not even let me think. You only want to be perfect. Twenty one stars. You only want to finish. I have heard you. I literally, I literally put on my I put on my Jeffrey Star shirt earlier to show you, and I told you. I said I'm wearing. Yes, I did. You want to say we didn't work in a way that we started? I literally put on the fucking understand what you want. With a typical fucking female, you can't even You pulled your dick out! I said, do not call on me! (laughs) (laughs) 
that is yeah. fucking wild. Man, what a common issue in yeah. America today. <laughs> We're just all suffering from these problems. Low key, though, if you've taken any form of pl- public transportation. <laughs> Do not. Yeah, be careful. Jesus. <laughs> My on on her brand new Jeffree Star <laughs> shirt, you fucking monster! Wow, the, what a weird, what a weird couple. Like yeah, what a and weird you know couple. the the thing is, is Josh has gotten a lot of criticism for stuff like this in the past. People are gonna know, like, make that white stuff come out. If you know, you know. Um, he's he's done weird shit like this before. His stepsisters have accused him of some weird shit too. <laughs> So, well, not half sisters, half sisters. So it's just like he is—he's yeah. a fucking degenerate, man. I used, he I've is. heard a There's lot no of rumors. Around that. It, it's our boy is not as innocent as he seems. No, not even the slightest. Yeah, take a block off for a whole my dick off. No, why am I Jesus Christ! Look, I pulled my dick out because I thought it would be cute, and you freaked out over nothing. <laughs> Like, why wasn't that the the big fight point? Why is it the drink? Yeah, really. Or the questions for Tombstone, like... Yeah, over questions on Tombstone and not the fact that, like, this weird thing happened earlier when you were playing a puzzle. <laughs> Can you, you're gonna... Can you, what, what, what? What? Someone just responded to it with the Daniel Larson meme that said, I understand TX2 of killing myself tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, if we can move on, I had to. I had to when I saw that. <laughs> it's the picture of Daniel 2. It's, it's, it's TX2's fault. Still don't know you go. Is TX2 going to be our Grace Vanderwall? Oh, he may be. He made TX2. Be. We've Yo, been I'm in a, contact with TX1. And, I really uh, hope this guy doesn't block us or else all out war will ensue. We're on the <laughs> team. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, I did. 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 Jesus. It's 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 the he's fighting off the dark side of the force, bro. Like, can you blame him? He's trying so hard. I don't know. It's it's almost uh, it's like he's fighting a witch and she's just casting a bunch of fucking illusions on him. He's like, it's not real. It's not fucking real, man. Sean is not up right now. It's not real. Have we ever heard him scream, like, to this level over shit? Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Really? Over, like, what? Absolutely. Um, cigarettes. No, I, mean, I know it's a br- uh, I broke my cigarette, like, the Star Spangled Rager. TTS. But I, but I mean, like, something serious like this. Because clearly, like, this is, like... Like, I mean, that type of shit, like, it's like, oh, I broke my cigarette. Like, here, like, he truly feels like he's being, like, like fucked over by her. And like I, I just don't know. Like I've never seen like may and I'm I'm not as like in tune with Josh's history as you are, but uh yeah, I just I've never seen him like to this level. I can like. I can only think of the Star Spangled Rager and maybe a couple moments during Donate to Talk Shit. People are saying Warlord? Um, yeah. Oh yeah, when War Warlord tried to steal his liquor, yeah, he fucking they called him Floor Lord ever since. He laid him out. I thought jo- Josh was going to stick him that night. I really did. And when I saw the... Well, I guess I, I didn't, you know, see it live or anything. But uh, when I saw it, I'm like, oh, shit, you know, Josh has his hand up by his knife. Like, he's ready to rock and roll. I could have gotten trailer park That would have been a quick. fucking wild stream. Oh, Jesus. man, dude. Bum fights 2.0. Good shit. That's just a, just a murder. I loved it when he used to have homeless people in his apartment. <laughs> They'd steal shit. Like it'd be the it'd be the funniest thing ever. Smokey, he'd get up to go to the bathroom, and the homeless person would like immediately get up and start fucking around on his tool table. <laughs> I hate I hate that we. You're, this sounds amazing. Like that sounds amazing, and I hate that you have to say that used to happen. Like that should be yeah. happening right now. 
that should be Cobra content, just him chilling with random homeless. Like, you know how, uh, like the RV streamers used to just invite random homeless people in? That's what Josh should do. New homeless mm-hmm. guy every single day. Guy or girl, doesn't matter. He doesn't discriminate. Yeah. Maybe he does, I don't know. No, he doesn't, dude. He's a fuck. Oh, I know, listen, I know. Listen to any Blair White <laughs> yeah. video response, and you'll you'll know what, what kind of ally he is. I was sitting at the table doing a crossword for four hours your dick out, and I told you whatever he did not throw on me, my clothes were clean. No, you did not. Yes, I did. No, you did not. But I did. No, but you you didn't. But I did. did. Jess, you didn't say that I couldn't fucking come all over you when you're putting together your puzzle. What the fuck? (laughs) This is uncalled for. I don't know, the fact that yeah, Josh yeah. put himself in this, and like, we already talked about the position of inviting the Jessica over, did this but, yeah, to but, but now the fact that you've gone up and done this, like, J- Josh, like, it's just not, it's just not something you do, like, the fact that now this has become the argument, like, no matter where it goes here, at the end of the day, you're in the wrong on this one. Absolutely. Absolutely in the wrong. <laughs> like, and the fact I that he's trying to defend this I, is so yeah. ridiculous. God, what's the big deal? Hey, and when I was sitting on Fluffy Dude, when I was saying TX2 died. Oh no, yeah, I saw that. TX2 is dead. Oh no. When I was sitting on the couch with you. No, you What? What did I do? You're not listening to me now. Joshy, why is that sick man such a bad actor? Why why is he such a bad actor, Joshy? That's probably how it started. Joshy, why is Kurt Russell so bad in this movie? Like, this gosh. movie's so old, Joshy. Yeah. You're just talking shit. I bet she's talking underhanded shit about Tombstone. And that's like talking shit about Ozzy. It's on site. You can't fucking do that. Not in the Cobra lair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's got some nerve for that. His defense is he's trying to be cute. Back to this again. I've been asking you questions about the movie all night. And it's the silence. I have been asking you questions about the movie all night. Repeats. She, I swear to God. She's a master of her craft, man. At provoking and... Disgusting people. Yeah, this is a fucked it. relationship, bro. Yeah. This is as trailer park as it gets. I bet that, like, the guy next door is like, geez, what amateur hour over there. He hasn't even hit her in the fucking face yet. <laughs> God, what a pussy. Stop asking for asking one last question. We talked to things on me. I don't know why you're doing this to me. I told you the second time I visited, if we ever watch this, one, I'm not a movie person. Two, I've never seen a Western. And three, no, no, I can't believe it. Because I fucking care about your interest. You <laughs> doesn't care about my interest. Who is this? It's a hard fucking fight. How did I make your fight by asking a question? Because I saw friends with that. I was trying to be coordinated with you. Yeah, the neighbor is going to knock on the door soon and be like, yeah, I couldn't help but overhear that the fighting over here hasn't progressed into violence yet. Yeah, I'm just going to hand, you guys some, I'm gonna some hand you guys some liquor. Like, let's just, let's, let's get this rolling.
I was going to say, like, that must mean y'all still have some meth up in here. The fighting <laughs> hasn't escalated to a point of violence, so you all have to have some crystal, and you ain't going to hold out on old Bubba John. It's like, no, no, sir. no, we don't. And then Bubba John's like, all right, well, let yeah. me call a guy in. The guy comes in, and he's like, hey, yeah, this is very important in reference to the meth I'm about to sell you guys. He's been the fucking kingpin the whole time. It's been Tony Chase, and he's posing as a schizo, so nobody will ever suspect him. He's that would pop- be fucking yeah. genius. He's oh been my Pablo god. Chacom the whole time, bro. That he would be the smartest goddamn man on the face mm-hmm. of the earth. It's like uh some 47 Ronin shit. You know the the one dude acted like a drunk so they get everybody to lower well, the usual guard. I was going usual suspects. I thought I was Oh, yeah, no that's that's good too. No, that's good too. Yeah, Tony's a fucking mastermind. You the one time we also could go like Shutter Island. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> could you imagine Shutter Island but with Tony Chase? <laughs> Is as the. <laughs> it's him in space, and he finally stabs the satellite man, and all the all the girls love him and stuff, and they're like, Tony, Tony, it's time for your pills. <laughs> <laughs> He's, and the final yeah. shot is him smiling with some his beautiful big teeth, and then just Tony, wake up! It's like some South Park cheesing hallucination oh, no, shit. Nova's Tony. here, Nova, Nova. We need to talk to you, bro. Don't worry, bro. Nova, we we made sure we made sure yeah. that we are going to show we are going to make sure that TX two knows who hey. you are. They yeah. pay for the insult because they insult. We saw them insulting you in that video, so we sent them a message over on Twitter and we're like, those motherfuckers, they're not gonna, they're not gonna do this. So chat, so, can you let, yeah, can you let Nova, know. yeah, can you let Nova what you guys think of TX2 right now? We need to, because we, yeah. shit needs to get sorted out and sorted out fast because I'm, I need to head over back to Twitter after the Cobra segment and really uh, hash things out with Mr. TX2. I thought he may have been, yeah. a, TX2 knows I know you they already. Know you. Yeah, we heard, we saw the, t- we saw them being fucking mean to you and like, signing your record all shittily and we're like fuck that so we hit them up on twitter and let them have it because you know that's just boys will be Look, boys nova i'm gonna be honest with you here and i didn't want to say this and i didn't want to even say it publicly because i felt real bad for you but i, I was talking with T, uh, tx2 the other day because me and him were like we're close like that like i was so we were we were we were talking and i was like tx2 my boy like so how has your recent shows been like out and you know the the west part of the country and he was like smoky my friend it's been it's been it's been just phenomenal and i said yeah man like have you met any good fans out there and like met any cool people and he's like yeah this one kid like around he said he was from Coeur d'Alene and i was like oh i know a guy from Coeur d'Alene his name's nova and he was like nova that kind of sounds a lot like the guy i was talking about he's like man that kid seems so fucking racist and i was like dude like you got to see his Instagram. So I showed him your Instagram and like, yeah, all TX two has been talking about all day is how you're a racist and how you watch YouTube videos on you. And now he's saying you're a pedophile and shit. And like, so we're basically gonna, we're going to get our whole community to take it to TX. We've had enough of the bullshit too, dude. We're not fucking with you. We saw this. We've had enough of it. Yeah. Enough enough of the bullshit. Enough of the bullshit is right. Absolutely right. TX two TX2 will know that he's going to respect yes. Nova, whether he, he likes it or not. You're not fooling me again, Smokey. Well, I see. I don't, I, what do you mean? We we saw that you're having a negative interaction with TX2, and we're going, we're just going to war. You know, it's look Nova here. The point the the point of the matter is, we're thinking of having TX2 on the show one of these next few weeks, mm-hmm. and uh, I don't think you're invited. But we do want to show TX2 some of your best videos. Um, we're thinking maybe, like, you let us know, Nova, what no. you'd like us to show TX2. Me and Kiwi were thinking the Twinkle yes. Twinkle Little Star video. That's After after that last interview, I don't think we could have him on here during the TX2 interview. It would be, he'd ruin it. Yeah, no. Ruin it. We want to get him on here and tell him what you've been saying about him. We've seen, we've seen the deleted TikToks where you've been saying that TX2 just is a fucking creep and we were like wow like it's it, a lot of a lot of hate going back and forth between you and jupiter and tofia and now tx2 it's you're fighting a lot of battles and a lot of fronts and this is one we can go and fight for you nova so don't you worry yeah we got you 
We got you, buddy. I Pretty eventful 9 11 for Nova. Second TX. Tell yourself whatever you want. Tell yourself. Make yourself feel better. Yeah, the TX too. Oh no. I'm not a narcissist. I literally sat at your table doing a crossword for four hours, being as quiet as I possibly could. So I was sitting there doing my my crossword patiently. Had a nice smile on my face. You know, I'm not bothering anybody. I'm respectful and quiet. Uh, and all of a sudden, I'm... <laughs> yeah, you know the rest of the story. I could not get a hold of the other line. I take a shower. I put on a bracelet. I put on the bracelet. I put on a brand new fucking outfit. I told you. I said, I finally got my large Jeffree Star shirt instead of the extra large. Look how it fits me. And he pulled the stick out, he has a jacket off, and I told him, please, whatever you do, don't get it on me. Just a little bit on me, I wiped it off. I said, please don't get it on me, because this is going to be my fucking outfit for tomorrow. Yes, I did. You did not, you wanted it for good. You didn't. You didn't. <laughs> you didn't say that I couldn't. Last time you were over here, it was standard practice. You didn't uh, say that I couldn't is such a wild yeah. thing to say after doing that. What the hell, man? Didn't you read the waiver I made you sign when you came in here? It says I can do this. Yes, I did. Well, I did. I had no reason to be mad at you. I told you. I told you that, and then we sat down and I fucking watched the movie and I was asking you questions. And I told you that from the second visit that I'm going to ask questions about this. No, just because I'm not a movie person doesn't mean I don't like movies. It's just I don't fucking care to watch every single movie out there. Yes, there are few and far between that I do like. I'm not here to fuck with you. I'm not. I told you before I watched this, I said, you. Why is it that you can say whatever you want and whatever you want? What if they keep doing this? I'll be at home for my I'm not going to do that. Where did you learn how to be at home? I'm not going to do that. 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 I'm not going to on your fucking lap. Don't want to do a sport. How do you want a half shot? How do you want a half shot? It wasn't a half shot. Okay. Will you stop? Will you stop? That's what you're going to do. 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 That's it was, and you could have literally cut my fucking arms and my legs and my chest and felt it. This isn't about me. I'm trying to watch the movie that you like. I already told you, Josh, I'm not good at watching movies. And you get He's mad the worst at, me. at it. It's hard. It's a hard thing to do. Yeah, I think so too. <clears throat> it's so It's so hard to sit down and watch a movie focus especially when it's a i guarantee you this bitch would watch a movie that she's interested in she's just saying this 
because she wanted to be difficult about Tombstone. I'm, I'm almost like 100% that she just wanted to make Tombstone a difficult process. She's asking a bunch of fucking questions and bullshit. Why not just sit there and watch it? If you didn't understand it, watch it again. What the fuck is... Uh, so what, Josh has to walk you through the whole fucking movie? Basically, basically. Which, honestly, if he was so fond of it, why wouldn't he enjoy that? That's wouldn't another that just... good point, too, yeah. You feel like he'd love doing that. Like, he'd be able to... Something else had to have happened here. I think Absolutely. That she, she popped off on him for spilling a drink on her. And that's the crux of this. That's the core of this argument was that. I think so. But yeah, no, that's that's yeah. the crazy, some crazy. That's shit, it's bro. that's basically it, honestly. I mean, they they keep arguing for a while. She gets back on the phone with uh, the pay pig, and yeah, that's it. I mean, just another twenty minutes of. I'll probably do like a big old live stream on Josh here soon, <laughs> where I watch all his shit from recent. So I have a tweet here ready to be sent. Uh, okay. Says I think we need to talk at TX2 official. Notorious online predator Nova Online, see picture below, has been making a lot of radical claims about you of late. He met you at your concert the other week and since then has been telling thousands of his TikTok followers that you were incredibly racist and creepy in your interaction with him. Nova- All of which is true, I mean. Nova, Nova claims. <laughs> hold up, hold up. <laughs> Yeah, Nova claims <laughs> Nova claims you allegedly made a joke about Indians and then smacked his boob. <laughs> this needs to be addressed immediately. <laughs> oh no! Oh no, bro! This is this is terrible. <laughs> Go for it! Go for it! Absolutely, that's what happened. He refused to sign his tits and smacked him instead and, and, and said some horrible shit. Terrible shit if no's yeah. to be believed. I'm talking about gas stations and stuff. It was just awful. <laughs> just slapped them titties. Yeah, that was good shit. Did, please tell me you sent that. I did now. Oh <laughs> we gotta see this. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the message needs to be spread, so I'd highly recommend that if any of you have Twitter accounts that you go and you repost this, I'm going to do it myself right now. Um, Man, no, that next TX2 concert so... is going to be, or TX2 meet and greet is going to be really fucking awkward. <laughs> okay, let me get it clipped here so I can just throw it up on screen. I mean, oh, yeah. it happened. Please go no. spread the word. Repost, like. No, Nova, Nova. That's crazy, bro. Yeah. I but TX2 see. needed to know. That's that's fair. They do. They need to be aware. Here we go. I'm, it, it's uploading. There we go. Damn. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Well, I, I just read it's it. Never, it's appropriate. If you guys like, would just just like it, you know. No. Yeah, no, no. If we we need this one, uh, we need this one to reach the masses. It's an important message. Um, <laughs> I mean, if, if they're gonna talk shit on him, he's gonna talk shit right back. You gotta you gotta be fighting. Gotta, no, but I really hope that's fight. I really hope that's not a lie either, bro. Because I bet you TX2's legal team is no one to fuck with. Yeah. Where is he? <laughs> the elite. Nova? Come on, Nova. What do you Nova, have to say? You? Oh, he's probably frantically writing a tweet to, to counteract what's going on with TX2. <laughs> oh, man. Nova was... People are still commenting on his tweet saying, Nova was cranking hogs at your last show. <laughs> One, two, Nova's coming for you. <laughs> Dude, you got called gay by the one and only Nova Cadre. Man, you gotta say something. (laughs) (laughs) 
The one and only. And then there's an actual person who hates him who says, you know, a real punk wouldn't call themselves a punk, dumbass. They don't give a fuck what people think of them. You were probably the least punk person out there, dude. How much you respond to controversy on your name and complain about people disliking you. That no guy way. really fucking hates him. We gotta get that guy on the show. <laughs> we get... That guy would go off. Yeah, this is what I'm saying. So maybe this TX2 guy will be like, who the fuck is this predator calling me out? Yeah, Sounds he needs likely. to know. He needs to know. And know that, like I said, you should probably, you know, you should probably address these claims too, considering you've been making all of them. And... Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pretty disturbing stuff. I haven't seen anything out of him, but we'll see what he has to say. Um, You know what? I don't think it's your tism. I think it's that dog in you, Nova. I think that's the reason all this is happening, because you got that dog in you, dude. You'll, you'll beat TX2, don't worry. You've got him beat. And on that note, we got a couple other people to cover. What do you think it's time to move on? Yeah, I mean, well, Chris, we can really just talk about like how he, yeah. he reacted to the Trump and Kamala debate. And I swear to God, like, I'll set, we don't, we're not going to watch it because really the only thing that that stream is good for is as a, set, a way to watch the debate. Cause he doesn't say like a fucking word at all. Um, and in it, like for the first 10 minutes, they say nothing where Chris says nothing. And then they bring up Springfield, Illinois and Chris just goes, ha, ha, Springfield, ha, ha. like that's where the Simpsons live. And that's, that's all, that's really all he says for a while. And it's, just, it's hilarious because it's, it's one of those things where Chris, he thinks this will be a great idea to get some eyes and some views in there, but he doesn't know what the fuck he's watching. <laughs> He's just like. Why, why does she look like Pepe? Oh yeah. So as you can see here, he, he, ha frog, he has though. a clear he has a clear <laughs> favorite candidate, and he decided to draw his own Kamala Harris son. Now I assume this is because he just didn't want to go out and buy one. Uh, but yeah. No, he's yeah. a fucking famous artist. What is Michelangelo <laughs> gonna you know? Not paint his side. Fuck. But that tweet is getting a lot of fucking, a lot, a lot of <laughs> shit. Yeah, yeah, we need some shit. <laughs> <coughs> Guys, for real, if you have Twitter accounts, repost. Umaga smoking grab has said Nova deleted the video, but there's a number of people who've seen it. <laughs> no, he deleted the. Oh, the one where he talks shit on. Oh, on TX2, TX2, yeah. The more he goes wow. crazy about him. This is crazy right here, though. I mean. The amount of detail, I guarantee you some ween will have this snatched up by the end of the night. Oh my god, I can't, there's no way it's still there right now. Yeah, yeah. There's just, not a shot. Look at all, he put a lot of work, he put more work into this sign than he's put into Sonichu in the past five years. Yeah, and you'd think that's the most interesting thing about this picture, but it's not. Oh, Let me it's go back not. to the other one. So, you, know, you guys see this picture time. here. And there's people in the chat, there's people in the chat, Kiwi, who are going to know what the hidden mm -hmm. little Easter egg in this picture is. But if you're watching it and looking on screen right now, you're probably not able to tell what it is. However, if you zoom in right above the Kamala Harris sign, right near the, right above the trash can, you will see a fucking cryptid. Creepy looking <laughs> Barb Chandler just staring right into your soul. And like for real, Barb looks like Chris in this picture. Like it looks it more like Chris than fucking Chris does. This I was about to say that. I think this looks exactly like Chris. <laughs> this is some fucking shit you see in like one of those like like paranormal things, like, oh look at this face in the window, like holy shit. Like, this so is real, one of those though. movies about scary old people is what this yeah. kind of gives me. <laughs> this is fucked. Wow. I, I, you know, it, it, it's like we were talking about. We've been hearing a lot of rumors that he's been visiting her often. So it's just weird. It's uh, very weird. It, it's just weird. I don't know how he's allowed back there. I don't know what's gone on, what the family's been told, what actually happened. It throws a lot of things into question, if you ask me, just, like, being completely truthful here. Like, if he's allowed to come back and visit her so much, I, I don't know, something's weird. Something is weird here. Oh, it definitely is. I, I, I don't um, know if I should delete that tweet or not. <laughs> yeah. 
I mean, it's all in Minecraft. <laughs> to to an extent, <laughs> yeah, yeah, um, yeah. No, it's 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 one of those pictures where, like I said, it's it's so creepy. But then you gotta remember, yeah, the backstory of it. That he is back in Branchland. Some some odd shit. Some odd shit. Why he's allowed back there is beyond me. I don't yeah, know. it's funny, chat, but it's it's there's there's other angles to this, but yes, yeah, no, it's it's odd. It's it's not my problem. Yeah, it's absolutely my problem. I <laughs> would I would think that like the issue is because yeah, everything was dropped, right? But I think the issue might yeah, be is yeah, like why didn't Barb file something against him? That's what's weird. Oh, she dude. never wanted to. You could tell she never wanted to. She um yeah. Yeah, yeah. I uh, th- there's also the question of why she never like say anything. Be like, no, he never did anything to me. Uh, could that have gotten him out of it? Who knows? I don't Who know. Knows? It's like there's. It feels like there's three poss. <sighs> there's three possibilities. It feels like it's like, and any. I don't know. I don't even. I almost don't even want to talk about the three possibilities. You know, <laughs> but it's like it, it could have happened. It could have not happened. Or he, she could have been in on it. Like that's. I feel like the three opportun- options of what could have happened. And uh, I don't know, dude. Him coming back there so much. What do you. What? What is it, the Twitter? <laughs> They're blowing him up now, too. They're blowing up TX2's page with all these Nova memes and shit. Guys, cut it out. We gotta go to Twitter and see this. Oh, okay, gotta... let me. Let me see. <laughs> it might be some of the. Like, what is this? What is this? I can't stop digressing tonight, bro. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let me see here. Just the replies to your tweet? <laughs> you gotta go to his page, too. Oh. You gotta go. <laughs> and then look at his most recent tweet that says, I am the punkest of all time. <laughs> Nobody is... <laughs> <laughs> Who tweeted the Chris Griffin video? I haven't seen the Chris Griffin video. Where's that? Yeah, I'm almost afraid to like. I gotta, I gotta rank these. Yeah, it's all just it's it's. Novus cranking his hog at your last show. I understand. I'm ending myself tonight. <laughs> Nova loves her senpai. It's just a picture of a. Uh, Nova here. Oh shit, I just watched the Chris Griffin thing. <laughs> what does he say? Dude, you uh, got you called gay by the listen, one and only. Listen. Are you a pedophile? <laughs> are you a pedophile? <laughs> <laughs> you guys are tripping. You guys are tripping. Uh, one, two, Nova's coming for you. Nova needs his treats, people. Are, I'll, I'll read the ones <laughs> to my... I'll read the ones to mine now, too, because there's like 50. One more. I just (laughs) saw a little girl on TikTok making a video (laughs) about you. (laughs) Oh, my God. What do we got here? Anything else? I saw a TikTok about this Nova guy, and he has an accomplice (laughs) that might be his brother or cousin by the name of Dark Nova, and they have both been (laughs) saying some disturbing things and have said racist things about Mexicans taking their jobs at Walmart. Wow. That's <laughs> fucked up, Nova. That is. I can't believe he's not here right now to tell us. Sounds like I wrote on. that. Yeah, I know. Nova could be clearing this all up, but you wouldn't believe the stuff he said about you. It's disgusting. Saw something yeah. about how Nova was upset that you didn't sign his tits when you met him. He was pretty pissed, too. I gotta say that. I heard that he he called some guy... uh couple of nasty words in the parking lot that I can't repeat here because of it. <laughs> what, what a fucking disaster. Okay, let's let's uh let's see what the people have to say here. Yeah. Yeah, goddamn. Yeah, it's been a crazy night. We've already It's been, been a funny one. Hours. Yeah, I I've had a lot of fun. I've had a lot of fun. Lots of news. Nova lost his job. Jupiter's back on TikTok and Josh and Jessica are officially over. Big couple weeks here. Has Big been. Big couple weeks.
And it only it only serves to show that every time we think shit's about to get like boring or whatever, it always kicks back up. So we will see. Oh what shit! Happens. They're saying world of t-shirts. That Josh is Park. true. Yeah. Well, we really only had one clip of him to show, and that's the uh, put the fries Freezing. in the bag, and then and then I'll he just attacks, attacks, and fucking goes after that woman on the streets. I'll kick your butt, lady. And she just fucking bolts. I'd love to see her angle of things. Nova said, you're the next Davi Vanity. Thoughts? <laughs> heart, heart, heart after that. Nova is live talking mad shit about you ever since he met you. Yeah. That's just so to the point. Nova's going to beat you up, leave you for hours, then come back and beat you up again. Nova said, you're about as punk as the Bee Gees. It's true. <laughs> See here. Block. Smokey's just dying over there because you guys just tweets. You're doing phenomenal. You're doing great, man. It just, it just hit me. The confusion. This guy's gonna. gonna <laughs> <laughs> He's not gonna know anything. I'm like, what the fuck is going on here? What yeah, is happening? You guys are killing it. You guys are killing it. You made Smokey's night. <laughs> People always ask us, they're like, man, why do you guys only go after, like, your covered low cows and all? It's like, well, now we're taking Not our. Anymore. dip <laughs> Dipping into the music industry. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Nova, for giving us an idea. Can we get a TX2 watch? We have an Aussie watch, and you're doing a phenomenal job, Aussie watch, but. That's we need true. A TX2 watch, because. I don't know. It's like I said, just get a, get some vibes from that one. This but video yeah. is so odd, dude, because if you were to watch this and not know who World of T-Shirts is, you'd think this is a bit, because it seems like he just turns on, like, he's like, he, he, he kind of like looks up and he's like, whatever, and then just on a whim, he just fucking gets up and breaks for it and just starts snapping, and like, I'm telling you, like, had you been watching this with no, like... No fucking acknowledge of who World of T-Shirts is. You really would probably think this guy's just faking it. But if you know anything about Josh, he's not. This shit really pissed him off. Some random woman telling him to put the fries in the bag. It's crazy. This pisses him off so bad, and it's his own catchphrase, and he tells it to like literally everybody. He's so egotistical, man. That's what I've realized about all this. Is like his ego is out of control. He thinks he's some gigantic celebrity because. Mr. Bass doesn't around help. New York City. Yeah, it doesn't. Mr. Bass doesn't help anything. He encourages him to do all yeah. kinds of fucking shit that's bad for him. You got a tattoo, is... dude. You got that tattoo. He's like, yeah. Josh, you think this? You think you're the most famous person to ever get a tattoo from this guy? Hey, guy, guy, is Josh? You think Josh Block's the most famous person you ever gave a tattoo to? Like he's such a douche. And Josh just he hears that, and Josh just smiles and looks at him the same way he did at that McDonald's employee right dude. before he told him to put the fries in the bag. What's so crazy is that Mr. Based comes in here and he's just like looking for love and praise. He's like, oh, these guys, I can't do as good an accent as you, but oh, these guys are going to fucking do a world of t-shirt stream. Surely they're going to talk about how great Jason Eitzler is and how he didn't have any hand in killing a woman. Surely nothing. And then he got the exact opposite. And he's like, oh, yeah, you guys are a bunch of fucking nobody weirdos. Like, what do you mean, dude? You look like. I've, I've always said it, but he just looks sickly. Like, he's going to drop any minute. He does. Mr. Bass really does. Yeah, it looks like you got something in prison from all those fucking Crips and Bloods who were known to, uh, you know, nothing more sick. Oh, yeah, no, they were getting down with it. They were getting yeah. down with it. Yeah, for sure. I mean, Jason wasn't unemployed in the pen. He had a full-time job. <laughs> we'll just put it that way. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you hear her put the fries in the fucking bag. She just being, you know, funny. Yeah, and big fan of World of like, T-shirts. Hey, would you like my number? It's like, I'll fucking whip your ass, lady. Get yeah. out of here. It's a yeah. homeless schizophrenic shit, dude. Instead of being like, thank you for being a, a fan yeah. of my TikToks. Like, he re he reacts the way he chooses to here. I'm on the tour. I'm on the tour sometime. But he's just one of the most egotistical people ever. And he's turned into daniel it, it's it's the truth like he's turning into a worse version of daniel 
damn. Oh yeah, he's getting there. It's it's getting bad, dude. It's getting bad. He's a full blown alcoholic. I'm not afraid to say it. He gets the shakes when he doesn't drink. So I I don't know what's going on here. This video is fucking wild. Here we go. You put the fries in the bag. I'm gonna kick your butt. <laughs> I love that war cry, bro. Yeah. That girl had to be terrified when he started charging at her. I have a very particular way I imagine him charging at someone, just like arms locked at like a 45 degree angle, kind of hopping from side to side at them <laughs> rapidly, just imposing. <laughs> We've seen Josh run on a few occasions before. When he runs, yeah. he kind of like, with every step, he kind of nods his head to the <laughs> side of which leg is going up. So he's like kind of <laughs> wobbling his head as he runs. It is as I wacky did. as you'd assume. She wants your house. I just fucking love that war cry. She wants your house. Yeah. <laughs> she wants your house and ten dollars. It's the home system. This guy. Oh, whatever. Oh, just, oh gee whiz. Well, Browning just subscribed on YouTube. He told me to he's... put the fries in the bag. Clarissa Dot explains it just And he's still wearing that same shirt in Spain right now. What a fucking lunatic. This poor bitch, she didn't even know it was coming, guys. No, no. She, no, she thought she coming. was just being cute. She thought she was going to be like, oh, he's going to turn around and be like, ah, that's funny. No. No, he was not. No. Not She'd probably funny. ask for like a selfie or something afterwards. You know, oh, could I get a selfie? No. I'll fucking kick your butt, lady. Yeah, he hates that shit. When no. any, any fan or anyone comes up to him and asks him for shit, we gotta go. Dude. We gotta go. I can't. No, no. I, do, I don't have time when, for this. Remember when he did that to Mr. Based months yeah. ago before they yeah. started streaming like this? Mr. Based comes up. I think fucking World of T-Shirts threw his drink on him or something, bro. And, he did. and ran he away. Did. Yeah. And, and he was trying that shit like here. He was trying it now. But I don't know. But my thinking is that Quinn, uh, his original handler, is kind of like taking a step uh, behind the scenes a little more because he's getting roasted so yeah. fucking hard, dude. That shit was legendary when people would put filters over him coming up out of the water, whipping his hair. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm it's, sorry. It's, no, the no, it's been shit. It's him, Mister Bass. They all got their hands on Josh in some way, and. This shit just continues. Like, when he gets back to the U.S., he'll just be back doing this shit again. Right now, he's overseas. He's enjoying his vacation. But it won't be forever. Mr. Bass will have his hands back on him in no time, and he'll just keep doing shit like this. Yeah. Exactly. It's just, it's it's the great cycle of things. Yeah, I like that's, this picture more. I think we should show this to That's a great one. That's a great one. Things out here. It's, uh, it's almost like he's back. Yeah, he's right here with us. <gasps> Yeah. Oh, Toad Smokes Perps. Thank you so much, brother. As Fuck always, yeah, Toad. Long time legend, Toad. Um, I hope you got to give Nova a piece of your mind as always and remind everybody about uh, what they need reminded of. Thank Hell you yeah. For thank you, Toad. Ships. Mandrid, thank you for coming a member, dude. Fuck Appreciate yeah. You. Nathan, Nathan. Seeley. Yeah, about yeah, that C playing her Wendy's <laughs> Vangina game. She needs to be prosecuted in reference to her stealing Pedro Pascal's genetics with her mouth satellite. <laughs> that sort of attempts of murder, no matter what dirty German race she is. It is. It is. She's playing those Pedro Pascal games of of of, of race of race stealing. It's crazy. <laughs> what a fucking message, Nathan. You did. You had me at Pedro Pascal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, happy! <laughs> Thank you for the five, dude. Thank you for the five. Oh my god! <laughs> I just have to crack up. Happy! Thank you so much. I just have to crack up that that tweet from TX2. His one had four replies when I like just about yeah. like ten minutes ago. It now no, has forty two. <laughs> no, we're gonna boost it. We're gonna boost it. Yeah. I'm surprised that Nova's not here. I think he might be a little upset. Yeah, no, I think okay. he is too. It's Happy though, thank you, fun. brother. You legend. Yeah, it is. Haha. <laughs> Roboto son, thank you for the five gift you legend. Been seeing your videos you've been putting out lately. You should go check out Roboto son. Always good shit, man. Always he's, good uh, shit. 
going after Andy right now. That shit's hilarious. Phantasma, happy Wednesday to high fam. Kiwi, uh, you always talk about my cat. Here's a picture of Vegeta and JC. Oh, that's awesome. Have a great stream. That's sick. I take it Vegeta's the one staring menacingly <laughs> in the camera. Oh, and then Phantasma then, drops to five. Thank you, Phantasma. Yeah, thank you so much, Phantasma. And I hope that uh, Vegeta and JC are doing well. All right, Stingy. Dude, I saw you talking about how we used to call you Stingy. Yeah. Yeah, All right, times, Stingy. The times have fucking, fucking changed. I don't have the worst dyslexia on YouTube. Uh, you know, I think we know who has that, but uh, it's close. <laughs> Just call me David with the 10. Thank, thank you. This you, is Dave. another long time legend. You know, if you were gifted by these people, be sure to thank him in the chat. David has gifted up a lot of memberships. He is one of the iconic Davids at this point. We appreciate you as always, brother, and I hope that you're well. Shirk, David. Shirk with Jesus Christ. Christ. Shirk, you've been way too kind tonight, dude. Not, <laughs> you really like have, say, man. You know, I, I hope that you're taking care of yourself first, but 50 fucking memberships for the chat. We appreciate you. Just tons of memberships tonight. Honestly, thank you to everybody who gifted memberships. We're going to thank you all individually, but this is crazy. I always appreciate it. It is, shit. man. Shirk, it's always unbelievable, brother, yeah. the amount of support you show us in the chat, bro. Just thank you. I'll have to get some more stickers queued up. That's what I'll have to do. Sadie finally got a membership. Yeah, if you're here, you know, and you watch uh, often, it usually happens, Sadie. So it's just a matter of time and turning on that little thing. That's awesome. Auburn gifts five memberships. Thank Hell you, yeah, Auburn. Auburn. Auburn, do you think that this Jessica shit's come to an end, dude? I, I think it has. As I, I know that you've been watching basically the whole time, so I think this is the end. Uh, I could definitely see it from Smokey's perspective where it's like the power of the Wendy's Baconator is just... You know, something to behold. But, uh, I don't know. I think Josh has had enough, finally. And if he hasn't... We can only hope. God we can only fucking him. hope, dude. Horror Emporium. Horror Emporium Thank with the you, five. Bro. Horror, Thank man, you've been gifting up, like, every week. Thank you, brother. Yeah, for real. Um, I don't know, like, that, that, I've always said it, but that is, like, a sick channel icon. I don't know if, like, you do, you have a YouTube channel yourself, I'll have to check it out sometimes, but, like, that would make a perfect little channel icon. Yeah, it's it was sick. I always, I always say people should get into YouTube. It's like one of my favorite things. To do. It really is something shit. cool that yeah. If you have a passion yeah. about something you want to talk about, go for it. Exactly. Paid in boredom. You tough twenty. You every of a week we're paid. Paid's always <laughs> yeah, there. And paid's always one of the real. And we just, lit. we love having you here as part of the team, man. Every week. He's lit. I love paid in boredom. Cue the fucking predator meme where we just yeah. slap you son of a bitch you know <laughs> uh it's good shit dude i always enjoy seeing that smiling face here and thank you for gifting up 20 memberships we appreciate that a lot fuck yeah bazooka brother. another bazooka just all the, the goats 10. yeah goats all the goats coming out in full effect tonight man bazooka thank you for dropping telling the people too my brother yeah dude you are a g bazooka and you know i'll always be appreciative because you taught me a little bit of final fantasy lore yeah and every time i look at that i think of uh just the viciousness of that little creature. They're fucking evil, bro. <laughs> stingy stingy with again another. with the five. Thank Hell you, yeah, stingy. stingy. Thank you, dude. You are a fucking goat. As always, be sure to go check out Stingy's channel. He's a legend. Always doing cool shit. Appreciate you, Stingy. Hillbilly Wizard with the 50 fuck God Hillbilly. This damn. is guy who's way too kind every week. Hillbilly always is, and Hillbilly's one of the OGest of OGs. Man, it's like I can't even can't even imagine a time doing these streams without Hillbilly being here, and it's something I don't want to imagine. Mm -hmm. It's been lit having you there here, here the whole time, brother. God damn, that last dab <laughs> fucked me up. I, uh, I'm going to do another happens. after this, because Hillbilly always wanted me mm -hmm. to do them dabs. He um, does want dabs. Fucking man. The fucking man, Hillbilly. Thank you, brother. He does want dabs. Uh, I fucking respect that shit. But Hillbilly, I think, is like my third channel member, which is wild. That's wild. <laughs> I, see, I see a lot of you guys have been around, like, fucking over a year now that's crazy or i think six something one of those big goals it's crazy to see how many people have been in here that long Sh shirk david hermaphrodite dude offed himself while i was at the host jesus christ that sounds horrific i'm yeah, so fucking terrible. sorry dude i'm so fucking sorry about that i hope that you're oh, like everything's good man but I, I that that just sounds awful i'm so sorry i don't i don't really know um, yeah, we just hope you're okay, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. 
Cobra did it for the Wendussi. Come on, the Wendussi. Come on. Then <laughs> naked and laughing took his bussy, pegged him in his yeah, pegged him in his yeah. <laughs> it happened. Came into this world as a reject. Like, look at the lyrics of that whole song, Did It For The Nookie. I, it's just called Nookie. Um, Fred Durst is the voice of a generation, by the way. I don't care what anybody says. <laughs> yeah, he, he did it all for the Nookie. It fits Josh so perfectly. Listen to the lyrics. Toad knows him. It really does. Save the really tubes. <laughs> no, you're already in hell. There is no being saved. Oh, no, God, no. It's already done. Apple, thank you so much. That's nightmare fuel. <laughs> it's like some shit you'd take some acid and just see an apple on your counter. Remember the chat, Bowser. <laughs> exactly. I would never forget. It always needs reminding. It'll probably be said until the very last episode. What have I done to you? I'm washing my face. <laughs> the She's, always She's always innocent. She's always innocent. The nookie, come Shashi. on, the nookie, Joshy. <laughs> Oh, Joshy yeah. the Nookie. Hey, Tubes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Tubes. <laughs> oh, God. Ew, hey, Andy. YouTube. You should do an Andy video. I've always thought that. You I've, I've been wanting to. I've been wanting to. I think that's one of the next ones I'm going to work on. Yeah, it's definitely. I want to do my uh, like a big World of T-shirts one where I cover all of his history. It's going to be good, man. That'll be really good. That. But, uh, yeah, this is one of my favorite Andy clips. If we can get 500,000 likes, <laughs> I will eat poop. He's a dude, god yeah. damn it. <laughs> but Nova but, smoked 305 menthol 100. That's a lot of menthol 100. I don't know if Nova can handle that. He's mad at us tonight. I don't know why. It's not like we haven't been defending him on Twitter. <laughs> Loving the intro <laughs> tunes, rock on, boys, mm -hmm. BS, white pals, it's a friend. Thank you, brother, all around. Intros always rock. Intros always rock. That's lit. It, yeah, they always go hard. Like, legit, I, I love them. I, I told Smokey, I'm like, we need Nookie this week. And I didn't yeah. expect <laughs> him to make such a banger out of it. It was beautiful. You know, it was a good call. It was a good call for the song. It fit, like you said, it fit him perfectly. Nova trying that one. They'll see, like, the creamy filling is a little salty but tasty. Oh, and needs God. more Dr. Pepper. I rate it an 8.5 out of 10. For real, that David, reverse. Final. It really, it would have gotten the 10 had it had that Dr. Pepper. They were fucking up. They were fucking up. You make me sick, David. I love you, brother. <laughs> and then he drops <laughs> 20, 20 on the people. God damn. Man, that's fucking... I thank you, Reverse. Of the pre I can't stop yeah, no, it's gross. Page. But thank you, brother. Oh, dude. We appreciate the 20 memberships of Million. This guy's another unsung go. Can we get some hype in here for Lou... Luard Reverse David? Much love. All the 20 people. Let's, Plenty let's of Davis Brown. It's another go right there. Josh knows how to molest the guitarist <laughs> like a pro. He did. He did. He did. He, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. David, David Mongoose. Mongoose. I'm glad this one. caught on in some small That did. Way. That's some I, funny shit. Who needs Wendy's Dornash tubes and a Jessica on speed down? Yeah, yeah that's what yeah. fucked him. That's what fucked him, David the Panda. S Saving me thousands. Should have just got that Dornash. Nyla Moon. Nyla Moon. Yeah, God, it's been around for a grip. For real. I was about to say, I'm like, welcome back. Yeah. Mini Cone. Ah, Mini Cone Fuck drops man. to five. Fuck yeah, brother. Blessed up five homies, man. Blessed us up. Thank you. Appreciate you for the five, Mini Cone. Oh. <laughs> Would you guys get Bush for not yeah. going to get... <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you you know, want to know a wild, a wild, wild, wild stat here? I tweeted uh, that tweet. Uh, it's, <laughs> someone's pointed out to me. On the East Coast, it was 9-11 p.m. on 9-11. <laughs> we tweeted that out. So, like, all the stars aligned. I'm pretty sure TX2 might So we're sending a clear this. message to TX2 <laughs> that we're not to be fucked with. Yes. yes. And uh, necessary actions may need to be taken. We chose this day specifically. Yes. <laughs> we yes. played when we started Two Eye for Stupid mm -hmm. right after 110 Autism a year and a half ago. It was all for this day right here. If you guys knew anything about us, you'd know that we're we're ones to plan everything out in advance extremely. Every every planned. step, every step of the way. Yeah. One night at the Wilkins household, no power, just a flashlight, and one week at Jupiter's place. 
Oh my Cyrax God. isn't a threat. He's an, you could he'd be more scared of you than you would be of him. Be like Ed Resident might be Evil. a problem. It would be like Resident Evil. Ed might be Fucking a problem. The Bakers are just but, the Wilkins. <laughs> but the flashlight's a weapon and one cracked Iraq. I mean, it's he, it's over. Like I said, his his bone structure is not yeah. one that. Can well, let's take be clear. Are we getting like a, are we getting like a cheap little plastic flashlight or like you know, a weapon? I'll be flashlight? I'll be honest with you. I don't think it matters. Depends how you hold it. <laughs> You're right. You're absolutely right. But yeah, a you metal one would shine be it in vicious. his eyes. When you bring it up uh, that way, though, it's like a metal one really would just set the mm-hmm. fucking that would really tip the scales in your favor because then. You're you're going against Sally, Ed, and Cyrax. Like, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, wouldn't be surprising. I wish nah. Jupiter had some sense of self awareness. <laughs> yeah, nah, that's that's part of what makes him so beautiful. But also, it's what's holding him back from like really realizing he's a piece of shit. He'll yeah, never he realize never. that he's nope. wrong. Never. If he did have a sense of self awareness, then uh, shit would be. That's just how I see it, dude. I mean, Jupiter's like lack of self awareness, I think, trumps every other low cow. Just how he's so things go over his head so much more than any other. You know, Bo right here, he he's a little more quick with it. It'd be like, so are you guys trolling me? Um. Meanwhile, he's been like sucking off the mic the whole interview. So we could ask him the same question. Yeah, he was the biggest troll in the world. Yeah, he's the biggest fucking troll ever. He totally ruined everything. Yeah, no, and then now he, now his relationship with his favorite music mm-hmm. artist is probably ruined because both of them are being creepy. It's wild. Just Blaze says that's in the past, Kiwi. I'm a changed man. <laughs> <laughs> Liam, thank you for the twenty, dude. And that's that's great. Like that is a great thing to ponder. Mikey the Mutt. Thank you. Mikey That's a sick looking dog. It is, man. Looks like a little bear. Spa. <laughs> you got a new. I got one a story. Today. I got Please. no. I got. I. I actually do have one. Okay. okay I do have okay. one. Okay. So, I had a job in college. It was in this little shopping, like shopping district, like probably like eight, nine stores in that bitch. And it was around Christmas time, and there's a Chinese laundromat. And the guy always, always was like, yo, like, when they put, like, the like Christmas trees out and, like, decorations on stores, he'd always bitch to the owners of, like, whoever owned, like, the place. And they'd always have to go around and be like, look, the guy doesn't want decorations up, yada, 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 we don't want to hear from him and all that stuff. So, the one day I'm at work, and I'm out on a smoke break, and, like... <laughs> I know you're fighting the urge not to do an accent right now. No, I no, there was not actually dead ass. Coming out was, complaining about a, a Christmas tree. Oh no! Well, yeah, I know you you're said, that's, hearing it. I know, but there's no. It, you'll see. There's no need for it in this story. Um, <laughs> so I'm sitting there. I'm smoking a cig, and like this is like so. This is like going on on Facebook and all too. People are talking about how like oh fuck this guy and stuff. So people know about this, and here comes some kids like from the neighborhood, I guess, and <laughs> they have a Christmas tree. <laughs> and um and the guy the guy i'm working with taps me on the shoulder he's like look at this and we're looking down there and they walk right in that bitch and just two of them grab it and just throw the christmas tree <laughs> and bro bro the guy immediately comes out with the christmas tree and the one as soon he throws it like on the curb and i'm telling you before it even hits the ground the one kid grabs it and rushes right back in the store <laughs> <laughs> it was. I remember just sitting there smoking. I remember we called our boss over and shit. We're like, "Look at this! Like, is there fucking giving this guy hell right now for no reason?" And like, it's just, like, yeah. It was, but yeah, he was, and it was nothing about like. The, I don't even think these guys, these kids, knew about it. They were like, "Let's just go fuck with someone with this Christmas tree." No, and way. they, they had to have known. They had to have known that this guy was like some kind of Grinch. <laughs> maybe, maybe, but like, I'm just, it's, I just, I just, that second pickup. I, I'll tell you, I like even the dude that was watching it with me. I've never laughed that hard. Like that was so because I did not expect the kid to just run right back in, like charged like a football player with that Christmas tree. Yeah, that Fuck. is that is good shit right there. <laughs> a, you're right. Like what makes it is the fact that the the guy <laughs> came back. Say- 
<laughs> you will MVP. accept Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> you will accept this shit, bro. Like, <laughs> this is happening. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> that was that was, yeah, that that was, that was a good funny one. shit. That was a good one. Christmas trees and spas. <laughs> yeah. How is Jupiter that damn big with that little girl voice? Uh, he does have a very, uh, like, he's got to yeah, have some kind weird. of, like, balance or something, you know, some kind of pituitary. I don't know. Talks like High Pitch Eric sometimes. If you guys have ever heard him from the Stern show, he kind of reminds me of High Pitch Eric. Why would. <laughs> Don't send him to Disneyland. I was about to say, I'm like, no Disneyland for this guy. <laughs> Kozak with the 10. This is a long time. Probably like one of the first membership gifters. Kozak. Fucking legend. Love this man. Always had the same profile pick. It's inside the guitar. Kozak is an unsung hero. And an OG. So, let's get some fuck. Sorry, Chad. I just look, I look at Chad. I'm sorry. Thank you, Kozak. The go yeah, W's. W's. Training backs and biceps at the gym. This helps. Thanks. Oh, yeah, man. It's good. It's going well. It's good shit. It is good shit. Mini Coat and Gun with a five. Thank Jesus you, brother. Christ. With those guns, you are the funeral director. <laughs> Mini Cone, yeah. Yeah. This nice, is... brother. Thank you. I like that name, too. You know, sometimes I'll just hear like a YouTube name and I'm like, that's a good one, you know, Mini Cone. Luby Lou. Uh, I love how you had to speed up Josh to fit Maiden, yeah. I think it was uh, to fit I did, Durst, I right? did. Yeah. Oh, no, to play the music, yeah. Yeah, yeah the fucking the guitar <laughs> solo of, uh, no, of so right. Number of the Beast. You're I've been so waiting right. to use that for like a month <laughs> until we had Jupiter back. And I was like, oh, it's a, it's a Satan song. It's perfect for Jupiter. You should put some edits like that in your videos. Those are killer. I really can with the copyright and music, and that's what... Um, even, oh, like, the true. Nintendo 64 covers sometimes get uh, get, get copyrighted. And, yeah, it's, wow. it's a bitch. It's a bitch. If you're having trouble with that, let me know, because I have a, a good service, which is... All right, it's bet. just called Epidemic, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah no, I definitely, I'm definitely going to need to eventually. I can't keep using all the... I mean, all my videos have copyright music in it, so... But I play it quiet enough to... Yeah, fuck it. Let's not get... Uh, Wubazing yeah. for Wubazing. the 10. <laughs> thank, thank you for the 10 memberships. This guy's another OG. It's just like a long line of OGs. And some new faces coming up, too. That's lit. But Wubazing, we appreciate you for all the support over, like, almost two years we've been doing the show now. It's fucking amazing. And I hope that you've enjoyed it, man. Because we've enjoyed it. It's been a great time. Yeah, so yeah, You're brother. abusing Jupiter. Stop now. Stop now. <laughs> I, I'm starting Andy, to get Andy has angry. a very threatening aura. Yeah, he is the Hulk. That's true. Uh, I'm Larson when the fucking, the likey meltdown. I need my <laughs> team. My team, I need them. <laughs> <laughs> hey, boys, all these cows been on some shit I can't keep up. Space, yeah, dude. Space Marine 2 does feel like you. Oh, lack of cover taking ability. Sometimes <laughs> I, I'm having a good time with it. It's it's a good time. It's a good time. Vera, thank you so much for the ten gift memberships. Appreciate. I I don't think I've seen you here before. I could be wrong though. Um, I am regarded. You know, I have been smoking a lot tonight, but I appreciate you for the ten. That is not the real Andy. They fool us every time. Every time. <laughs> every. I want it to time. be Andy. You guys don't yeah. understand how badly I want that to be Andy, but it's yeah. not. <laughs> Barra, thank you so much for the 10 gift. For real, Puppet thank Master, you. Welcome to the fold, tiny little Jake. Welcome to the brotherly fold, brother. Yeah, brother. <laughs> Jordy. What? I never got a good one out of Nova, where he's like... And I told him he was a sick kid, too. Heart yeah, no. Fuck. No, Nova didn't give a fuck. Jupiter cared more. Dark Nova cared more. Z3PO, <laughs> thank you, brother. Oh, man. I feel. What's that fucking... I feel like that... I don't know. Z3PO, did you upgrade your shit, dude? <clears throat> it looks lit. Hope you're doing well. Wubbazing with the 10 is Nova, but yeah, it's uh, Selenash. He's a little... He's like the people eater for Mad Max. He's always playing with his nipple. Yeah. Showed my sis the vid. And so is TX2, apparently. She gagged. 
<laughs> yeah, your sister almost threw up when she saw Mr. Beast's face. That's a natural reaction. If you're ever trying to like stay skinny, I'd recommend just looking at his face after a heavy meal. It's Frank not a Hassel. bad idea. Uh, yeah, I remember World of T-Shirts hit him. <laughs> Jupiter and Nova boxing match. Who do you think would win? Jupiter versus Nova? My money's on Nova. Uh, I'd take Jupiter. I, I'd take Nova. I feel like Nova um, has been boxing. He's been training. He's very talented in that region. Very powerful with his strikes. So, yeah. I, that'd be a very interesting match. I wonder. I wonder. This is my first live, and I'm loving it. Thank all you boys for the great content. Thank you for, for loving it, Jason G. It's been a fucking blast, dude. And, you know, thank you for watching all the content. I should have a new Cobra video up for members here. Maybe tomorrow or the next day. Should be good. Nice. Bovine Booniverse Band Boopiter Bar Bediters Begging for Forgiveness Buzzing Boo doesn't boob anything. Being better benefits both bodies because behaving brings benevolence. Buck these pedophiles. Backs, bro. Backs. No way am I able to read that shit. <laughs> Cheems Bogar. This is a fucking legend right here. It's good to see you, Cheems. Facts. Cheems the realist. Well. He is, dude. He let me call him Keems for the longest time. Just like Stingy. Those <laughs> poor bastards. <laughs> But thank you guys. He's one of the realists. People love James. F Mary Kill Nova Andy Ditch Jupiter. I mean these are these are always like you know what I'm saying? So I would say I would say you absolutely right. You absolutely have to marry uh Mary how, Jupiter fuck Andy no, Ditch no, kill no. Nova. No, the question is what is like how does Thomas Ditch have no? Because because the one dude's coming in chat asking what? us to start a to start a, a what's it called forum a a fundraiser forum. So they clearly don't have money. So you don't marry Andy Ditch. Uh, what are you Jupiter, talking about? We're trying to find the best reasons to marry each one, to kill each one, to fuck each one. Come on, Kiwi, gotta give the people. I think what it's they want. simple. I, it's simple. You marry Jupiter, you fuck Andy Ditch, and you kill Nova. Let's... This is a real thing that's happening. Like, this is real. Yeah. We're gonna have to marry one of these three dudes. <laughs> like this is happening right now. What? Like, so, <laughs> like, and it's life or death for one of them. It's literally yeah. death, and that's Jupiter, by the way. Nova Jupiter's has dead. already Jupiter's Nova fucking has... dead. <laughs> nah, dude. Nova has already agreed to go to Haiti. So if you're marrying him, you're gonna be a widower real quick. So I don't. So know. So you fuck and marry Andy Ditch. That's the answer. Yeah, I mean. It, uh, Autism's in. I'll be, yes. I'll be trendy. On the There's train the back, Megadeth was so fun seeing Guar tomorrow. <laughs> That's awesome, Jasmine. Yo, I was, I was looking at Cousin David's clip channel the other day. And Jasmine was talking about her RADS test, and that's like... Oh, I saw that. Yeah. I saw that, too. Yeah, and Smokey's <laughs> like, congrats, dude. Great job. Like, we're so proud of you. <laughs> I thought it was a good thing. I thought, yeah. Oh, yeah, that was the funniest shit I'm ever. I'm still convinced it is. Congrats. Yeah. No, it is. Uh, Bro Brutes with the 10 looks like pounds. Drinking a beer and smoking a cig. That's awesome, dude. Beers and cigarettes, that's underrated combo. Like... Whenever uh, I'm hanging yeah, out with yeah. Smokey and we're drinking, I have to bum cigarettes. I can't. Oh yeah, that. I don't. I don't blame. Yeah, I always. Uh, if I'm if we're like out, we're drinking. Uh, I always grab like two to three packs because you never know who's mm -hmm. gonna need cigs if you're drinking. Absolutely. It Thank fucking so sucks for your pockets though. Just not. I I mean, not only money wise, because cigarettes are expensive now, but also because it's. Carrying around three packs of cigarettes. But Nova, please review Galaxy Guess. We've been asking it. for it. We've been asking for it. Mr. Substitute asks why I'd fuck the guy who constantly shits himself. I think that answers itself. Coochie Critters. The new King Cobra JFS sub was banned this week after a post about Jessica. Yeah, dude, you can't have no fucking King Cobra JFS sub anymore. They keep an eye on it. Like, it's, it's a shame. It really is. I... I think that shit has the right to exist, but uh, it's almost like Jessica will go in there under an alt and post personal information for the sole purpose of getting the fucking subreddit taken down. 
you know, the mods aren't going to be able to watch every now, second. How big do these subreddits get before they get taken down? I don't know. I haven't really been on any of the new ones. If I'm being completely honest, I'm out of the loop on that be- end. All right, because we've talked about this for so long, like, I finally had to, like, figure out what this shit is. And so, I know there's a Bowser one. I know there's a Chris Chan one. Mm-hmm. And, like, there's always far-out shit that people send me from these things. How do how do all these not get taken down? Like, the one thing I kept questioning was, remember the whole Mr. Harassment shit? People were yeah, sending me his crazy... The... Yeah, people were sending me his crazy fucking messages every day, and I was like, this is... This is wild. This is just staying up, but okay. Like, I I don't know. I, I, I didn't know Reddit worked like that, but I guess it does. It seems as long as it's not doxing. I don't know. They've got, like, a fire lit under their ass about little cows. Serpent Mongo for the five. Cobra is like the Johnny Silverhand of little cows. He's a rock star with strange charisma, but abhorrently self-destructive. Yeah, and soon to be missing one arm. I couldn't agree, agree more. Beautiful, beautiful enough. He's the least creepy of all the creeps. There's really nothing more about him. Hey, (laughs) Mike, happy birthday, dude. Fucking happy birthday, Mike. Big ups, man. You got the big thank you from the the big uh, happy birthday from Danny, too. My dad works in a tobacco farm. It's pathetic to see this predator waste perfectly. (laughs) I feel you, bro. Hurts my soul. It's it's an insult on the middle class. Milkweed. Thank you for the 10 milkweed. I feel like oh, you've yeah. done this a couple times, dude. Yes. You're a legend for that. For real, milkweed. Legend. Thank you, brother. We appreciate you. Chunk smoking Squad. This is allowed legend. here. Yeah. Smoking is allowed, Chunk Squad. This guy's a right. legend over on the PCL streams. Love Chunk <laughs> Squad. <laughs> Mike Curse ha me ha. Oh, my God. <laughs> Liberty Curse ha me ha, bro. You just feel. And that was directed at Nova. I bet you Nova was in chat at that point. That's an iconic moment, right? When Chris just lets out all his rage. <laughs> Carnizzle, I wish I could tell you, bro. I wish I, I could know. tell you. It seems like they're just it's kind of dragging their feet. I don't know. It's weird. It's allowed him to do a lot more weird shit. Jesus, Jesus wept. wept. He did. He did. He wept about 70 fucking six episodes ago. <laughs> Jesus said unto his disciples, judge not. Lest ye be judged, but judge Earl Doom, because he is a friend. <laughs> My dad was on the bottle when he made when he made him cut me some, cut slack. Me some slack. For when, real. Oh shit! God was drunk. We'll chill. We'll chill on you, God, but don't worry, man. We we do understand yeah. that was a grave mistake. Yeah, honestly, Almighty, we really don't appreciate it. It's kind of a dick move. Yeah, <laughs> to give us this, David uh, again with another ten though. This are all guy. Shit. Yeah, thank you, David. Thank you, brother. Thank you. The cool ass Nintendo sixty four picture. Love it every time <laughs> we see it. <laughs> yeah, we do appreciate you, David. That's like twenty tonight, brother. Thank you, Jasmine. Bro, that's uh, why he's high off the Nick. The cherry is burning the chems in the filter. Oh, maybe, maybe that's what's doing it. True. He's just smoking filters. <laughs> And going wild. Kibi, I sent you a message on X. Big ups, boy. Thank you. I will check my requests. Netyeg, five big ups. Five big ones for the slots in New Orleans. Oh, that'd be nice. I bet Jupiter's girlfriend will be loved by his family like he loved his baby sister, Earl and Jupiter pedophiles. Yeah. Yeah, he's, uh, Jupiter shouldn't be around, like, women, anyone who's, like, yeah, anyone who he can take advantage of because he'll try. He will. He won't hesitate. Yeah. A cot K. New Orleans, re- Nola re- re- uh, represent. Hurricane no Frenzy ends. might take my power, but not my buzz. I guess everyone but the Joshes are puedes nowadays, huh? Wow, that's... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if your name's Josh, you're kind of safe from it. What? I think I've asked this before, but what about Andy? Yeah, there's some weird shit about him. Okay. There is some weird shit out there about him. Uh, he'll, like, stalk around playgrounds. Jeez. Hey, brothers. Sorry for coming up late. Got caught up with work. No need to apologize, dude. Shaquille Oatmeal. <laughs> yeah, I love that name. But, hey, man, you were here. You got to at least watch some of it, and I'm glad you were. Dude, the Shaquille O'Neal guy is just everywhere these days. Fuck, I mean, he's, yeah. Yeah. Shaq, Smokey. Shaq, Shaq does legit everything. Uh, Smokey, you heard the man. Oh, yeah, we'll grab it. 
We'll grab it. You're going first. We'll grab it. I heard Jupiter was called eating someone's dogs and cats. Shoot. Dude, you're letting the Haitians take all the blame. Yeah, cut it out. Nitrous, Nitrous with Cobes. Cobes. Yeah, oh, no. my God. I mean, maybe. Maybe. I mean, have you ever no. done whippets with people? It's like... I do not want to. It's like, you know, just a... You just hear a lot of clinking. You know, it's... I, I don't know. I don't know. They're, I just don't... I, it sounds like a good way to just end up even more retarded than I already am. It does. Oh, I feel <laughs> it's yeah. It's just it's just it's. Uh, you ever seen that meme of like the slow already the slow acting potion of retardation? <laughs> it's kind of like that. But uh, bovine <laughs> bovine reviews galaxy guess. Oh, the fast acting one. My bad. Yeah, the fast acting potion. <laughs> I gotta send you that meme. That meme's hilarious. That is good. That's the Bo best meme. He needs to review Galaxy. It's in right now. Galaxy rocket fuel the planet. Regard. Amen. We already do enough of that with the dabs. All right, stingy. Uh, nangs or whippets. Uh, once in a blue moon thing to try. And even if it's in a blue moon, yeah, it can fuck you up, dude. It can fuck you up. They call them nangs, I guess, over in Australia. Really. But if you have a friend who has like those little CO two cartridges all over in their car, they got a fucking problem. <laughs> like I don't know if you've seen them, the little blue cartridges. Yeah, yeah I mean, dude. like Steve O. The thing is, like I said, those things I don't. It's another one of those ones where I don't really get the appeal. <laughs> Nova should he should have yeah. fuck. That's damn it. Yeah, I'm fed up with this world. Oh, hi, Mark. It was right after he had hit her, but he did not. No, I mean... I swear. What was that bitch's name from that? She was the worst, bro. Who, in the room? Yeah, what was her name? Lisa. The, Lisa was the fucking worst, dude. And that ending, I... That ending is just so fucking, like... Zero to a hundred, man. <laughs> Yeah, oh yeah. It's a classic, though. Oh uh, yeah, Lisa blows, bro. You're tearing me apart, Oh, we should have asked... That's what we should have uh, asked Uva. Yeah, what he knew about, uh, fucking... Tommy. What's... Tommy was O. He might have known something. Someone's had to ask him before. Damn. Yeah. You're tearing me apart. To quote I wish a great we could watch that. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> That'd be a good one. Uh, Kava and Kratom taste absolutely foul. Yeah, Nova doesn't like do. that's fighting words for Nova. Happy birthday once again, Mike. For sure. Yeah, sure. facts, Mike. Happy birthday, brother. Ozzy. Watch Ozzy. He's, still lives. Yeah, he's there. He's still there. TX2 watch though. I don't know. Yeah, coming soon. Regarded Hugh Jackman. Yeah. Yeah, Maybe. Nova was giving off. I mean, I'm um, Jupiter, mm -hmm. but yeah, Dark Nova. I'm sorry. Dark Nova. See you at the next Nambler. Oh, God. <laughs> Yo, boys, whippets are in somehow. I was in Philly at hijinks, and some dude gave me a business card for medical grade NO2. A uh, dude was bringing it right to your house for a party. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. This is that's what's wild. happening to Yay. This is what they're doing to Yay, guys. We can't let this stand. See you in prison. <laughs> You know, they say that he has, like, nozzles installed around his house so that he can just fucking fill a balloon whenever, wherever he Really? Is. Yeah, that's, that's wild. I never heard of that. That's the rumor. Oh, wow. Nova is never so entertaining and not resident sleeper. Oh, wow. Thank you. Is that fucking Tipster? Whose face is that they got pasted over Tipster? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but that is, that is definitely supposed to be Tipster. <laughs> ZD93, thank you so much for becoming a member, brother. I Facts. am Tyler C. Time to go rip a dab because it's 1700 somewhere. Pull yourself something tall and strong, yeah. bro. Making a hurricane. Oh, wow. Oh, well, this, this cross is too heavy. Don't know how Jesus did it. Two out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to ask if someone could give us that art, but it seems sacrilegious to, like, have Nova... 
Nova the on the cross? On the cross. Cruci- crucified. All right. Well, I mean, look, if we're being completely honest here, Nova <laughs> just kind of looks like... Uh, you know what? It's not sacrilegious because lots it's of people the hair. were crucified. Uh, you know, lots, of, lots of people were crucified. This could just be some random Roman citizen from back in the day who's well off and pudgy. It downs yeah. Christ. That sounds like a fucking heavy metal band. Downs Christ. <laughs> yeah, chilling at work. <laughs> Sneaking dabs. Thanks for the great stream and the good vibes. Thank you so much for watching, dude. That's a fucking tricked out gator. Yeah, it's Next. cool gator. Nov's favorite troglodyte here. Nova lies about a majority of his partnerships, although I think you already know that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. He's a liar. He's lied to us so many times. He's a Kiwi fanboy, secretly writes fan fiction. Yeah, you know, it's kind of, I wish he liked Smokey, <laughs> being honest. <laughs> yeah, no, I can already see it now. Yeah. And then the, and then me and Kiwi told Smokey he's not on no, the podcast anymore. No, me and Kiwi. <laughs> <laughs> no way. I've already had, this is the best co-host I've ever had for these shows. My last co-host well, that guy, he's like Green County, for fuck's sakes. Nova, <laughs> hire me as your lawyer. He needs a good one. He needs a good one. He does. So does that the Paladin hour, guy. The Hour of Joy. Yeah, it's always been the Hour of Joy. Phone for the I'm pasture. <laughs> dab time. I'll take a dab. That is true. That is true. I'll take another one after. I'll read the next one. But thank you, Dixon. Dixon's a realist. Dropping the ten on the people. You guys are fucking sick, man. (laughs) (laughs) It's gross, dude. (laughs) Our joy new name, Glory Hole Confessions. Yeah. (coughs) Confessions of a Glory Hole Addict. Alcatraz Sabusa. That double chin coming in nicely, bovine. He's been working out. He has a shrine to Kiwi. I'm not liking this tonight. You guys are fucking... I mean, you can't really blame them. It's Nova. Nova's just hey, fucking... I don't like it. I Nova's like in love bit. with you, bro. I'm telling you, it's crazy. Oh, my God. Uh, about to take a hit out of my unicorn ball. <laughs> oh, you're not going to look what I'm about to do here, but chat. <laughs> chat, look at the screen right now. Who's Nova staring at? <laughs> Who's Nova staring at with all those hearts around him? He's looking right at your avatar, dude. He's got no time for me or Sadie in the corner. He is eyeing you down. He's eyeing you down. In the chat, I, 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 I think that he's looking at the Christian and the Hedgehog boys. <laughs> nah, nah, bro. Not looking at me, dude. <laughs> now you're the one writing fanfic, not fucking <laughs> me, man. So nobody, nobody ever accused me of being the weird one with this shit. Okay. It's like one of those paintings where the nah. eyes follow you. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I don't like this, nah. You changed the name of your fucking show, Nova. Or I'm coming to Spokane. Yeah. Yeah, Nova, you're causing a lot of issues yeah. here for Kiwi, bro. It's going to be are. a problem. You're causing dissent in the ranks. Sadie, <laughs> thank you so much for the five. Nova's a predator. <laughs> Which reminds me of our old TV. He does. He does. <laughs> oh, man. That's I just want, bad timing. Yeah. I look at the screen and notice that. I'm sorry. He really yeah, is. Yeah, He's yeah, yeah. He's staring right whatever. at your guy. Whatever, dude. Go write your fan fix. <laughs> I want to see Nova do robo tabs. Well, you know it. You know it better than us, Fats. I need to do another video on putts. I bet he's been fucking wild lately. Nova's new thing. <laughs> Grade A underage. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, somebody, can we get, like, a, a soy jack or a woe jack of Nova? That would be amazing. Nova has a That'd framed, you know what, I'm not, <laughs> we're not taking any more of these. At, Nova has a framed picture of Kiwi in his room, that's why he won't show you around. Nova and Kiwi, enemies to lovers trope. All right, Jesus Tubes, it's Christ. that time. Ch- I'm just speeding through the fucking... <laughs> All right, tubes. It's time. <laughs> it's time again. Would you rather have Cyrex's teeth or Tony's? No cop outs. I would rather have Tony's. Um, they're less crooked. I always I say like Josh. More, I feel like Tony's more salvageable. Are, I don't know. Yeah, I, both are just. Oh God. 
You're going through hell yeah. either one you pick, you know. Yeah, people are saying new new merch on the way. Who knows? Nova, genuine question. Do you write Kiwi fanfics? I'd totally reread it. Nova is a clown. <laughs> I should. It should change to big lunchbox. Big lunchbox. Amen. Lunchbox live. <laughs> Nova needs to fully embrace the sped from Spokane grind set and finish a 0.6 liter of galaxy gas a day with a full flavor review. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wow. This strawberry get, galaxy gas is really good. You can really taste the strawberryness in this galaxy gas. I sound like Tofia when I do this. <laughs> like, I feel like it's going to be irresponsible of us to do galaxy gas on stream, but... The more we talk That's, about it, the more I crave it. As a regarded man, I crave this shit. Yeah, no, I'm not lying. It's like it's one of them things where I'm like, well, I mean, trying it wouldn't be that bad, right? Like one galaxy <laughs> gas no. wouldn't kill you. No, I don't think so. I think one one maybe like um maybe one or two, you know, or three. Just to get you know, just to get a good vibe of it. Um we should definitely each sample like a different maybe for the for next week's show. I ever tell you I had a friend who did something like that there's another story you ever seen the movie Traffic uh, no it's like uh fuck who's in it um the kid from that 70s show Topher Grace is in it like there's oh you, uh, Eddie Brock you could have just said Eddie Brock yeah when I was thinking well nonetheless there's a, a scene in that movie where they're like smoking dope off of like a off of a piece of tin foil with a straw, and um, nice. and like I remember when we were watching it, it was a few of my buddies in college. My wife just turned it off, and he's like, "I, I gotta go." He's like, "I gotta go." He's like, "I can't do this." He's like, "He's like, no." He's like, he's like, he's like that just looked awesome." And he's like, "I got." He's like, he's like, he's like, so if we watch any more of this, we're gonna end up like, and I, I was thinking there too. I'm like, that was not did not look awesome, but okay. But yeah, this dude got up, turned off the movie, yeah. and just dipped. I didn't think oh, it was yeah. to go buy anything, but it was just like, yeah, I gotta leave right now, or else I'm gonna. I'm Every gonna time I watch Intervention or Train Spotting, I just want to find a needle. Train Spotting's a itch. fucking Ooh. classic. I love that movie. Yeah, dude, I think it's uh, it's Obi Wan's best work, for sure. It's a phenomenal job. Bonehead, thank you so much for the five. We'll put this towards the Galaxy Gas Fund. Very excited for that shit. Very excited. And thank you for the five memberships, as always, dude. Boneheads a go. Auburn, the danger last night at work before going on vacation. Uh, thanks for making the hours bearable. Thank you for always showing up, brother. By this time next week, I'll be off on an island off the coast of Honduras. I'll oh, report shit. back if I found some smoky. You gotta fucking get out of there, dude. That would be know. cool, man. I trust Auburn. I trust Auburn. Yeah. I, said, I have islands in many places. <laughs> that doesn't sound good in this day and age. I... I have many islands with many different purposes in many places around the world. You're clearly just not from from the Great Isle of from the of Hawaii, yeah. From the uh, from you the you 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 Epstein-minded oh, Americans. You, <laughs> Americans. No, this is what I okay. <laughs> All you islanders trying to deflect shit. I see how it is. You I guys don't even is. know it. Like, you think, today everything's all fucking sweet, but it's not going to be so sweet when a coconut's getting thrown through your window. Cobes can't, Cobes can't stay away from that stank windowsy with extra <laughs> grease and gravy. No, he cannot. No, he cannot. It's like some fucking Flintstone <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah, for real. For Chris real. Chris Hansen better not come to my house or he's getting the boondocks. Well, you better read this one, Smokey. Chris Hansen better not come to my house or he's getting the boondocks treatment. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he yeah, is. that's what's up. Trips OG, thank you for the one gift. Much Trips is a long time uh, watcher as well. We appreciate you, dude. Herping people one at a time. Just call me David with the, the 10. 30. That's 30 yeah. tonight, bro. God damn. Yeah, I mean, that is 30 tonight. We appreciate you, David. And if you ever have a message you want read, just let me know, sir. Fuck yeah. Pop it up here. Fuck yeah, David. A-Rog. Jupiter is sensitive to Duke because he's a D-Gen like him. Yeah, it's almost like if, if he admits that Duke is bad, then he's bad. Maybe that's what it is. I think it's just that he can't theory. fathom that, like, his... Like, it's the same thing about his little sister, right? It's like, 
yeah, like, I hope you disappear, but I can never say that because I love you and you're still my little sis. Like, he just holds these people in high regards. If his little sister did something terrible, he would be like, that's terrible, you can't do that, but I still love you and we need to figure this out. Like, he'll, he, he's, no, he would never turn his backs on them no matter what they did. And, uh, shows the type of person Jupiter is, bro. It's not a deal breaker for him. He doesn't mind people being creeps because he himself is a creep. That's why he loves Big Toaf. He does. You're right. I'm not. Sp- I feel no, bad this about crazy. this. Yeah. Going on the, the what was it? The Galaxy Gas Rant? Yeah, what were no. We doing here? Shark, you did not have to do this. None of y'all did, man. This was too <laughs> much. I felt so bad about this hillbilly too. Like Jesus. Yeah, you guys are too kind. Shark, for real, bro. Like and guilt. Charged- and guilt. <laughs> yeah, but uh, Shark, dude, for real. We didn't mean it for that. We never say that kind of shit. We'll never come in front of you guys and be like, donations are much appreciated. But, uh, yeah, it's fucking, it's always lit, dude. We always appreciate you with the gifted memberships, with the donos. And I feel bad because it comes to a point where it's like, I feel like we're not thanking you enough or we don't really have like anything more or different that we could say other than just thank you, dude. And what a fucking ride it's been. It has, man. It yeah, has. For the for weed, the weed fund, fund. Yeah, I need to... I want to whip out the Nectar Collector for one of these streams. I haven't taken, like, a nice solid dab from a rig in quite some time. Now. Really, bro? No, that's yeah. big. It's, I don't... I uh, I haven't been doing it of late because I get really fucking cooked when I, uh, when I do. And I notice in episodes mm-hmm. like that, I go quiet for a while because <laughs> I'll be thinking about, like, shit. So, like, that's... I, I just stick with the dab pen. Uh, I don't even yeah. like actual weed for these streams. Yeah, the dab pen's good. The dab pen is definitely good. Always, like, solid. But, Hillbilly, what do you like smoking on? If you're still here, just let us know what you like smoking on. I'll throw it up here. In a minute. That's true, Hillbilly. I've always wondered that, because you're always talking about the button. Do you be ripping dabs, too, brother? Mm. Yeah, let's see here. Um, Then we got Peyton Borden with the 30... Some Didn't money for new. Thank you, <laughs> thank you, paid him for him, bro. We're so I feel like I feel like Josh now. <laughs> I feel like Josh. Oh my yeah, God! Man. Thank you so much, paid him for him. The next time I do, the next time I do a food hack, I'm gonna give you a shout out. I'm gonna write paid him for him on ba- with bacon bits on my on my kitchen counter. Yeah, man. Thank you so much, dude. Now I can get my phone fixed and I can text Jessica again. I can abuse her. Fast can we? Can we just talk about, like, imagine if any of these guys were junkies. Like, Cobes would have, like, four videos a day. So, guys, I'm back! I'm back! I'm back! I just really, really need $120. Like, I really, really fucking need $120. Like, and if I don't, well, then it looks like videos are just going to stop forever! And it's... it's oh, that would be Tapers crazy. Tapers off into withdraw rage. Yeah. I love that shit. <laughs> It's so true, though. It's so true. Like, what if they were legitimate, like, fiends for horror drugs? No, but you need to make it happen. Yeah, we need one. Drop another Cyrex. All right, so this is something I had to bring up because, like, I was going to ask you this, uh, like, off air, but I'll just bring it up here. Because I am curious now. I've gotten so many comments over the past maybe three or four days, more than, like, in the past year of people saying, when's the new Cyrex video? Could we have a new Cyrax video? Shit's getting crazy with Cyrax. We need a new Cyrax video. Like, is it really that wild, or like, like what's going on there? I don't fucking know. I I haven't gotten any. Oh, I'm asking the yeah, I'm asking the chat because I've gotten a lot, like a lot. I guess. Like, is is it anything more than I saw the mulch? If it's the mulch, that's that's pretty fucking funny. But that's all I've really seen. Um. It's been a while since my last super chat, but there's a Frank Sinatra song that's about I'm stealing your hat. That song is fucking hilarious. That song is fucking hilarious, dude. They play that's a it song just to by Frank Sinatra. Off. It's the the Frank Sinatra song that's uh, stealing Josh. I think it's an AI song, at least I think. But yeah, it's funny as shit. <laughs> oh my god. Let's see here. And then Gil Flover, ninety to Smokey, Jeez. ten to Kiwi. <laughs> You cut me deep tonight, Gilf lover. That makes up for that one last week where the person was like, oh, "I want significantly less to go to me." It's just, yeah. Is, is he? Did he do that last week? Is this the same no, motherfucker? Maybe. No, I don't. No, 
I don't uh, think so. No, that's true. That's true. I will make sure that this all goes to me, Gilf lover. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm just joking, dude. It's not personal. Roboto-san, found this in the couch for the tip at the weed store. Thank you so much, dude. I'm giving, I, I don't tip those people. Fuck them. I spit on them. You guys are lying about that. That's middle no class, way that's true. Middle class rants. I spit on them. See what's in chat right now? That, there's no way that's true. And if that is, that's fucking... Yeah, that's lit. That's strange, yeah. Uh, found this in the in the couch yeah, for right. the tip of the weed store. Appreciate you. As always, Roboto son. Be sure to go check fuck? out his channel. Mr. Muda's Cow Hour. I am more than just some lizard kiwi. Your days are numbered tubes. <laughs> yeah, so this is the guy who beat me up and took my vest. It's not very cool or uh, funny. Uh, it's assault, and I'll be talking. Uh, you know, legal charges will be filed against Mr. Muda. Jennifer Many. pushed him to the boiling point. <laughs> that's that's creative right there. The boil. That's a good one. Yeah, Josh is a hero. <laughs> what if you're choking Jessica? <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> of course, uh, she likes notorious Nazi Jeffrey Star. We'll have to ask Nova. That's the our. our yeah, he's, that's our Rick Harrison guy. He's our, for shit. He's our expert racist. Mm -hmm. You remember how we yeah. called in Tony the pedophile to find out if Bowser yep. was a pedophile? Yep. Yeah, I do. So anytime we have a racist now, we're gonna call Nova in because Nova. If anyone knows pure, unbridled fucking hatred, it's Nova. You see those hearts? See those hearts? Me and Kiwi put those hearts there. Those were swastikas in the original picture. <laughs> Ruby Bruise Day, Duster is just Hillbilly Galaxy guess. <laughs> yeah, the, the Duster people were on the trend before the, the Galaxy Gas people got on it. You know, way ahead of their time. <laughs> yeah, and those weren't cat ears he was wearing either. Liquor cuts the grease, amen. Makes it thinner, more tasty. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey gang, uh, don't have time to talk about the sanctuary today. Grandma Rex is in the hospital. Just want to thank y'all for. Ah man, I hope she gets better soon. She will, man. Yeah, she will. Gets better soon, Rex. And I'm sorry to hear that shit, dude. Just keep your head up, keep a positive thought. And we'll keep you in, in mind. Uh, another <laughs> black dragon lost their wings. Was peachy, but had to change my name to match the socials for business. Y'all have been inspiring. Much love, Kiwi and Smokey. Much hate, Jessica. She's awful. Well, that's cool if you're doing your own, like, YouTube Hell yeah. shit. That's awesome. Hell yeah, but, man. You uh, do you. We'll always we'll always recognize you. Yeah. Don't you worry. We'll know you as the hamster with wings. Hot tubbing with the brewski. Started a new job this week. That's, that's the fucking move, dude. That's a vibe right there. That's a vibe. Hope you're enjoying that shit. David Sparks, thank you for the two gift memberships. Gift one twice. Much appreciated. <laughs> So going into goblin mode uh you can't do this to me yeah dude a green goblin mode for real josh has been fucking going crazy lately you know how the green goblin will hear shit spider-man one yeah will yeah. see shit in the mirror and stuff that's the the route josh is going Oh, I thought oh, you were talking dirty. about Nova I thought he was gonna be walking through his kitchen oh. to see a pot see a pot and then hear out the back of his head Frederick, you through, please, please, please. Frederick, you through, please. He's he just, all. Oh, he just gets that hankering to whip up a nice red onion soup. Don't dirty her clothes. She might gaslight you. Amen. Amen. Someone wrote. I gotta say, someone wrote to TX2 and said, "TX2, Smokey's not lying. Nova even was so scared that he deleted the video. That's further proof. <laughs> He's so scared of the truth." <laughs> That's so that's such good solid proof. <laughs> Dude, he's gonna he's TX2 is gonna have to say something on this. Like, this is a problem. Kiwi tapes, I gave you a shout out on Discord. I said how cool your channel is. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Oh, that's I, cool. I, yeah. I'm excited for the next couple videos. They're gonna be fun. You guys want me to do two jobs? No, dude. You fucking are doing great on yeah. Aussie Watch. Yeah. Some other goat's going to have to get on TX2 Watch. You're already killing me with Aussie Watch. In the day that Aussie dies, it's going to be your time to shine, bro. Like, oh, yeah. It's going to be your time to shine, man. So be ready. The next one up. 
yeah, gender just... relations coming in nicely, tubes. <laughs> they are, man. Isn't that crazy? Cobra always claimed that he wanted to improve gender relations, but he's actively contributed to its further downfall with his relationship with Jessica. Sea Daddy, <laughs> thank you for the 20. Every time C- he C-Daddy does, does, man. See, Daddy, bro, fail. fucking real one. Thank you for blessing us up and the chat, man. Every week, you are the fucking realist, See, Daddy. See, Daddy is the realist. He's been around for fucking months now, and we appreciate him. A lot of you have been gifted by him, and if you have, be sure to show him some love. Hell yeah. Chat. Appreciate you as always, brother. And I hope you're having a good one. Naked and laughing, Nova ass large. <laughs> Could be what it stands for. Another five from Minicone. That's 15 from you tonight, man. Yeah, Thank you. Yeah, that is 15, Minicone. We appreciate you, dude. The mic's full, full send. send it. He did. He did he full did. send the, the tweets. <laughs> it's been a good day today. Too high for stupid and passing my big girl test. Finally, FF paramedic. Oh, that's awesome. Thanks, that's awesome. Congrats man. to that you, man. Awesome. Congrats to you. That's sick. That's great news. It's most of the Cornetta. stream due to work, but I had some time to pop in. Nova's pot to be called the French Onion Scoop. I like that, too. I like that a lot. I'll, I'll try to have it uploaded to uh, the Rumble by tonight. At the very least. Nice. It's going to be, a, we're already at the four-hour mark. This is another That's crazy. Stream. Yeah. He's put more into that <laughs> sign than Kamala put into her campaign. <laughs> debate <laughs> prep combined. Yeah, we're not. We, we, that's why we didn't want to cover the debate, because... We learned our lesson with Uve about politics. <laughs> yes. Uve Those... was going off. Oh, my bro. God. Like, he was yeah. saying some crazy shit. I couldn't help but laugh. I'm sorry. My yeah, theory no. is Nova yeah. is, an, is an alternative. Yeah, he's proof the dimensional merge already happened. <laughs> yeah. I'm so, so glad I finally caught you guys live late, but here I've been binging the past streams. Keep up the great work. P.S. White Pals is a pressure. Thank you for... I'm glad you uh, enjoying it, my friend. And Bowser, you fucking know it. He, and any time he watches one of these or sees it, he's going to see messages like this and always just fucking shake his fist. Actually, probably do more than that. Probably just like, flip his fucking table. He hates that shit. Yeah, you know, probably go... If it was Nova, he'd probably go spray paint something awful on a synagogue. Yeah, he would. Yeah. That's his thing. That's his insignia. He does. That's his calling card. If you ever see any like, thing. yeah, like mm. ju- like Jewish like uh, hate, I guess. Yeah, yeah, it's Nova's. That's him. If you ever notice it, Nova's not far behind. Insane how cow for the twenty though. Thank you, insane how cow. You're a fucking another real one too. Every week's another twenty from you. <laughs> insane keep your, how keep your you. synagogue safe from Nova. Yes, you guard all your shit. Be out on watch, dude. It's not safe. Uh, Kalo Kine, thank you so much for the 10, brother. Hell yeah, bro, thank you. This is a goaded movie. Yeah, that is Colloquian. Colloquian, yeah, that's right. Colloquian. Yeah, Yeah, Scarface is goaded, dude. Thank you for the 10 gift. Mini Cone, another five. That's 20 now, man. Hell yeah, thank you. That is much appreciated, as always, Mini Cone. Mr. Based Wigs. Yeah, Mr. Based Wigs are fucking ridiculous. (laughs) Yeah, uh, he, he at least he accepted the balding. You know, that's more than can be said of others. Cooter Johnson, thank you for the membership. Much appreciated, as always. And then the five gift Cooter, thank you. Thank you, thank you. That's a sick name, dude. I named my second kid that. <laughs> Idasa, <laughs> thank you for becoming a member. I don't know what's going on in this pick, but it does not look present. No. This is very important in reference to the previous two I for stupid. The mongoose is an invasive species in Hawaii. No cobras are known to live on the islands. Of course. Just, I'm, I'm telling you, they're apex predators. They just are too yeah. vicious and successful to no, be No, you, again, you, you, you foolish Americans, despite us being American too, uh, you know, we live as one and with peace with the mongoose. And we, yeah. we go about our day and it's just... It's nothing but peace and 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 blue waters and sunny beaches, and we live that way because there's none of those treacherous snakes anywhere near our island. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. They they eat up all the snakes and the ground nesting birds. So, all the endangered stuff that poops on me when I'm trying to go on the beach and, you know, snorkel. I just know we'll never respect the great mongoose here on my island. 
Well, that's a damn shame. That's a damn shame. Hello, Kian. Thank you for becoming a member. Appreciate you, dude. Uh, y'all honestly made my week. Thank you for helping me get through this week. Thank you to Cooter. <laughs> Cooter guy for giving me a membership. <laughs> I want to see go eat a Slim Jim and see if a tooth falls out. It probably will. It probably will. But yeah, great, man. Thank, thank you for being here. I'm glad you've been enjoying this shit. And shout out to Cooter guy. Always showing love. Oh, my God. Cooter guy. <laughs> Dear Cobra and Naked and Laughing, it's over now. Are you happy? Are you fucking happy? It's the thanks I fucking get. <laughs> we sure that it's like a Wendy's faux 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 and more like an Arby's half pound with cheese and <laughs> horsey sauce? I'll tell you that much yeah. right now. That's, that's the biggest. I think I told that to you before uh, on this show here, right? That that I was never been been a big fan of Arby's. But one night driving and it's the only place open. And I said, all right, well, let's get, like, a roast beef and cheese and fries. Because, like, really the only other thing other than chicken fingers. They didn't, they didn't have fucking chicken fingers. They give me that sandwich, bro. That bag was heavy as shit. I opened yeah. it up. It sat on it. It was, like, three slash four. So that was, like, what? Like, <laughs> a half? Uh, I, I, yeah, three-fourths fucking pound. But I opened that bag. It just looked disgusting. You could barely see the bread. It was all roast beef. I just... Just put it down, put it in the bag, and threw it out at the next stop. That shit looked just fucking terrible. Wow. They tried to hook you up, and you threw it in their face. I did. You, cause you, I, you're you're going to talk shit that. on mongooses. You don't want that. That was a mess. It wasn't even edible. What a what a waste. That I'm was it a to f- a homeless. JN, thank you for the $2. We know that... Uh, yeah, we'll put this towards, I guess, the Arby's hate fund. I actually, I actually put Arby's. it in a trash can so far away from like, just to make sure no homeless people got it. But thank you again, JN. Yeah, we're trying to make Chili's great again. That's <laughs> yeah. all that matters. It is. It is. Daleks will always win against the Caucasian Koopa. Yeah, dude. Everyone's always on the winning <laughs> side when you're going against it's the always Caucasian Koopa. <laughs> It's always a good feeling when you can tune into the live and watch you two gents, knowing it's going to be a great time. It's always a great time, Colloquia. It is always a great time. And we're I glad have, you're here now, brother. I have a lot of fun hanging out here with you guys and Smoke. It's a blast. Y'all are fucking amazing. The comedy coming from this podcast is astounding. The community is great. It's just really just like a where we're just shitting around. <laughs> yeah, man. And uh, we enjoy, like I said, we enjoy chilling here and we love it that you guys enjoy being here, man. It never, mm-hmm. it, ne- it never gets lost on us, bro. It's like, this is fucking awesome to do every week, and we are just thankful as hell for you guys for always being here. For real. Uh, there's so many amazing goats showing up all the time. JN, I poo sometimes. Well, that's good. That's good. And he did. <laughs> oh, so the shirt David was saying it was just a pedo. So remember when he said somebody off themselves oh. at the hospital? Oh, well, that's not a, yeah. That's <laughs> If it was just a pedo, I mean... Seems like you might have, like, a oh, job thing there, considering that you were just in a waiting room. We was, you say yeah. we locked down for... Uh, maybe. Waiting room, not... I don't know, probably just an appointment. Nonetheless, I'm glad you're okay. He knew what Bubba would do to him in the clink. <laughs> Cobra is almost a freak on a leash with his collar. Not a bad... Not a bad yes. uh, description of him, though. The fucking... Uh, the corn version... The next one, Nikocado reviews Sundown Towns. Nikocado, that whole situation's wild wow. with him losing all that weight. It is. It is. I two steps ahead. He fooled us all. He did. Went. He went and like disappeared for a while, and it seemed like even that wasn't enough time. It had to have been years, years. There's no way. I don't see how he could have done it in just a couple months. Yeah, no, nah, Todd. Kiwi gives Kiwi. you low-cal mafia vibes. What does that mean? I don't know. Kind of like you're picking them off, bro, one by one. You need scared. to figure out the business here. No Rico cases around here. You all go down with me. You're all you're all impl- you're all implicated in this. Crash Bandicoot warped. It was, Crash Bandicoot was this? warped. That's the third patch Crash Bandicoot game. Oh, Went nice. to. Would mean to check out Aussie, R.A. Aussie Radio. I like them the morning radio has for the community. Hell yeah, man. Stingy be doing his show every morning. Go check out. Well, not every morning, but most mornings Stingy be doing the yeah. R.A. Aussie Radio show. You guys got to check that shit out, man. 
where you're located globally too that probably works out pretty well you yeah, can do like a yeah, morning you know show at night for people management told me to donate to you both instead of eating strawberry salad and boiled chick what <laughs> <laughs> and now i've not played that yet i i've heard a lot about it though i have it's it's good i haven't played any pvp yet sadly but i have gotten a chance to play a good chunk of the story and i'm pretty impressed sup gangsters sup plankton this is the greatest plankton picture ever that is a cool plankton <laughs> Another five from Insane Calhow. That's 25 tonight. Thank you, Calhow. Thank you. And then you had this to say for 20. Which locale had the best slash worst 2024 of, of time? Daniel. Daniel had the worst. I'd say Chris had the best. Chris saw a resurgence in popularity and relevance as well as being released. And uh, Daniel got sent to jail and had like the worst year of his life. So that, that's how I see it is best Chris Chan, worst Daniel Larson. Kitty Cat Gaming, thank you for the five gift. Appreciate you. I appreciate all the gifters for real. It's what keeps the community so tight. Whenever somebody gifts like an extra special thank you to you. Kiwi, I expect all the Davids to receive invites to the wedding at Kiwi Core forever. Yeah. Yeah, fucking right, dude. It, it would be, um, I would invite you all, but if you've ever seen Game of Thrones, I would want it to turn out like the Red Wedding, where we all just, you know, pop up with like crossbows and shit, and uh, fucking, it's it's a total plot twist moment. Nova comes in, he thinks he's marrying the love of his life, me, and we all just pop out with fucking crossbows and daggers and shit. Take out the opposition. By the way, I have my own music on my channel. Feel free to use it. It's not the best, but it's free. Thank you, Mikey the Mud. I always have a special appreciation to people who put music on their channels and let us use it as well. That's greatly appreciated. We'll have to listen to it sometime. Sipping on iced tea. Yo, you guys, I got my first tattoo today. Keep doing what you're doing. You be careful sipping on iced tea. I got my first tattoo, and I ended up uh, keeping, like, I keep acquiring them, so... It can kind of get like a little bit addicting where you're like, oh, you know, I just want to fill up this and fill up that. And it's a lot of fucking fun, dude. It's a lot of fucking fun. That is that is exciting. Eddie Money for a few. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to take some nangs next week. <laughs> Nova 100% wants to catch. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. No, dude. I, I don't like this. <laughs> John Stinson. Thank you, brother. Thank you, John Stinson, becoming a member. No, no. Oh, man, yeah, it's about to Not weird. allowed. <laughs> oh, this, one's, you... this one's for me, Jesus. Yeah, Jesus they're all getting you. weird. Yeah, they love you tonight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how do you like it, huh, Smokey? How do you like it with fucking people? Not like... as much as Nova yeah. does, bro. Not as... <laughs> hey, guys, awesome stream. Love the content. Always bring me a smile when I pop in and watch new episodes. I'm, okay, I'm glad, bro. I love hearing that. That is good shit. shit. Mini Cone with the five. Third stream I've caught live, and it's a good one. Thank you all have a good rest of your night. Thank you, man. You've a, That's you have awesome. a great rest of your night, too, brother. That's awesome. What's up, boys? What's up, Hulk Rogan? Been traveling Hulk Rogan, today, the realist. But I'm able to stop uh, before I sleep. Have a good night, guys. If you're going to use any gas station showers, look out. Uh, especially if you're um, very handsome wear a bowler hat i would i would look <laughs> out if i was you sorry i'm late i was being gay <laughs> <laughs> the ultimate excuse nova if chris had no creativity in 4k <laughs> <laughs> he is that's that's a perfect way to describe him Clipperino, Clipperino. Thank, you. thank you for becoming a member jake shield jade shields thank you for becoming a member Sadie, thank you earlier. I appreciate you uh, for all your messages earlier as well. Facts, Sadie. Josh. Thank you for died by died GF, by yeah. Grum, yeah. Poor bastard kid had his whole life in front of us. Yeah, I, I want to. I haven't checked out that video yet by Nick Crowley. I want to. Um, I thought about like doing a stream over it because it's interesting. It's really interesting. I, I don't know. Have you heard of this, Smokey? <laughs> This no, guy. I have not. Yeah, it's worth a look. It's very creepy. Finally caught your stream. Good job, guys. Thank you. That means Thank a lot. Thank you, man. 
Shucks, David Chuck, welcome to the fold. Shucks, David Chuck, thank you, brother. And then, holy shit, Hulk Rogan Jesus. right now drops 10 just to end it, man. Hulk, Ro- Hulk Rogan's another one of the realists. Mm-hmm. And all you guys tonight, man, are some real motherfuckers for sticking it out here. Four hours of too high for stupid, but what a fun four hours it was, man. It's been uh, it's been another good one, and I'm, I'm glad to have That's been good. here tonight with all y'all. Yeah, I had a great time, man, from talking about Bo I Dot to Jupiter to Cobra's failing relationship <laughs> with Jessica. To TX2. Yeah, to TX2. With that tweet that I'll probably have yeah. to delete because it's just probably not smart to keep up. Uh, that was but, my but, favorite part of the show. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, I, I definitely was... agree with you there, you know. TX2. <laughs> yeah, you know, I was going to go ahead and probably delete that one right now. Oh, but, uh, but thank you guys for coming tonight. For another edition of Too High, and we will be right back here next Wednesday at 6.30 p.m. Eastern Time. And man, is it going to be a good one. So I can't wait to see y'all then. But until we do see y'all, stay safe and have a great rest of your week, everybody.